Good morning, jewellery makers. Genuinely, genuinely, today might be, you know, before you start something and you've just got that anticipation, bubbling anticipation. Genuinely, I think today is going to be one of your favourite shows ever. You have got such a Thursday in store for you. Oh my goodness me. Two auctions in particular completely take my breath away. One of which is with your fabulous guest designer, the beautiful Yvonne. Hello, good morning. Oh, morning, Elle. Morning, my darling. It's, a, it's beautiful, it's isn't special. it? Everything here on the desk today is just gorgeous. So, 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 so special. special. It is, it really is. I, I mean, last night, Yvonne, um, you know this, I always prep the night before, yes. it stays in my brain then. Um, I didn't. I didn't want to move on from your pearls. No, they are. I mean, you've said before that I get spoiled with my kits, but I mean, this is just the ultimate, isn't it? I think. I think it is. It is. This really is the is. cherry on the on the yeah. proverbial cake. I mean, that takes metallic to the nth degree, doesn't it? And size as I well. Know. I mean, they're absolutely In enormous. Absolutely incredible. They are come in the most beautiful packaging as well. And, and I'd like to think, Yvonne, that we're, I mean, I always say it's our greatest strength here at Jewellery Maker, yeah. but I'd like to think we know a thing or two about pearls. Absolutely. As does our audience, obviously. Yeah. Um, but last night, I was like, you know what? We've, I've got countless presentations on pearls. Uh-huh. But I was like, you know what? I'm going to really focus on the thing, the main traits about your pearls um, in terms of research, which is most definitely size. Yep the colour but the numero uno is that metallic beauty it is it's incredible and I and, and I in my research it I mean I, we kind of already knew this um, and I know we are probably going to sort of repeat some things that we already know but it really 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 highlighted to me and obviously I'll share all the information that I found just how rare metallic pearls yeah. are. Yeah, I mean, we play that clip, don't we, of Dave yeah. with the lady at yeah. the gem uh, fair, and um, she always emphasises metallic. the metallic, metallic every single time. Maybe one in like 10 years exactly. or something like that. Exactly, yes. They have to literally scour through thousands mm. of yeah. pearls in a harvest you, to find one. And you, you can't really replicate that, can no. you? Well, not in my maid. <clears throat> no, you definitely can't. No. Um, and the value of them. So I'm so excited to be offering you the opportunity to purchase, purchase these pearls. And I will tell you, jewelry maker, the price is insane. In comparison to what you, you should expect mm -hmm. outside of these four walls, the price is incredible. Exciting. Absolutely incredible. So, Jen, if you are a pearl lover, and listen, I've said this before, my own admission, I have lots of jewellery maker pearls. Uh -huh. Lots. Do you think I'll regret any of those purchases? Absolutely not. You know, they are savvy purchases. Let's just put it that way. I have I to think be, you might I, be getting an extra one 100%, today. hundred percent, hundred percent. I have to be more careful using the I word. You know, I can't say that if you buy this, it's going to be... No. You know, no, it's no, going to no. make X, Y, Z nope. in the future. Because I don't know. However, however... I don't think I'm going to regret because pearls are that constant, aren't they? Now more so than ever. Anyway, I'm, I'm kind of jumping ahead massively, but it, as you can tell, I'm just so excited about these pearls. We have 60. Oh, is that how many? I, did, I wasn't aware of how many we had. 60 available. And if we'd... Well, I know we have advertised it, but I will not be surprised if we don't have London Jewellers shop with us today. really yeah yes. i would not be surprised i know that we've had conversations with the oco of london before um i would not be surprised if they don't get involved on this auction opportunity i don't know yoko but you know definitely we just definitely. surpass ourselves every time we don't really we? do so it's really special but there's 60 that's not a massive no, quantity no, no, it's not. it is when we consider what they are but for for our numbers that's not huge and nearly i'm so confident they will all sell out a hundred percent hundred percent please though if you are and, and i think you already know this if you reckon if you're excited like i am about the yvonne's pearls please at some point at some point and i get it costs money get them valued please yeah. do but not just for, for our own ego purposes 
but have them valued for your insurance purposes yes. because they are irreplaceable at the price that we are bringing them. Don't think that's the, the you know the value of them, the number that we bring to screen. They're worth so much more. Anyway, so that is happening, jewelry makers, at nine o'clock. It's honestly, it's a deal of the day at nine. Yeah, at it, nine o'clock. You know, we don't think we normally <clears throat> bring that type of thing. Nine no. o'clock. So we? if you've got anything to do, yeah. do it now. Put the and kettle then, on. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and then be back with us for nine o'clock. Then at ten o'clock, talk about rarity. I mean, how far jewelry maker has come, and they're almost yeah. fourteen years. If, when you look back at the old yeah. shows. I mean, it's just which miles great, away. Which are great, you know, yeah, and we still are. bring you yeah. those fun gems. And we all enjoyed them of absolutely, the day. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. And we'll still bring you the affordable strands. We'll still we bring you yeah. all of those components as well. But these two auctions that I'm getting a little bit excited about, <laughs> well, not a little bit, a lot. Um, the second is the Black Series. Type A Burmese Jadeite, which we know is closed. Yeah. Closed in 2020. Black jadeite takes three times longer than any other color to form. And we're not just talking like, oh, maybe just go another couple of years, millions of years longer to form. And this is literally transitioned through all of the colors. Yeah. So it's been your imperial whites. It's been your sort of soft, as I described, like apple blossom green. It's been the other colors. It's been um, imperial and transitioned through that. Incredibly, incredibly rare. So we have a huge opportunity on that at the most amazing price. Also yesterday, I told you a little bit of a story and actually when I came off air, I was like, should I have told that story? Should I not have told that story? But I was like, you know what, we're Too all late friends. Too late now. Yeah, well, we're all friends. So, and I think in the world of gemstones, that's, that's one of the joys of jewelry makers that yeah. we share that yeah, information with each other. Anyway, I told you about literally an acquisition that I made maybe four weeks ago. Um, I haven't done anything with it yet. Tom, funny enough, my husband was like, when are you actually gonna go and get that get get that certified? I was like, well, I've been waiting because Wayne's been on holiday and Wayne will be the person, or Dave, Dave's been on holiday. They're the people yeah. who actually get me in contact with them. Anyway, so I was sco scrolling as you do sometimes aimlessly through Marketplace on Facebook yeah. um, and something caught my attention and I was like, oh, okay, that's not something you normally see on Facebook. <laughs> and it was a heart, I showed you the photo yesterday, didn't I, Neary? It was a heart pendant, matching earrings, and it had, it was 14 karat gold. Wow. Chinese inscription in the center, which I asked Susie means um, luck. Um, inscription on the center, on a gold chain, and it was priced at 220 pounds, but it wasn't the gold that, that excited me. It was the beautiful lavender gemstone that surrounded it, and same on the earrings. Um, anyway, read the details and he's an antique dealer yeah. and he said it's a jadeite 14 karat gold necklace. So I reach out and say, is it natural? Is it type A grade? He says, I'll be honest, I don't Doesn't know. know. No. I don't know. So, okay, fair enough, fair enough. In my head, I'm going, 220 pounds is a great price for the gold mm. alone. I'm going to buy it because it's so pretty, so, so pretty. So I bought it. And at some point I will get it tested. That will cost me a few hundred pounds to actually is do. Is that how much it is? Yeah, it will cost me quite a bit. But, and who knows, if it's type A grade, I've got a great deal. Yeah, absolutely. An absolutely fantastic deal. If it's type B or type C, I've still got the gold weight. So it's, yeah. you know. Plus you like it anyway. I love it, exactly. Yeah. You wouldn't have bought it if you didn't like it, no. would you? But the reason why I'm harping on about this, the reason why I'm telling you the story that went on behind the scenes, and you might not even be interested, is because lavender jade eye is the rarest color of all. And many people like the likes of Roland Schlussel, who's, who's a jade guru across the world, um, believes that lavender jade eye will command a higher price point than imperial jade eye in the future. Well, jewelry makers, we have in our vault, I think maybe, two or three strands of natural you don't have to get yours gem lab certified that we have done it for you natural type a lavender jade eye and it's a long strand it's a long strand look at that we are looking at one of the wow, rarest colors how many of those do we have okay 32 and can I tell you that that's a 55 centimetre strand of the rarest colour of all. How, gemologically Gosh, how it forms, it's the rarest colour. enormous. 
So it's uh, so you know what? Scrap what I said earlier on because I'll be honest, I totally forgot. <laughs> You've got three massive auctions today. First one being the pearls. Then we've got your black series. Then we have your final selections of lavender jadeite, wow. including a carving, What a by show the way. today. Eh? It's going to be unbelievable. That's why I'm kind of bubbling with excitement. Yeah, you came in ever so excited. <laughs> <this laughs> Literally, morning. I was up, 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 with the, up with the bird, early bird this morning. Like, super excited. Yeah, absolutely. Right then, shall we get cracking, jewellery makers? Oh, let me just reach over that trolley. There we go. Okay. Um, starting off with... And do get your text messages in at Jewelry Makers. We would love, 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 oh, love, yes. love to Let's hear from you. Let's hear from you today. Did you say what? 52, 51? Oh, is that not what you said? Okay, sorry. Misheard you. Here we go. Oh, they are. They're, this is the right one. Faceted bars. Um, totally natural chocolate mousse. They are lovely. We don't see it very often now. No, I love that they? shape too. Very elegant. Do you know where where they are drilled? You could set those in a bezel, couldn't you? you I could. would have thought. Yeah, you don't. You'll prong set them. You don't have yes, to use you them could. stranding. Yeah. Loads of you getting involved. Oh, that's a nice way to start the show. When was the last time we had chocolate moonstone? Which I'll be honest is my favourite of all the moonstones. Yeah. Um, because it just highlights, a bit like a black opal, highlights that natural phenomena effect. It goes well with the peach moonstone <coughs> as well. Pretty, yeah. so pretty. How many do we have of these, Neary New? Five left, I'll leave them with you because we're super over allocated. Well done, everyone. Shall we do some more chocolate moonstone? Oh, these are lovely cut. Oh, the pendants. see those twinkling from here. Yeah. Crying out to be a beautiful pendant, aren't yeah. they? Oh, look at that. There we go. Pendant and earrings, yeah. That's called adrolescence, a beautiful natural phenomena effect that occurs internally within the gemstone straight away down to 9.99. Gosh, I remember when we used to be able to do chocolate moonstone showcases. I haven't done one of them in a long time. No, we have not. Oh, we're crashing. Oh. I had a conversation. I, f I fell in love a little bit with a with with an Indian chap when I was over in uh, in Tucson. Don't worry. He was um, in his late 80s, so my husband, <laughs> husband hasn't got anything Is to worry about. about. <laughs> yeah, um, just because he, he, he was talking, he only sold Moonstone, oh. and his absolute love and passion for this gemstone was just, yeah, it was, it, it, he was like only gold, he only set it in gold. Probably his lifetime's work then, yeah. was it? Yeah, and you just listen to every single word, it's like, he just adores this gemstone. Yeah. And here we are bringing it to you for £4.99. Um, Paula in London, Linda, Lanarkshire, sorry, Ella, Maker, London, Anna, Hilary. Morning, everybody. Do get your messages in. Come and say hello to Yvonne and I and the lovely crew that we have here. You are a lovely crew, you know that? You're all good, aren't you? You're good eggs. You're all good <laughs> eggs. Um, make sure you're checking out your baskets. How many have we got, Neary? 12 available, but they're flying. There's a bit of a queue on the phone lines. Oh, everyone's chomping at the bit. That's the thing. Oh, everyone's, everyone's just really up keen. Early today. Uh, really keen to get involved. Well done. Well done. I'm going to move on. Bring you as many early bird deals as I possibly can. I haven't spoken about the early bird this morning. Here we go. This is your early bird this morning. All sterling silver. Separate auctions. Sorry, Michael. So you've got different links there as well that you can um, literally just attach clasps. Yeah, to make a all sterling it, silver bracelet. That's all it needs. Or customise them for earrings or something like that. Yeah. That would be quite yeah, nice. Yeah, lots of chains. Yeah, so do yeah. shop ahead on those. It's going to be an absolute cracking deal. Right, bit of snowflake obsidian. Ooh, it's a long strand. Fighting back. I know. <laughs> Love a bit of snowflake obsidian. Yes, I know. love snowflake obsidian. Little snow was one of the first things I bought from Jewelry Maker. Oh, is it? Yeah. And it's totally natural. Really nice cabs they were in uh, Snowflake it's Obsidian. It's a very cool gemstone. So you've got that wonderful depth of colour and then literally like snowflake patterns on the surface. Um, comes from um, basically, uh, it's a volcanic glass. Also, by the way, for you Game of Throners, this is uh, dragon glass, what they refer to in Game of Thrones. Uh, £6.49, that's a nice early bird deal. Well done. You get loads on there as well. 49 wow. I know, some amazing deals. Yeah. Um, did you say golden topaz? You mean imperial then? 
Um, Imperial Topaz, the rarest of all. Na and it's Brazilian, goodness me. Right, either somebody has made a huge error labeling that. It's not, this is, this is Imperial Topaz. Imperial Topaz, um, you remember Matt Bennett, don't you? Yeah. Matt Bennett went to the Ouro Preto mine in Brazil, where this most likely has come from, and saw less than a carrot unearthed in a given day of mining. That's how rare it is. And we just casually go, oh, let's call it golden <laughs> and do it for £7.99. Um, incredibly rare. It's also one of the most uh, limited edition collections we've ever done across the Gemporia partnership because we, we rarely ever get it. How many do we have? Oh, 24, that's a good number mm. for Imperial Topaz. If anybody has got the Gems and Crystals book from the Smithsonian Museum, if you flick to Topaz, what's the picture that they've got on the first page? It's not sky blue, it's not London blue, it's not colourless, it's Imperial, and, and they do say in black and white, yeah, it's not £5.99's worth of gemstone, <laughs> it's very rare. Uh, Bristol snapped up too, Paula and Linda, Linda in Staffordshire, hello to you, Jane in Nottinghamshire, Cheryl in Yorkshire, Cathy in Yorkshire, Tracy in Lincolnshire, hello to Maker and Candy in London, morning everybody, loads of multi-buyers, lapping up the Imperial Topaz, how amazing is that? They make lovely earrings, because they're dangling, because you could see through them then. And you'll get the flashes yes. of gold Beautiful. through. Yeah. Amazing. Super, super, super rare. I mean, this, like I said, this is not a gemstone. If you watch Gem Collector, our sister channel, uh, you, you don't see it for five ninety nine. This is a very rare gemstone, especially of these sizes. Five ninety nine. It's a joke. <laughs> it is it? a joke. You're right. That's it. It is a joke. We we need to have a little word with ourselves because that's ridiculous for the rarity of the gemstone. Um, amazing. Well done. It's going to sell out. We only had. What, just over 20 available. Um, if you want to shop ahead on any of our goodies, go to all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. If you click watch live and then scroll down and you'll see all the goodies. There's your early birds, items one, two, and three. They will be going lower. Um, oh, I like number three, uh, number five, sorry. Items selling out already. Some beautiful goodies in there. Oh, more pearls sold out. Gosh, lots of temptation there, isn't there? Oh, another sold out. Oh, it's going to be a busy day today. I can just feel it. Abalone. When was the last time we had abalone? Uh, amazing. Oh, Ethiopian opal rough cut. That's cool, isn't it? Mm, I love those. High luster metallic purple fibre. Oh, that's lovely. Then you've got another, there's one of the lavender aqua jadeite carvings. Oh my goodness. So yes, do shop ahead. If we crash it, crash it further, everybody pays that final low, regardless of when you make your confirmation. So by shopping ahead, you're guaranteeing your place. Nothing is debited from your account until the end of the day. Um, and it's one postage and packaging all day. So if you don't like the price that it goes to, you can always change your mind. Um, not that I think you will. Um, well done, well done, well done. What did you say? Angelite, oh there, um, that's why, is it the big ones, right okay, four mil, uh, I don't see them, Michael I can't see them, number 48, oh there, Michael's looking at me like that. Oh, for goodness sake. You mean the ones in 48? The ones that were in 48, yeah. There are a lot of them as well. <laughs> <laughs> my bad, my bad. We got there in the end. Here we go. Uh, did you say angelite? Green angelite, beautiful. Amazing. Certainly one of our most popular gemstones now, angelite. We only ever used to have blue, didn't only. we? And I'll be honest, I like the blue. I like the blue. But I love the green. Yeah. Does the green have the same waxy type look? That yes, the blue it has, has like a yeah. like feathering, like the peacock yeah, yeah, angel. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, it's so beautiful. I like the blue. I do like the yeah. blue. But I love the peacock and I love the green angel like yeah. because of those patterns. That is so pretty with all the different uh, tones of green in there. Stunning, mm. absolutely stunning. Eleven ninety nine. They would go amazing with uh, that's the one I picked up 
Yeah, these would go beautifully together because it's also, as you can see, Incredible. and you can see the patterning that Yvonne's referencing there. Um, these are coming up as well, but absolute last of stock opportunities. I know it's so difficult to get hold of. I'll leave the four mils with you and I'll dive into the 12. Are they 12 mil? Gosh, they're colossal. I'd use these with some nice white pearls, I think. Mm. Lovely with white pearls. Very yeah. summery. And again, you get these lovely, like, cloudy-like formations that naturally occur. Angelite, do you know when it was discovered? 1987. Oh, really so young? It, yeah, it's a very young mm. gemstone. Discovered in Peru. Originally, it was the blue that was discovered. Yeah. But yes, you can, on rare occasions, actually uh, um, discover it in the greens and also these peacock colours. But incredibly popular. Um, morning to you. Is that? I can't. Moira. Hi, Moira. Uh, good morning. Have to rush out to work. Can I please see number 34? Thank you. Yes, you can. Oh, um, what we'll a shame, now, Moira. Moira. <laughs> oh, Moira, I'm sorry. <laughs> Take us with you if you can. If you can. <laughs> Here we go, Moira. These would be lovely with those green angel lights. Absolutely. Um, hang on a minute. That's. Have we put the right graphics on the right price for this carving? What's the split pay? No. What on earth? So this is uh, Guan Yin. You can see beautiful figure there. That's such an authentic carving. I love isn't it. it. I do too. You've got those the beautiful terrain in the background. Yeah. You can see the waterfall in the background. It's like blue, the willow pattern. Yeah, stunning. And then the figure walking across the bridge, the yeah, water lovely. that flows underneath the bridge, all carved by hand. You've got, um, I always forget, you've got that beautiful building in the background where you've got those lovely kind of fluted roofs. Like Sorry. Pagoda. That's, pagoda. Is, it, is it like a pagoda? Um, hiya, Julie. Hi, Elle. Um, from Disney, I got my angel eye. Amazing, <laughs> Julie. <laughs> Oh, are you wearing your Mickey Mouse ears, Julie? Yeah. Oh, have the best time. Have the best oh, time. Such that'll a happy be waiting place to when be. you get back. Okay. Now, Moira, I can see you there with it in your basket. I can also see Kerry and I can see other collectors. How many do we have? Ten chances. Should we do, should we do a lowest ever price point for you? Moira, as you requested it, as you've got a dash out, we're going to take this even lower. It's already ridiculous at £65, don't you think? It's carved by hand. Beautiful Guan Yin. As, um, as Yvonne was saying, it's a very authentic carving. It is, yes. If you think about sort of beautiful Chinese art, you know, on the silks or maybe um, their pottery, you quite often yeah, see Yeah, it makes scenes. me think of the pottery, the, yeah. the blue willow pattern. Yeah, I agree. Um, Neary's just said that wow. is quite possibly one of the most affordable jadeite carvings we've ever done. Um, <laughs> he Just also think how says, long it takes to do that. exactly, literally done by hand and wet bamboo. Um, he also says, pray for me that Wayne doesn't see it. He'll be here any minute. Ah, uh, oh, he's back from holidays. He is he? back from his holidays. Mm. Yes, he is. Moira, well done, lovely. You've got to. Um, hello to you, Rupal. Hello to you, Marie. Uh, hello to you, uh, Olienka. What a lovely name, yeah. Paula and Kerry. You're there as well. I only had ten. We've got to do a clock to close because Wayne will be back in a minute. He's going to, and he pops his head in the gallery every time he steps into the building. <laughs> Does he? Yeah. <laughs> He, but, no, he does it to Ross as well. Kind of slopes in. He doesn't trust Ross or, or Tom. No, slopes in, sneaks in behind them, sees what they're up to. Um, you're welcome, Moira. Um, this is the lowest ever price tag. Again, all that lovely detail. Think about it. You're holding a piece of Taipei yeah. Burmese jadeite rough, one of the world's rarest gemstones. And then literally, you want this is this is the vision. You want to you want to create the beautiful detail of the mountains in the background. That every branch, every leaf, the the flow of the river. Look at the shine on it too. Yeah, like a melting ice yeah, cube. Yeah, look at that. Lowest ever price. We've got to we've got to sell out of them because we've taken it to a ridiculously low price. And we're doing <laughs> it before Wayne steps into the building. Mind you, he can't say anything after his manager special deals. He's done some pretty shocking jade eye deals recently in the best possible way. Well done, everybody. Congratulations. Um, 45, 45, 45, 45, 45, 45. Oh, I got it. I love this strand. <gasps> you could skip with that. <laughs> you could. <laughs> That's a meter of your birthstones. Oh, so let's go from that. end to end, actually, shall we? You have January for your garnet, 
February for your amethyst. March for your aquamarine. Look at the quality of these. Instead of putting diamonds in there, because that would bump the price tag ever so slightly, you have clear, the finest clear quartz um, for April. May, you have your emeralds, natural emeralds. Where April, May, June, you have your moonstone. July, you have your ruby. August, you have your peridot. September, you have sapphire. October, you have tourmaline. November, you have your citrine. Oh, look at those. That's a good citrine. Yeah, lovely citrine. And finally, December, you guessed it, it's tanzanite. Wow. A metre long length. I launched this, Neary. I remember very vividly launching this. And it went to a crazy low price tag. I mean, you don't have to use them for birthstones. At the end of the day, you're getting 12 amazing gemstones um, by a full metre. What did it go to? 19.99. Wow. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Um, oh, I haven't seen this gemstone in ages. I know your shift side did it recently. I was green with envy. I was so envious of your abalone showcase. Um, love abalone. Incredibly, incredibly rare. Look at do you that. know that? Do you know the patterns in an abalone shell is where they've changed their diet? Is it really? Just where they've eaten something a bit different. Mm -hmm. So you get these beautiful, beautiful patterns. The story of the abalone shell, or power shell as it's often referred to as well. Um, as you can see, this is crying out to be like a Moana inspired, inspired, inspired sorry, pendant, don't you yeah, think? Yeah, definitely. Um, we're at 99 pounds and 99 pence. It is, let me just double check before I say it. For the last few chances, you're going to take it to the lowest ever price. Are you? How amazing is that? Now, you could wire wrap this if you wanted to. You could very carefully drill it. You could, yes. If you wanted to put a peg in, the, uh, a peg bale in the top. Lowest ever price for the final few chances. Wow, that's unbelievable. For abalone, at $49.99, and you've got your split payment. But just to give you an idea of scale, it's huge. It is huge. Perfect holiday jewellery oh, isn't that, it exactly yeah. what I was just thinking had I have known that we had these I've got one of these to wear to make some jewellery for holiday with yeah oh yes because you're going soon going soon this is definitely something you can imagine wearing with your floaty dresses and your yeah, sandals definitely um, how did you say sorry six available Adri's there on the phone lines in Manchester waiting to be answered our call centre will get to you I promise it's busy already this morning um yeah I was on hold yesterday but they do they are an amazing team and they will get to you as soon as they possibly possibly can down to the final four um oh oh nearly oh a strand of abalone no way 79.99 again they're the kind of 3d abalones let me take it to 49.99 let me count two four six eight ten twelve abalone shells i'm not sure i am what that's ridiculous look at all the different low. colors in there we used to give you abalone slices for more than mm, that we did you know like literally yeah. a little section of them which yeah. were beautiful with the back, uh, yeah where they, yeah. where they were like a doublet yes they were yeah so they had exactly like a resin that. back yeah. we used to do do those for more than 29.99 here we are bringing an abalone by the way much like pearls anything that's harvested yeah. has gone up and in the price. whole shell the whole thing yeah. as well not a shell is it no they, they, they've skyrocketed because you think covid has had a knock-on effect yeah to everything um, with everything not only that environmental yeah. issues so the price of abalone and the accessibility of abalone is is so difficult massive massive price reduction that jewelry makers for abalone 29.99 how many we got nearly new eight available paula well done to you hartfordshire's there london's there 30 seconds we've got to move on make sure i, I might have to get some of these I'm shopping. I feel a shopping day coming on. I've, I already know that I'm going to be getting involved with the Vons Pearls in the next hour. <laughs> so there's my basket open already. I might as well add a few extra bits to it. Did you like my train of thought? You know, why not? It's like, oh, I'm just popping into the shop to get bread. Oh, well, basket's already open, so I might as well do a complete <laughs> shop. That's my logic. Tracy Paula, Brenda Marishka and Hertfordshire. When was the last time that you saw abalone? I haven't seen it in ages absolutely ages beautiful well done well done well done um okay 
30. Ah, oh, I mentioned yesterday that we've been watching in our house Opal Hunters. Yeah. I love it. And my husband loves it. Does he really? Yeah, loves it. And he's not normally a gemstone person, but... It's exciting though, isn't it? It is. And they don't describe it as play of colour. They're like, oh, you know, they might... You know, we're looking and we were thinking, oh my goodness, we've got baking heat and whatnot. And then we were just digging away, thinking we weren't going to be successful for Opal. And then we're just surrounded by colour. And this is what they're referring to, those beautiful flashes of play I of colour. I can see those flashes from here. Even in the studio. Yeah, yeah. Look at that. Do you know, if you've got your own little gemstone museum, this needs to be pride of place in it as well. Um, Wayne has this in his pocket. He carries one around, does he? <gasps> the other side look at that play of color it's so cool oh my goodness me 15 carats that. of your ethiopian opal rough and red and red there, yeah rarest color to get that's the, that's actually the back because you're getting all that play of color front and reverse how amazing is this it's one of the nicest i've seen actually i love the fact it's non-faceted as well Straight away, we've got collectors getting involved. Love the organic nature of this gemstone. It's literally, you can almost imagine yourself literally peeling it from the ground itself. Mm. I adore Ethiopian opal. I think Ethiopian opal, because of its translucency, gives you more displays, more flashes um, of play of color um, than Australian opal. That's just my humble opinion. I love Australian opal too, don't get me wrong, but there's more translucency to an Ethiopian opal. And if I look, we've got stupid, horrible floodlights above us, so it doesn't benefit this gemstone but yet you're still seeing that performance that play of color um i'm gonna leave that one with you jewelry makers congratulations oh going back to the abalone you found another one. Oh, gorgeous just literally pop it onto a chain and away you go on sterling silver oh, just already, like that it already comes with the bail as well does it yeah and we've got chains coming up as yeah. your early bird. Oh, look, that's beautiful. Oh, that is nice. Absolutely beautiful. How is that £20? That's really pretty, isn't it? Can you imagine this on like a coastal, in a coastal um, jewellers or something oh, like that? Word, Can you imagine the price it would be? an arm and a leg. It wouldn't be a 20 quid. No, it would not. You'd be, you'd be lucky to get it for 100, I think. How many have you got of these? I am thinking for myself. Ten chances. It is the sort of thing you would buy on holiday, though, yeah. when you're in that relaxed mood and you see something in a shop window. Catch that's your pretty. attention. Yeah. And likewise, um, I think you could turn this into earrings, too. Maybe that's what you're doing, Moira. Yeah. They'd be beautiful, beautiful earrings. Conway's there as well. Well done. Uh, morning to you, Samantha. Morning, lovely ladies. Neary Nunu and crew. I have this rough opal and the abalone. Stunning. Or, Samantha, have you got, like, a little Ooh. museum set up? That's amazing. I have a little shelf in my studio that I put all precious little things, oh, like like a, just, an opal rough. Yeah, be, where that would sit pride in place. Yeah. Yeah, amazing. And an abalone. Well done, everybody. Congratulations. Do keep an eye, jewellery makers, on the website. Again, do shop ahead. There's lots of goodies on there. Lots of items are selling out already. Um, oh, what number? Yeah, I had my eye on this. Where's it gone? Where's it gone? Where's it gone? Where's it gone? yeah i looked at this earlier on this morning now those of you that know me know that i've bought this twice in I, the different colors i didn't know we had it in the quartzite jade i love this design oh, have it's you not got that one not got this one and literally just wear it sort of as a uh, as an easy wear bracelet coming up how many do we have 30 available opportunities um it has to be a star buy Ah, oh, this is gorgeous. Um, okay, so no. We could use that. Yeah, let's go with that. Let's go with that. All right, so um we've done this design and it's a finished piece of jewellery. We first launched it, I believe, with the green jadeite, sold out. Then we brought it to you in the lavender jadeite, sold out. Then we brought it to you in the Olmec Jadeite, sold out. I did not know we had it in the um, 
in have you not I in all the quartz site jade I do you know, Neary, these go to such an amazing price. And I know lots of our jewellery maker audience can make it, but at the price that we take it to, I'm just going to tell you, it's not worth it. It's not nope. worth making it. Um, if you want to deconstruct it, you absolutely can. I've bought so many of these for gifts because they're very giftable. They're this amazing shape, though, I mean, just take a, take a moment to appreciate. You've got the haigu carving, so you'd have to buy that first. Then you'd have to buy these gorgeous six mils, of which there's two, four, six. Um, in a quartzite jade, so extremely, extremely rare, then you have to master the precision of that macrame. Yeah. Now, a haigu is basically, we call it a donut basically over in the West, but it has got huge significant, uh, significant meaning. So if we just go back to that literature, um, yeah, so we know about jade. The reason jade is so prized for jewellery is often referred to as its water content in Chinese. Crystalline structure enables rays of light to penetrate the stone easily to reflect and refract in uh, light. Uh, translucency makes it look as if there's water inside the stone itself. Um, so we know about the value of jade um, overall. Um, what does it symbolize though? Prized by scholars and collectors for centuries, jade has traditionally symbolized purity, knowledge, and righteousness, as well as protection. Now, emphasis on the word protection. Many still believe that a stone protects uh, its wearer from harm and promotes health. Um, it's important to check that the jade, I'm going to say jade rather than jadeite, has not been treated. Um, so let's skip on from that. Yours is natural. Um, and there is that shape. There is that haigu you can see very simply complete with a bale. Um, it's often done with like a lark's head knot as well. Um, but again, that's that haigu shape that we're referring to. But what does it mean? In Chinese culture, jades have a spiritual tone, uh, stone sorry, with significant meaning, um, except for its durability and its role as a gemstone and beautiful adornment. Chinese people have loved jade jewellery since ancient times. They believe that wearing jade jewellery can bring good luck to the wearer and protect the wearer from harm and negativity. A pinyanku, which is like a haigu, uh -huh. is believed to bring good health, peace and safety to its owner. The shape um, of a safety clasp is simple. It's a convex or plump disc with a hole in the center. Um, but it is this simple shape that contains the wisdom of ancient Chinese mysticism and is still used today. So great meaning behind yes. that. Either if, if you call it a pinyanku or a haigu, um, it's that same amazing meaning. Another thing that often they believe in Chinese culture that you um, the hole in the center will actually keep you connected to uh, your lost loved ones. Oh, um, that's so, so yeah, lovely. It, it, it's just beautiful. And Pinyang you know, to make that, that. Yeah. Um, I, I know you said we have six beads. Yeah. You'd have to buy a whole strand you have to, to buy do that, strand. wouldn't you? Yeah. And then you have to six. buy the. The, yeah. the, the actual yeah. donut so to shape buy itself. all the components so. well on that Yvonne I don't think you're going to be able to do it for 49 99 you definitely couldn't no you definitely couldn't we go lower plus your time as yeah. well I've bought a few of these designs I didn't know we had it in the golden jade uh, in the quartzite jade yeah pop to somewhere like Mason and Kay you can get a high goo not a traditional high goo I have to say 2250 US dollars and it's literally on cord. Literally on cord. I've brought so many of these for gifts. Yeah, they're perfect gifts. We're at £29.99 pence only. It's a mad price, Neary, honestly. Is this the first time you've ever seen it then? I didn't launch this one. I don't know who launched this one. We, I know that when we had the lavender, I know that when we had the green and the Imper and the Olmec, I definitely launched the Olmec. They flew, absolutely flew. Again, perfect holiday jewellery. Ah, oh, yeah, gorgeous. I yeah. wear mine all the time. I mean, lots and lots of people are going on holiday now, aren't they, with the school holidays, etc. And don't you think, Yvonne, this is something that everybody can wear? Because it's quite, you know, you know that, that Probably all ages, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. This is a mad price to source the gemstones yeah. and to factor in your time, as Yvonne was saying, 19 pounds and 99 pence. I love the contrast of that sunshine yellow alongside the lavender color. Um, beautiful. It's the gold flex in that silk as well. Well, I wouldn't be able to do that. Pretty as anything. Lovely, that, lovely. Yeah. How many do we have available? 
Only 20. Hillary, Janine, hello to you. Helen Maker, uh, Helen in Yorkshire, Helen in West Midlands, Margaret in Wiltshire, um, Maker in Northamptonshire, Cynthia in West Midlands, Ivy, Dagmar, well done to you, <laughs> Susan in North. I knew you'd love it. I knew you would love it. Yeah. I bought one. The first time we ever had these, and I'm probably going back about a year, um, it sold out, and I bought two during the auction. I know, naughty, naughty. Um, bought one, I was like, oh, I'm going to give that to my niece. She never got it. I... I I wore it. Um, and then we did another one, and I was like, no, I will buy one for my niece, and she does wear it now. Hello, Samantha. No, not a room, but like Yvonne, I have a shelf for my special pieces. Um, Elle, I think your shopping list is getting um, ever longer. Yeah, it is, yeah, yeah. If, uh, Samantha, I, I do genuinely come to work some days and work practically for free. <laughs> I might as well literally say, just give my wages to the to the to the call center. Cut out the middleman. <laughs> yeah, might as well. Um, but I'm not going to regret those purchases, am I, Samantha? Oh, well, lovely. I want to see photographs of these lovely yes. gem shelves. Um, 19.99 jewelry makers again. The phone lines yeah. have gone crazy. Cynthia, we will get you. I promise you, my lovely. Dagmar's there as well. Uh, with people multiples in their baskets. We only had 20, so I'll be checking them out ASAP. Uh, 53 seconds to close. I don't think these are going to see another show. I don't think these are going to see another show, Neary. I think these are going to sell out today. The gold and the lavender go together beautifully, don't they? Yeah, stunning. Imagine if you're lucky enough, if, if, if you've got maybe some of the other colours, yes. high goods, you can literally up, just wear them, them together. Yeah. Uh, or if you're gifting, you know, you've got that meaning, be not only behind the jade, but the meaning behind the actual shape itself, mm -hmm. believed to protect you. Um, hello to you, Janine. I wear my Olmec one every day. Uh, this one is for my 11-year-old, Florence, who wears, uh, uh, so wearable for all ages. Janine, what a lovely idea. And I love your daughter's I name. I love that name. It's Florence. beautiful. Florence. My, my Willow's got um, one of her friends called Florence. It's such a pretty, pretty it's name. It's a lovely name. Yeah, me too, Janine. I wear mine all the time as well. I can't, I, I have to limit the jewellery that I wear into the studio. I'm not meant to wear any, really, but um, well done. I'm going to squeeze two more deals in before your early bird jewellery makers. They are available on pre-order. These beautiful sterling silver lengths that you could very easily customise. The other joy of this bracelet is the on and offable so easy to get yes. on and off yeah no problem whatsoever well done everybody let's do some spice beads diamond cut spice beads you get how many 25 yeah 20 and they're five mil i was gonna say um and look at that diamond cutting so wow. just literally so that means every time you're you know you're wearing them you're gonna get this constant almost like a melee diamond you're gonna get that beautiful light performance yeah they look do at that sparkle, sparkle don't they amazing little additions like this little additions like this just transform your jewelry um we're gonna take it matching an early bird price because these were a previous early bird opportunity five millimeters so they're sizable for spaces really 9.99 i remember when we used to do packs of 10 for more than that and they were smaller we and did, they weren't yeah. diamond cut we only used to have a few in a little bag didn't we when yeah. we first started selling them we used to do like the three and four millimetre mm -hmm. by packs of 10 mm -hmm. and weren't they about 14.95 they were, they were. Uh, I, I, I we never did five mil did no. we and we didn't do the diamond cutting ones no we didn't have we got many of these left 28 so you need to be quick especially as everybody's multi-bought so far um, over two grams of sterling silver. Well done, Conway. Well done to you, Dara. Hello to you, Brenda. New customers, Hillary, Maker, Cambridgeshire, and Sheila. Loads of you getting involved. Well done. We're going to do what? We're going to squeeze a couple of B caps in before your early bird. You get some sterling silver opportunities in the show because they are at an absolutely mad early bird price tag. Sorry, what did you say? What number? There's nothing in for. Oh, these, yeah, I launched these. I know, we took them crazy low. Oh, they are pretty. Aren't they, they? nice? Aren't they lovely? They and you've got really the drill are. hole at the top, so can you see that just yeah. there? It's a beautiful little bead cap, a nice little forget me not. I've never seen a bead cap anything like that before. No, and I was saying, Yvonne, during the launch, that they're that substantial in their grand weight, they could equally be like a tassel top. 
Oh, wouldn't that be lovely? Yeah. yeah. You could use them on the top of tassels. These were only launched, what, a week ago, maybe? Yeah, a week ago. Um, they absolutely flew, and they flew not only because they're so pretty, but because they're at £4.95. Oh. Pence. I know that these are last of stock opportunities. Now, speaking of beautiful 925 sterling silver and unbelievable precious metal deals, you're going to absolutely love your early birds, plural. Yeah, it's plural because you've got three different styles of chains. They're coming up next. Now, um, yeah, I, do you know the biggest quantity auction I've ever done here at Jewelry Maker was... 1,500. Wow, biggest quantity. what on earth was that? Can you remember? Mm, I can. <laughs> and, there, and it went crazy because of the price that we took it to. It was on a 925 sterling silver chain. Really? Yeah, and it was back when Liam used to produce me. Oh, right. Um, anyway, it went nuts. Uh -huh. It went completely nuts because for a good period of time, we couldn't really buy lengths of chain. No. Oh, it, it was very few and far between, I should say. Very, very, very seldom. Um, and then when we did get them, they used to, they used to just go in a matter mm -hmm. of seconds. Now, we're fortunate to have wonderful connections in the, opposite, the bullion world. But even now, almost 14 years on, I don't think we've done lengths like this before. So these are your traditional bracelet lengths. Oh, right. But if you don't want to turn them into bracelets, then I'm thinking... Firstly, it's going to help with the price tag, so uh -huh. the, length, the length that you're yeah. actually buying. But if you wanted to turn them into sterling silver, I don't know, waterfall style earrings. Join them together. Join that. You could do that. You could cut them. You could yeah. use them maybe in between like your Alhambra inspirations yeah. as well, something Mark and I were discussing yeah, yesterday. Yeah, any station type necklace. Yeah. Pearls or anything. So I'm going to tell you that the reason why I mentioned the, the, that big auction that I did was yeah. the price. I'm going to tell you that this price massively beats it massively oh. massively beats it and you have got a cho choice of design so let's take a look at those actually so you've got they're all diamond cut which means well it's exactly as it says on the tin um it's almost like the the links are all faceted and polished by a diamond so you are guaranteed to get the most amazing light return so three different links all of which are very um well they're they're italian mm -hmm. designs um so we've all got the this best one. star aren't they yes absolutely this is called a uh, lip chain so almost like the shape of lips can you see that next we have your classic figaro beautiful figaro do you know why it's called figaro because it's like notes of music figaro. you've got that extended link figaro where the extended link like like music notes um and then you have this beautiful textured link which is sizable now, one thing I don't know, Neary, is the quantity. We have 150 of each. Okay. You don't just get the one, you get two lengths. Oh. So you actually do get, in total, what would be considered a necklace yes. length. Yeah. Now, we're going to start with the biggest. This, again, because of that diamond cutting, the absolute light return from every single, for want of a better description, facet, because that's what they are. Okay. They're like facets to, the, to your precious metal. So you are in total getting, what is it, 16 inches? Is that right? Is that right? Fifteen inches, I beg your pardon. Look at that crisp white luster. Now, you could literally just put a, a clasp of choice on this, couldn't you? Really you really could. But, you know, I make a lot of pendants with a jump ring either side so that the chain comes from either side. Oh, very nice. So that's perfect. It means you don't have to cut a chain in half. Yep. You've got the extra length on the pendant at yep. the front, your clasp at the back, and then one of those chains up each side. Beautiful. Stunning. And you, like you said, you're not cutting up existing no. chains. No, it this always seems like 
like sacro it things does. To and you know, if you go to any jewelry w workshop, effectively, um, that's what they do. They do it off the spool. They don't yes, cut they up do. existing yeah, chains. Yeah. Um, so they actually effectively customised. Now, already jewelry makers were at twenty nine pounds and ninety nine pence. I mean, look at the quality. Look at the quality of that beautiful nine two five sterling silver. The, the detail that you're getting. 1.3 grams in total diamond cut precision that you can see can't you we the biggest auction i've ever done as i said was 1500 quantity literally flew and it was on a sterling silver chain how jewelry maker competes i do not know to be honest because the bullion market is the bullion market mm -hmm. how we can continue to bring you these unbelievable prices is is beyond yeah beyond uh, um anything i can get my head around we're already at 1999 wow. and that's not your early bird price tag now you get the two you do, you know, here's another scenario just imagine yourself walking down the high street and you're like okay i've got i don't know my auntie mavis's birthday coming up next week i need to buy her a nice <coughs> present and you think oh a nice bit of jewelry might be nice yeah. so you pop into your local jewelers not the really expensive ones like your tiffany's and your boodles and things like that you pop into your local one and you think oh maybe a bracelet because everybody loves bracelets and they're particularly mm -hmm. big in 2024 um, do you reckon you can be able to get one bracelet for nineteen ninety nine in sterling silver? No, absolutely not. You might be able to get an extender, an extender chain. <coughs> ah! Wow! <laughs> so that literally just makes your neck, your existing necklaces that little bit longer. Yeah. So it's that bit at the back there. Can you see the bottom of the screen? That's what you buy in for a tenner. So all that elaborate picture at the top. But yeah. It's nothing to do with it. There's really. nothing to do with it. It's the bit at the back. <laughs> it's the bit at the back. Now, <coughs> two seven and a half inch lengths. You literally just get. We sell those. Not at ten pounds though. I have to say. You get that little bit, that little inch. Oh, you can't see it. Oh, there. Yeah, yeah, there. That's what you get. <laughs> you can make a complete piece of jewellery or you can customise. 30 seconds. Yes. Yes. I agree with you. All that 925 sterling silver plus the diamond cut precision. Now, we've got 150 of these and the same applies with the other designs. Do shop ahead on those because we are going to drop that price. That is not what we're stopping as your early bird, wow. incredibly. Um, and then jewellery makers, we're going to put a clock on your screen. So I'm going to say, if you are um, watching today, craving your precious metal, needing it, knowing that you're going to use it, knowing that you're going to create maybe some dangle earrings, or you're going to go for the station necklaces, or you're just going to make some, you know, a classic, beautiful diamond cut sterling silver bracelet. You know, right now you're making it for £7.50. Yeah, okay, you've got to add a class. £7.50. Where else in the world will you get a sterling silver diamond cut bracelet of this gram weight for £7.50? The phone lines have lit up. Have you got a bolt ring clasp in your stash? Have you got a toggle? Or a magnetic clasp? Any of yeah, the above? Any of them. If you have, you can make that piece of jewellery. Yeah. It's your early bird, though, jewellery makers. Let's put a clock on screen. This is where you show Neary that you want the best early bird deal. And he says he's got your he's got you covered. We have the only issue here, Neary, is that we do only have 150. And you think about everyone that's multi bought so far. Yeah. That's 75 people getting two. Yeah, the baskets, the phone lines are filling up nicely. That's what we like that's to say. That's a really unusual link as well. That one diamond cut. Mm. It's flattened, isn't it? And then yeah. almost, almost faceted. Yeah. Do you know, I'm just going to borrow one of these for a second. And I'm going to kind of go... Oh, that's going to look... Oh, my word. Look at that. You're ready for your night out there. Yeah. Look how it literally catches the light. Oh, my goodness me. How amazing. And that's me doubling up effectively. You that's could literally incredible. Just, and that's a long length. I don't have yeah. to use all of that. No, you could do three lengths, yeah, couldn't you? Yeah, definitely. Gra graduating. So just seriously, that bracelet, that oh. bracelet, imagine it complete, five pound. 
for sterling silver. It is ridiculous. You're right, Michael. It's absolutely ridiculous. It, it, yeah, Louis says it's not possible. Well, it is. It is if you're shopping with us right here, right now. Right here, right now. Um, yeah, or you can get an extender extender chain, which is basically <laughs> a chain and a bolt ring clasp on the end of it. Okay. For a oh, I know which I prefer. And like, I have to say it's a pretty bog standard chain as well, isn't it, on that website? Oh, definitely. Um, there's nothing bog standard about this one. Um, as I said earlier on, I introduced your early bird talking about the biggest auction um, in terms of quantity that I've ever done here at Jewelry Maker. Um, and the reason for it was because of our amazing sterling silver price tag. Like I said, we've surpassed it today. Well done. The only issue is we don't have that 1,500 quantity that we had back then. Um, we have 150, we have 10%. Um, there's threes and twos. Durham's got two, Charlotte's got two, Debbie's got three, Conway's got two, Maria's got three three linda's got two marishka's got two you get the general gist don't you um beryl yeah. christine wendy tracy linda rupal nicolette paula hello to you northampton uh, ronda audrey says i'll have three at that price Merthyr tidville i'll have two thank you very much you, you could make a bracelet a beautiful bracelet for a fiver sorry what's that samantha saying say neary new new we love you ah <laughs> that's nice uh lisa in west yorkshire you can have that chain dangling from that floral bead cap as earrings. Oh, nice idea. Yeah. That's a lovely idea. We're going to have to do a clock to close because I've got lots to bring you. And remember those insane pearls are coming up in the next hour. I'm excited. I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm so excited. Um, there are 60 of those pearls, by the way. Just so you know, don't wait. We should have brought this to you at a much higher price tag because this has actually got more silver. Um, because you can see that from the scale of the You them, really can, you? yes. So we should have actually held this higher, but hey ho, it is what it is. It's going to be an amazing day. Jenna Weaver, Northamptonshire, well done to you getting two. Kate and Dorset says I'll get two at that price, and Leslie does. Um, I don't blame you. And Ruth, I'll have two. Geraldine, I'll have two. Um, congratulations. I mean, there are uses, um, far too many to mention, really, yes. aren't they, for chains? And it's not wasting. No, You're no, not no, cutting no. up any of your no. um, existing chains. No. Now, <laughs> I love a Figaro chain. Yeah. It's one of those classics, isn't it? It is, and all these chains are chains you can wear on their own without a drop yep. or, or yep. A pendant. And chains are huge at the moment. I know they are. The layer, it's the layering look, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, I love it. Yeah, I absolutely I like love it. it. Yeah. You can't beat a Figaro. Again, it is like, if you imagine like a, um, I'm not in the remotely musical, but if you can imagine sort of um, musical notes, like a script, of, do you call it a script of music? What do you, Michael, your musical, what do you call it? A manuscript. There you go, where you actually have the music notes. <laughs> a manuscript. I don't know, I'm not very musical. Like a sheet of music, yeah. Sheet music, there you go. So if you can imagine that, the rhythm, and then imagine it actually in, in sterling silver. That's how yeah. you figure it. I should um, see the sound go. Yeah. Sound, yeah. Um, oh, let's do it. You know we're not stopping there, jewelry makers. Equally, I've got 150 of these. We're gonna go straight down to this. Um, not gonna dilly-dally along the way. You've got lots of beautiful, beautiful precious metal in there, polished to perfection. And again, like the previous, um, they're seven and a half inches each. Each. And, that, and you, you could very easily price compare this. You know, if you were to go into a jeweler's and say, have you got any Figaro bracelets? I'm sure they would. And if they did, and I get you've got to add your class to this, but um, imagine it did. Yes. They're not going to be at the price that they're we're bringing them to They're certainly not. No, they're not. Not even a base metal one would be that. Oh, no. <laughs> no it's, it gonna, it's, it's not, it's not going to be a fiver. I was saying yesterday I bought a pair of earrings from Zara for my holidays, and they're literally kind of plastic, really. <laughs> I love them, though. I like costume yeah. jewellery, especially yeah. on holiday, and they're like big, gorgeous yeah, tropical flowers yeah. that look like birds of paradise. So they have to be um, that, And they're 30 quid. Oh, wow. 30 quid for their costume jewellery. I mean, what could you get from for five pounds from your children's favourite shop? <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> not, not a lot. That, that Claire's place. Yes. <laughs> yeah, not a lot. Our not Claire. a lot. Um, 30 seconds, jewellery makers. Not nearly enough of you on the phone lines. And we've got a massive opportunity coming your way. 
um, stock up while you get the opportunity. Another real positive to a Figaro is because you have got that one extended link, you can literally attach to it so you don't have to solder or cut anything. Nope. Um, so you could almost, if you imagine cutting it at the section, I suppose, um, just above the extended yeah. link, and then you can wrap loop directly onto that. Exactly, of course you can, so you're wasting nothing, Wasting are you? nothing. No. So you don't lose, you're not gonna even lose a single link. So just like your rosary link in yeah. on it, yeah. Beautiful, and that's because you've got the space in a Figaro. We're going low, low. Do you know what would go well on those? Is those, um, the big, the meter long, um gems you bought earlier on Ooh, in the birth, yeah, birthstone, the birthstone yeah. ones lovely Yvonne seriously 7.99 oh no it's gone even lower this that's time like, that's like <laughs> four pound each four pounds nearly no four pounds what are you thinking is that i don't know what to say about that it just happened <laughs> just four happened. pounds oh no hang on a minute hang on a minute I, my call screens, I don't know if it's a bit of a delay, but that there's no way near enough people on the phone lines for sterling silver at, at £7.99. Two lengths. What on earth? Neary, we could literally just sell these onto our sister channel who are crying out for chains. Gemporia have got... Yep. Yeah, well, yeah, they literally, we have Rachel sometimes come hop over from their buying team um, who produces, and she's like, I might as well buy them from you directly. Yeah. The prices that you get here at Jewelry Maker are insane, and that's literally within our own partnership wow. saying that. Um, clock to close. It can't go any lower. That's an absolute giveaway deal. Helen, Nicolette, Dawn, Samantha, well done to you. Leslie and Jenny's got five. Patricia and Wendy and Conway and Rupal and Sylvia. And Durham's got four. And Linda, well done. Beryl and Marishka. It's like we've woken up to realising that this is a crazy low price tag. Yeah. They're eight, sorry, seven and a half inches in their length. Um, with a figure out, you don't have to be a silversmith. You don't have to solder. You could literally just wrap loop directly onto yeah, it. Yeah, and jump rings for the clasp at the back. Jobs are good yeah. Job is a good one. Well done. And finally. I've never even heard of that before. Have it's you? the first time we've had it. Yeah. It is like, you know, so, sometimes you see like if you click an emoji, the kissy lips. <laughs> Does Michael Wolf send you kissy lips? <laughs> Does he? <laughs> ah. Here you go. Are these? No, I don't think we've done this before. I'm loving this one. It's a brand new chain to me. I've not seen I've these. I've never heard of that before. It's like little puckered lips. How beautiful. How unusual. Look how they catch the light. Oh my goodness me. And they alternate as well. Can you see? This is really clever actually. And it's a minor, it's a little thing that we can very easily overlook. As we're under magnification right now, do you notice how you've got lips in one direction then the other so they alternate they oh, alternate yes. the links alternate and the reason for that is that you always will have that constant mirror like luster so regardless of where if i rotate my hand maybe back and forth you are always always going to see that beautiful light performance now we've got 150 i expect these to be an on and gone opportunity i don't remember ever seeing this design previously before if you are looking for ultimate luster which i think most of us are in our precious metal then definitely this would get a thumbs up from me beautiful something you could use alongside the amazing pearls that are coming up in the next hour as well jewelry makers 7.99 it's far too low far 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 too low unbelievable and like i said it might it's new to me i've never even seen this even at jewelry shops outside yeah, of these four walls uh, with having that sparkle if you were layering up that's one you could wear on Lovely. its own in between other necklaces isn't yeah, it? yeah it's a necklace on its own yes, right it isn't is. it it's not just yeah. a chain no, no, yeah. um dawn julie jane well done multi-buying patricia well done conway multi-buying rupal sylvia uh durham getting three linda getting two you can still do it i had 150 opportunities but time is running out jewelry makers 
Um, we are going to be closing this auction and the entire hour. So do check it out because we have the most incredible, I'm genuinely, I mean it, some of the most incredible pills I think I've ever, ever, yeah. ever, ever, ever seen um, in the next hour. As you can tell, I am just brimming, brimming with excitement. Um, but there's 60. Make sure you're checking these out, jewelry makers. Again, it's one of those opportunities you just can't keep your hands still. You want to show off that amazing luster. Well done, well done, well done. Now, is it time? Is that what you're saying? Okay. Yeah, I agree. Um, sorry, Neary's just said we launched some lovely boxes the other day with yes, Abalone. I saw those, yes. We've actually added them into the hour oh, because right. Yeah, we've if you if you mind do they come boxed as well, but our pearls, the quality of our pearls do deserve presentation. Now yeah, they do. Just take a moment, and have, well, I need a moment just to compose myself because um, I consider myself truly, truly blessed to be able to, it's not work for me, but it's okay, not. let's use the word. You can't use it, isn't it? Yeah. You can't call it work, can yeah, you? Yeah, no, it's a privilege. It's yes, a real it privilege. Yeah. And when you're so passionate about something, gemstones and in particular pearls, to be able to see pearls of this grade is a real honor. But we must never lose sight of how Historically, pearls have always been, always been incredibly valuable. Where you have your wild pearls, where they're literally, it's like one in multiple millions that, uh, oysters will ever produce a pearl, and they're free dove for. That's where they, that's why they were the most expensive gemstones in the world. And then fast forward to the current time after sort of Mickey Moto's development, of course, now we're able to access pearls like this, but they are still real details of rarity that we must never ever 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 lose sight of check out your baskets for your first first hour because these are about this is about to close and get yourselves ready to be completely and utterly romanced by the finest metallic pearls Hi jewellery makers, Yvonne here. Just popping in to tell you that I'll be back in the studio uh, on Thursday the 15th of August with Carol, Tom and the team uh, and I'm bringing some beautiful pearls at nine o'clock. Um, I've had the luxury of um, using these. Look at the beautiful case before we even get in there. Look at these. Metallic multicoloured pearls. How delightful are those? absolutely gorgeous so we then in the 12 o'clock hour have um, a shot plate I've had the time of my life with this um, it's got four little uh, symbols on it and they're all very generic so they this one will suit everyone it has um, two different stars on it a heart and a smiley little sun and I've put them all on one necklace there I have made other pieces of jewelry but I'll show you those on Thursday hope you can join us see you then bye <laughs> makers did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee no matter the size weight or quantity of your order how many times you check out that day we will still only charge you that single PMP keep things simple on jewelry maker hi everyone I'm back on Friday the 16th of August I have this amazing strand of faceted jadeite and I'm really excited to share it with you. Also have these amazing sterling silver panther heads. I'm really excited to be back and I can't wait to see you then. Bye. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. 
Our partnership family includes Jewellery Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Oh my goodness me, like literally, you know, when you're just brimming with anticipation and excitement. I, I, I say it every time, and I'm sorry for sounding like a broken record, but this still is one of our greatest strengths here at Jewelry Maker, the quality of the pills that we bring you. And, and it's very easy to fall into a trap. And certainly, I know my friends and my family have actually asked me about this and said, well, yeah, but because you're, that yours are this price, they, they automatically assume that's what they're worth. And I totally get it. I totally get it. We are not, we have not got a jewelry shop. If we had a jewelry shop, then the price on these would be whew, astronomically high. I used to work in those jewelry shops and I can tell you it's wholesale times four plus yep. that as a minimum. Yes, it is. Yeah. As a minimum. Now, so we almost make our own job quite difficult sometimes because we have to overcome those subconscious feelings that, that are some of our viewers, new viewers in particular, who maybe are getting to know Jewelry Maker and what Jewelry Maker is all about, is, okay, well, they're 399 that's what must be what they're worth. I can't, I'm not qualified to stand you and tell you what these are worth. However, 25 years of working with pearls and not pearls necessarily all of this amazing grade, tells me, the, tells me that the deal that you get them today for, I mean, it's, you could add zeros. Genuinely, you could. Especially now. Now more than ever. And last, yes, I saw these for the first time yesterday. And last night, I, went, I started researching um, Yvonne, these amazing pearls, and I could have literally just read and read and read and read for hours. Because I know that our regular viewers, you have a wealth of knowledge on pearls, far yeah, more, let's be honest, far more than certainly I had when I first started in the industry. I didn't know the extent of pearls rarity. I knew Tahitian pearls, South Sea pearls, and Nicoya pearls. And I knew they were freshwater pearls. Freshwater pearls, everybody, yeah. I couldn't, I couldn't really yeah. differentiate between, the two, between them. I didn't know what made no. one more expensive than the other at the time. But you all know that. You all know that information, and if you don't, then you know. Hopefully, we do help educate you on that. And a few of these, I am going to, uh, and a few of the facts that we're going to discuss today, I know you already know. Please humour me. It is my job to highlight these quality, the, these quality factors. So I have, instead of going through each of the five virtues, we know they're enormous. We know, you know, so size, colour. Then we start talking about shape. Then we start talking about nacre and luster. I want to kind of whittle it down to a few vital factors for these pearls. And I want to show you articles. These aren't my words. These are literally off various different pearl sites. Highly qualified, otherwise I wouldn't, re reputable sites, otherwise I wouldn't bring it to air. Um, that discuss what you have the opportunity to own. The first one, and the most obvious. Now, you've not seen any of these before, I don't believe. Well, I've, I've never presented these to you before. They are, it's a brand new uh, presentation. So the first one, and in my humble opinion, the most important factor of any pearl is luster. 
Now, this article says, when it comes to determining how beautiful or valuable a pearl is, one characteristic is consi uh, to consider is its luster. This refers to how well the gem reflects light. Fine pearls have a wonderful shine that's almost like looking into a mirror. When light hits them, it sparkles and shimmers enchantingly. Pearls like this are worth more money than those without such luster. I think we've discussed that before, jewelry makers, haven't we? We've discussed the fact you can have a huge pearl, you have a perfectly shaped pearl, you have a lovely coloured pearl with lots of nacre, but if it hasn't got luster, it's just me. You need to have that mirror-like luster. I think it is the most important of all your factors. My goodness me, this ticks it and then some. In fact, it goes one step beyond luster. I'll get to that in a second. <coughs> Reading on. Shape and size. Just take a look at that photograph to the right hand side where it has the measurements 5, 7.5, 10, 12. A 12 millimetre pearl, a 10 millimetre pearl, anything double digit is colossal. I remember asking Charlie Barron maybe about two years ago, what's, put it into perspective, put it into perspective, what's the, the, the difference of rarity in a 10 mil pearl? How do, we, how do we compare that? And he actually said, well, look, put, look, at, look at it this way. A 10 mil pearl is like the equivalent to a three carat diamond solitaire. It's huge, huge. And look at these. They are all of that colossal size. The two in the middle, the half drilled ones, are 13 millimeter. That website doesn't even give 13 mil as an option. No, it didn't. <laughs> and the rest are all 10. Wow. So remember, 10 mil, three carat diamond, 10 mil, three carat diamond, 10 mil, three carat diamond, just to put in Charlie's words. Let's read this though. The allure and price of pearls are influenced by their shape and size. Round pearls are rare. They are highly sought after because they are symmetric, symmetrical and attractive. Additionally, larger pearls command a premium price. They take more time to develop and therefore considered rarer. These, it's really important to know that your pearls, each and every single one, I'm not talking the strand here, each individual pearl that you see there will be one pearl per mollusk. Yeah. Per oyster. Another vital fact, and you've got to remember that we're talking about, it's not just a static colour. We're not looking at like sort of a Dulux paint chart here and go, okay, well, that blue's got to match that blue. That... We're not talking about paint matching, we're talking about pearl matching. Matching is another one of the virtues, and it is crucial. You can see with this Tahitian pearl necklace that this lady's wearing, it's matching overtones, undertones, and also the body color. And they say when crafting pearl jewelry, it's not enough to simply gather pearls. They must also be sorted by their luster, color, size, and shape. You have to match all of those details which is painstakingly difficult, especially with something as rare as these. This careful practice guarantees that the gemstones are complementary in every way. Pearls that have been well matched command a higher price because of the uh, um, effort and, sk and skill involved in their assembly. Can you imagine that for a second? That you've got a harvest of pearls before you, not all of this amazing grade, so you have to sort through those. You have to then go, okay, so they've all got amazing luster, but wait, that doesn't mean that they're all gonna be together because some of them might be smaller. Some of them might be a completely different color. Some of them might have blemishes to the surface of them. Something we don't talk about often enough when it comes to pearls is something, and sadly, it's something we really do need to consider and is having a huge impact on the price and accessibility of pearls, and that's environmental factors. When it comes to a healthy, uh, the health of an oyster and the quality, and the quality of pearls they produce, water quality and environmental factors are key. Water temperatures, salinity, and the cleanliness can all affect the nacre production. And pearl farmers often have no control over them. Unexpected weather or change in water conditions can mean entire harvests are lost. Now, that's, that's sad, isn't it's it? It's extremely sad. It, I mean, the, 
and they have no such, control. I know it's no so control special. over that. We've heard <laughs> about your Kasumi pearls, which actually stopped mm -hmm. producing pearls for a period yeah. of time, and then they had to do this massive environmental overhaul to try and start that production again. But it took them years. Yeah. Now you look at Kasumi pearls. The price of Kasumi pearls they're absolutely sky high. So yes, um, environmental issues can have a, a huge uh, influence. You know, not just, I'm not just talking about pollution, but you know, things like, uh, um, we saw it after the 2004 tsunami. Massive implications on pearl mm. harvests. One of the factors that we absolutely know, regular viewers, you know this, is market demand and trends. Now, pearls have been long held in high esteem in the world of jewelry, representing both class and eternal beauty. Recently, their popularity has kept rising. This is thanks to modern tastes, their status yeah. as wise investments and cultural importances. Pearls now have never, ever, ever been more desirable to date. Pearls are modern now. They're modern. They? They, they've remodernized. Every generation yeah. are wearing yeah. them, gents, ladies, yeah. whatever the age, every occasion yeah. as well. But, so you've got that spike in demand. Everybody wants them. But don't you find you always have that spike in demand when things are at their yeah. lowest in supply? And that means that the pearl harvesters, if they're lucky enough to see something like this, can literally name their price. You've got Yoko of London asking 50,000 pounds for naturally colored pearl necklaces right now. They can name their price. If you've got an appetite and the, the budget to buy pearls of this quality from Yoko of London, it's going to set you back five figures. Move it on. Because this is the most important. The most important thing which really we need to recognize if you are lucky enough to own these is that your pearls, they're sizable, we know that. They are naturally colored. They're beautifully matched. We know about the demand, but yours are also naturally metallic. Every single one on that strand. Metallic freshwater pearls are extremely rare. The crisp metallic luster only appearing, let's remember this statistic, shall we? Nought, sorry, 0.01% wow. of freshwater pearls. 0.01% are naturally metallic. The amount of pearls necessary to produce a well-matched metallic strand is staggering. A producer would need to sort through hundreds of tons of pearls to produce a single strand. Can we just, can we digest that for a mm -hmm. second? Because you're about to own one of those strands. N Sorry, even I'm saying it wrong. 0.01% one percent of all freshwater pearls are naturally metallic we're talking single pearls not strands single pearls the amount of pearls necessary to produce a well-matched metallic strand sorting through hundreds of tons hundreds of tons to produce this of pearls and they're not heavy are they pearls unbelievable pearls aren't it? heavy let's read on this is pearl paradise. There is a type of freshwater pearls that is so rare and difficult to source, most companies won't even try. We offer true metallic freshwater pearls direct to you. That's their headline. So rare that most companies don't even try, uh, don't even try to supply them. Do you want to see some of their prices, by the way, for the metallic pearls? And by the way, they literally had, a f oh, sorry. No, it's coming up, it's coming up. I've mentioned it a second. Um, they only had a couple, by the way. This photograph here, I wanted to quickly show you, this is called the Big Pink Pearl. It's an exotic, natural abalone pearl, one of the largest and finest of its kind, um, weighing in a whopping, it's that rare, they measure it by the carat weight, 470 carats. The Big Pink Pearl stuns with its natural pastel pink hues and shimmers and iridescent flashes of blue, green, lavender, silvers, orange overtones. They don't actually even describe that as metallic. Okay. Don't even describe it as, I probably would because you've got those silvery light colors, but that's one of the world's most valuable pearls, um, which we've brought you, I'm not, I'm not comparing, I, you know, obviously that's huge, but um, we've brought you those overtone pearls previously before. So, flicking forward, 
There is one of Pearl Paradise's pearls, just for one single nine to 10 millimeter metallic drop pearl with a diamond at the top. It's not a massive diamond, 317 pounds on sale. That's not a bad price, by the way. Uh, that is, I was actually quite surprised by that. I thought that's quite a good price. For a single pearl, 317 pounds, yeah. that's not bad at all. I don't think they're, you know, um, yours are all, by the way, 10 mil or 13. Um, just, just consider that for a second, everybody, okay? One single pearl from Pearl Paradise, naturally metallic, same as yours, you're getting full strand plus earrings. Let's have a little, little look at another design. Um, also from Pearl Paradise, two beautiful 12 to 13 millimeter metallic uh, lavender pink pearls. Four, that, again, a great price. 428 pounds for those. They're perfectly spherical. So you know our earrings? Yeah, I'm definitely saying that. So you know our earrings? Before we even start anything, let me make sure I show you the right way. Before we even start anything, see these two beautiful Matching, three, 13 millimeter, spherical, Look at those. metallic pearls. Yeah, it'd be great if we brought you those two at 428 pounds. Yeah. I don't hesitate putting them side by side alongside those pearls. Yours are actually bigger, actually bigger. Let's go to Yoko of London because believe it or not, they've actually reached out to us here at Jewelry Maker. Where are you sourcing your pearls from? Um, because it's uh, they're actually struggling to actually commission pieces uh -huh. like this because of the supply of pearls. I mean, that's stunning, isn't it? Especially when you look at those beautiful shades of pinks, um, the ones at the bottom of the necklace and those peachy tones you're definitely getting. Uh, this is a Blossom Rose Gold South Sea Akoya Freshwater Pearl. So it's a mixture of them all. Mm -hmm. 50,000 pounds for that necklace. I couldn't see that price from yeah. here. I was waiting 50, for that. 50,000 <laughs> pounds. Wow. Um, but they're right, it will definitely get you noticed. Look at a few others. Um, there's, oh, I think we've done that one. Moving on, you've got a single pearl from Yoko of London, freshwater That's pearl. Beautiful. So pretty, 500 pounds. So again, one on a gold class, 500 pounds. Yeah. And that's not unrealistic. I don't know what size that is, by the way. I don't think it's anywhere near it's the size that you're getting. It's absolutely not unrealistic. No. Um, what about these that we saw in Stratford-upon-Avon? Um, very disappointed with that bust. They need to give that a good baby wipe clean, don't they? But <laughs> anyway, not metallic necessarily. The two pink pills at the bottom there, £535. Are you seeing a pattern here between £400 and £500 just for two spherical mm. pearls? Um, you get those as well as a strand today. Let's have a little look at some more. Yoko of London once again, £7,000 for an 18 karat gold um, Akoya and Freshwater Pearl necklace. It's absolutely gorgeous. Um, ombre pearls here, 5,500. These aren't metallic though. They aren't actually metallic. They're lovely, they're beautiful. Don't get me wrong, I'm uh, amazingly spherical. Now, jewelry makers. <laughs> I told my husband about what's happening today. Oh, did you? He did like a little bit of an eye roll. <laughs> he knew what was coming. I was like, Tom. I've, I've got some amazing pearls that all down to Jewelry Maker, as I know so many of us do. But the deal that you're about to see today is completely unmissable. They are some of the biggest metallic pearls that I've ever seen. But there's so much more to this statement. They're perfectly spherical. Mm -hmm. They are completely flawless in their nacre. But never lose, never forget this statistic. Hundreds of tons, tons of pearls have to be sorted through to find one single strand's wow. worth. And we promise it 0.01%. And we, well, I heard that, that's the statistic that I used to say, Neary's saying, is that one in 10,000? That's what I used to say, but I think it's even less. No, but it's a hundred tons, it's hundreds of tons hundreds of tons not a hundred so it's less than that one in ten thousand that's what i always I, i'd read that before i think it's even rarer than that can we because mike and, and i know look we are going to do a clock to graphics but i also want to really show you if i can 
a short video of Dave in Hong Kong at the beginning of this year. Now, basically, it's a really casual exchange. It's him talking to a pearl supplier, asking about a few different strands, asking about the price. That's how we buy, or, or mostly how, how our sister channel actually buy. And there's one in particular where she holds up and she was like, oh, very rare. Um, these would be like one in many, many, many years because they're metallic and the color. Talk, think about the price that she talks about. Remember that this is wholesale, not retail. But she focuses in particular on the size, she talks about the shape, she talks about the metallic beauty. These are the factors that all you are getting in abundance in this opportunity. So shall we do, what do you reckon, Neary? Do you wanna do clock to graphics or do you wanna watch this video? Right, let's watch the video and then, so there's no distractions. We have 60 of these, you will need to be quick. You will need to be quick. And then I'm gonna make my way over to Yvonne as well so can, I can show you her amazing pieces of jewelry. 60 seconds, uh, sorry, watch this video and then the graphics will appear after. Remember, metallic, size, shape. Have a look at this. <laughs> This is it. With metallic. Hmm? And what kind of price for this? Uh, which one? This one. This one? And what's the image? This one. $1,000, okay. Yeah. And what, what size is it? 11 to 4? 11 to 14. 14 mil. Yeah, yeah, 11 to 14. And how much for these? Uh, everyone different. Okay. Yeah, everyone different. Yeah, like, like this one. Mm -hmm. Shining. And this one. Okay, I like uh, this one here, price. Uh -huh. This one. What color is this? This is pinkish with metallic. Metallic with yeah, a metallic. pinkish, yeah. Pinkish. Okay. Pinkish. Hard, very rare. Very rare. Yeah. The 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 color very rare. You cannot get. And the bigger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Big size. Big size. And Pearl has gone very expensive now <laughs> in the market because of Nini and Yang Ni, yeah. the social media. Social media, yeah, 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 very. US dollars. US. So for this strand, 18,000 US dollars. 18, and can you get how many? Um, maybe many years can get one. Yeah. Oh, five? Very. No, 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 I only, this color, only one, this size. Right. Yeah, maybe a little. Smaller? Smaller, but a smaller, not metallic like this. Okay. Yeah. And, and if, if smaller? Uh -huh. Okay, so uh -huh. can you get more of this color? Yeah, this color can, no, two, maybe, two. Two, yeah. Similar. So, Similar so color. yeah, yeah. Yeah. And what price if I buy these two? Uh, yep, you. This one. These are smaller, right? Yeah, this smaller, this quality. $5,500 yeah, yeah. US. This quality. This all belong to top. Yeah. Yeah. This is what I'm interested in. Yeah. This one. Also, special white top color, top quality, like South Sea. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Is this more affordable? More affordable. Is this lower? No? This top, our top, lower is over there. So for the top white? Yeah, top white. And what kind of, what, okay, so uh, how many do you have? This one. Yeah. Yeah, this law is seven. Seven. Uh, seven. If I buy all seven, uh -huh. how much? If you buy all Natural seven, color, right? Natural color, yeah. natural color, all natural color. We all natural color. Just the golden and the black. We die. This is all natural. 6,200, okay. Now can you put clasps on and everything, manufacture with? We can, we can clasp. If you have clasp, so we made it now, it's no problem. Okay, yeah. okay, perfect. Eighteen thousand, one strand over many years because of color and metallic. Your graphics are live, jewellery makers. I'm going to wish you all heartfelt 
best of luck opportunities. This honestly is one of the most unfathomable deals that you will ever see in Jewelry Maker history. Don't forget that number. 0.01% to get one single metallic pearl, hundreds of tons to produce a single strand. And that's not even factoring the fact that these are between 10 and 13 millimeters. That's colossal. Remember Charlie's number, the equivalent yeah. of a three carat diamond. <laughs> that highlights the rarity of your opportunity. We could have done these absolutely at two separate auctions. You know, we've shown you quite a few different suppliers and I didn't cherry pick. One of those was taken in a photograph in Stratford upon Avon, mm -hmm. the jewelers about 20 miles away from us here. 500 pounds as a ballpark, not even metallic. Yours are much bigger, naturally metallic, and I can tell you, well, I'm not even, I'm, I'm not going to say anything, but I'm not going to say anything, but let's just say we got this covered. If you are looking for some of the finest pearls in the world, genuinely, and I, I truly, truly, truly believe this, there is nowhere else in the world to look for pearls other than jewelry maker here. Mm. And I'm not just saying that because I'm biased. I am biased. I'm being honest, but I also wouldn't say it if I didn't think it was wholeheartedly true. Hello, Alison. Brilliant presentation. Bless you. I've been for jewelry, uh, um, been a jewelry maker fan for over 10 years and I've learned so much about the pearls and gems um, I have bought from you. Do you know, that, that's lovely to hear. And you know what, Alison, we learn with you as well. We learn with you. My knowledge of pearls was nowhere near what it is now. And that is because jewelry maker take us to places like Hong Kong. See those prices. We get, we went to Hong Kong that year fully knowing that we were never going to buy pearls. Mm. Do you know, do you know, and, and, we, and look, Gemporia have got the budget to pay, uh, to pay for those tickets. They have, they have, but it's vital. It's vital we do those trips because it's not just about the actual physical buying. It's about the information that we get. You know, we heard, learned about Nan Hong being mined out mm -hmm. at, on that same trip. If we hadn't gone, we wouldn't have known that. And we wouldn't have known that pearls like this are 18,000 pounds a strand wholesale. Ooh. We wouldn't have known any of that information. You, uh, Mark said to me the other day, they, he's got, yesterday, he's got, there's some lovely jewelers li local to him. Yeah. And he was saying that actually it's the first time he's seen in one of those luxury jewelers, no pearls. And it actually says because of the supply issues yeah, that I they have. Yeah, I heard him say that. It's so uh, unbelievable, isn't it? You might be thinking that these are going to be, be beyond your budget. I'm here to tell you that you are going to get one of the most incredible prices probably in jewelry maker history. Let's go quickly through, lastly, your virtues for your pearls. Size, jewelry makers, anything over 10 millimeters is colossal. Shape, round pearls are rare. They're highly sought after because of their symmetrical, they are symmetrical and attractive. Additionally, larger round pearls command a massive premium. Then we start talking about color. Did you notice that lady was saying, oh no, 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 dyed pearls are over there. <laughs> the dyed pearls are over there. These are top because they're natural, top. Yours are natural. Nacre, I mean, we're under magnification here. Can you find a single flaw? Can you find a single blemish no. on the surface of those beautiful organic gemstones? I can't. And we talk about luster. Luster and then added metallic beauty. Shimmers and overtones, iridescent colors of gold, copper, silver, blues. You've got it all and it's all natural jewelry makers. Massive congratulations. Can I just say already approaching 20% of the stock has gone. Rupal, London, wow. Linda, Peter and Sharon, Margaret Maker, Gloria. I've got Samantha Maria and another Gloria there as well. Thank you for trusting us. I promise you from one pearl lover to, uh, to another that you will see the most unfathomable deal, the mm -hmm. most amazing, amazing deal. The reality is, yeah, that lady in, in, uh, that was offering the top grade, and I actually have to say they weren't as strong a color as, you, from what, whether it might have been the lighting, I'm not sure. But 18,000 pounds, metallic, she says. Big, metallic, mm -hmm. top grade. That's wholesale. We uh, should be bringing you the earrings for more 
than we bring you the entire set for today. Let's do it. The start price is already going to be outrageous and I think the start price is already going to get a, a huge reaction on the phone lines. I buy pearls like this jewelry makers, not just because I love them. I buy them because I've got two girls. I've got two girls who will know that mummy worked with the most yeah. amazing pearls in the world. And, you know, they're not going to be, they're not going to be able to purchase pearls like this when they're older. Um, well, I don't know, unless they win the lottery, of course. You, know, <laughs> you don't know, you don't know. Um, but I can't buy them outside of jewelry maker at no. the prices that we bring them uh, to air for. 25 not years from, ago, not I Not from couldn't. a shop window. No, mm. 25 years ago, I, the pearls that we had in said establishment were like five figures, £10,000 upwards for this size. Look at your start price. It's a joke. It's actually a joke. That's £500 for the earrings, £1,000 for the strand. Hang on. Hundreds of tons of pearls are sorted through to find a single strand of naturally metallic. And you've just got it for a thousand pounds you can get a freshwater generic non-metallic potato pearl for four figures you can and they're lovely you can buy 12 of ours for the equivalent of that eighteen thousand pound strand that that lady was offering at, at hong kong yeah can, permission to jump on my soapbox for two minutes less than two minutes to our wonderful management team upstairs are they, is, is Wayne still in there? He's lurking. This is why I've been saying we need 18 karat gold clasp, because I wouldn't put that on anything other than 18 karat gold. No, you're absolutely right. I thought that when I was making them. Eight, you can pick them up from Cookson and Gold. They are mm, our competitor. Pop to Cookson and Gold, they're about 50 quid, depending on the design. This deserves it. And you are only complementing the quality of your pearls. You've saved masses already at £1,499. Masses! Already 20% of the stock has gone, jewellery makers. Well, yeah, 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 yeah. Neary is just saying in my ear, you know, we almost have to rationalise why we take this lower. This is why at the beginning I said, if we actually make our job harder because if we were to match the prices of other locations like Yoko of London, um, we haven't got the overheads that the, the jewellery establishment. And we might sell one every year, two years, three years, because that's the reality of what yeah, they do. Yeah. You know, but you make massive of ma masses of, uh, of profit in that one sale sorted. Happy days. We're not about that, though, jewellery makers. Shopping TV is very, very different. Shopping TV is, remember, remember Steve Bennett's ethos? It was like, I want to make the most precious, the most desirable gemstones in the world accessible to the masses. And instead of putting out that 400% margin, instead what we'll do is work off tiny margins so everybody can get it and we'll sell volumes of them. And that ethos still remains true still remains true today we could stop here we're not gonna let's take it under a thousand pounds jewelry makers and you get extras i've barely mentioned these but you know no, that you yeah. do get them and of course you'll get your demonstration and instructions with our lovely yvonne i am going to make my way over but i want you to get the opportunity to purchase the pearls first 999 pounds only is ludicrously low in the best possible yeah, way it is when you think one single purple metallic pearl mm. from Yoko of London was 500 quid. I've never seen pearls as big as the earrings. 13 no, mil. Never in real life, I don't think. They're insane. <laughs> they are incredible. Well, here, yeah, let's, let's put this into perspective. Oh, that's a good idea, yeah. Let me hold it up to my ear. Can you see it there? It takes over my, my earlobe. They are absolutely huge. They are huge. Look at the quality of them. It's flawless. I would pay, budget permitting, I, reality is £999 isn't a bad price for this one. No, it's not. This one 13 mil pill. The reality. Jewelry makers in a minute, in a minute's time, We're not stopping at 999. In fact, we're nowhere near hundreds of pounds. Thank you for your trust to every single one of you that have eased the pressure on our call center team and shopped ahead. 
Um, but you've also secured yours, safe in the knowledge you can sit back and enjoy the rest of the auction thinking that you've got some of the finest pearls on their way to you. They come beautifully presented. I, again, I've barely mentioned that. It's all been about the quality of the pearls, the content of the pearls inside. I will go as far as saying, jewelry makers, in my 25 year career of working with pearls, these are genuinely some of the best that I've seen. Mm -hmm. Genuinely some of the best that I've seen. And I've got, I've seen some lovely pearls um, over the years. That's a lot, isn't it? 25 years, these are some of the most memorable pearls that, I've ever seen. Yeah, it's a big that really does say something, doesn't it? But they're flawless. They are absolutely flawless. You're getting a full 38 centimetre strand jewellery makers. We're not stopping here. Hundreds of pounds coming off that price tag, folks. Huge congratulations. I'm literally green with envy for those of you. Oh, oh my goodness me. We saw I mean, some I'm 8 like mil them. earrings oh. in Stratford-upon-Avon that weren't metallic, still lovely, don't get me wrong, very symmetrical, beautifully flawless nacre oh. surface at £535. They're on a little gold post. And you know, you wouldn't look twice no. and think, oh, they're, they're not overcharging. You would take that as red, yeah. wouldn't you, walking past that yeah, shop? Yeah, that jeweller, I wish they'd wipe the bus though, seriously, <laughs> but that jeweller is not overcharging no, for those not, pearls. No, they're not. Not at all, that's the reality. Access to pearls, is at an all-time low but the demand is at an all-time high let's consider this 2, 4, 9, 9, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40 40 pearls wait, wait, wait so let's ease of maths Let's call them £250 per pearl in that Stratford upon it. Just for kicks, this is really. <laughs> £250 per pearl. Yeah? You'll shave a little bit of price off of the gold. So £250 times 40. Congrats. How much? £10,000. Good maths. £10,000. Yeah. Not unrealistic. But they're not metallic. So that price would be more, wouldn't it? Mm. Leslie? Definitely. London, Pamela, Samantha, Gloria, Maker, Margaret, Peter and Sharon, Linda, London, Rupal, Patricia, and Janine, Marie wants three. I've got Staffordshire there as well. We're at 399 pounds. Let's go through those virtues. Size, oh my goodness, yes. Size is colossal. Anything double digit measurement um, is huge. Three carat diamond, remember what Charlie said all those years ago. Shape, perfection, round pearls are rare. They are highly sought after because they are symmetrical and attractive. Larger pearls command a premium price. They take more time to develop and therefore considered rarer. Um, then we start talking about color. Are they dyed? No. These are totally natural. Mm -hmm. You know, that is like literally what each pearl, a little lottery ticket, a winning lottery ticket. But then it's luster and even more than luster, metallic beauty. And today, oh, and only today, this is, there are jewelers shopping with us, I'm not surprised. We are going to bring them to you at one. Inc it's already incredible. An even more incredible price. I have 60. And I point blank refuse for a single one of these to be sent back to the mm. vault. Because they are too incredible. If you have any interest at all. You know, is this the... the are these... These are goals, aren't they, for me? You know, like there's pieces of jewellery that are aspirational pieces. They are something you aspire to, aspire definitely. Aspire to. Yes, These are goals in yeah, the world of jewellery. If you have that dream, then just show us you're there. We've got 60 available opportunities already approaching. I have to say half the stock has gone. Massive congratulations. But in 22 seconds, we are going to take it to the most amazing, unimaginable unmissable price tag for the finest pills that genuinely I think I've seen in 25 years genuinely um, do they come with a lovely box please yes they do they Joanne do. they come beautifully presented yeah. like so um, you get if I just move those for a second you get the beautiful box 
matching complimentary velvet box that comes with it it comes with the silk as well jewelry makers and it comes with your sterling silver collots as well i know i've barely mentioned them i was going to save that for when i move over to um yvonne and you get yvonne's instructions too to make that piece of jewelry all of this today jewelry makers for an incredible 300 349 pounds wow when one natural pearl purple pearl is 500 pounds yeah, from yoko of london a pair of studs was 525 pounds in stratford upon avon and literally you could go anywhere and find natural purple pearls of uh, at a higher price tag than what's on your screens yeah, right definitely. now Definitely. please 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 know though the metallic beauty of these pearls is exceptionally rare and can take years years and years and years to put together an opportunity like this dorothy you've got two amazing danielle in oxfordshire louth linda in manchester leslie in somerset well done i've got leslie in west midlands hello to you samantha saying omg simply stunning that's my 60th birthday oh sorted. congratulations oh, happy birthday samantha yeah what a birthday present absolutely. that is absolutely and imagine if you're going to be a mother of the bride this oh. year can you imagine the sunshine twinkling on those for the photos i i mean you'd you'd steal the limelight sorry oh, you, you would really you would, would. as yeah. the mother of the bride yeah. you'd steal the limelight yeah, wearing those pearls yeah. because they are jaw-droppingly yeah. beautiful yeah. You know, I've seen well, I've seen a fifty thousand pound South Sea pearl necklace that sold on our sister channel, and it's absolutely incredible. It really is. I'd still choose these over. Would it. you really? Absolutely, a hundred percent, because of the natural metallic beauty. Yeah. You know, save yourself the tens of thousands of pounds. It's <laughs> yeah. unbelievable that jewelry maker make this level of rarity. Eighteen thousand yeah. pounds for that one strand at wholesale at the beginning of the year. It's amazing that jewelry maker give you this quality little old jewelry maker that literally started in an old cupboard literally we started in the cupboard broadcasting 14 years yeah, ago who would have thought exactly it? and here we are bringing yeah. you the best I've seen bluish colors at 349 pounds or wait wait what's the split pay 69 pounds and 80 pence now i'm aware that we've spent quite a long time on these don't worry yvonne will have a demonstration can i show you something can i show you something because i've got 60 of the or had 60 of these available dan can we go down the right hand side of that call screen Because if you see your name on this side, it is not guaranteed to you. How many exactly do we have left? 19 <gasps> left in the world, right, okay. So if you see your name here, Maker, Vicky, Andrea, Sarah, Yorkshire, Marion, Jeannie, Cumbria, Kathy, Abiola, Linda, Patricia, and Janine, and you disappear off the bottom of the screens. It's not guaranteed to you. There is a queue on the phone lines forming as well. If you wait for this clock to reach zero, you will probably miss your opportunity of owning these. These are legacy pearls and we will never, ever, genuinely big statement, but I wholeheartedly agree with it. We will never be able to better this auction opportunity because believe it or not, that's a purple clock. We are taking it lower for you today yeah, and today only. I can't believe that, it. Honestly, when I said at the beginning of the morning, when I said I was like literally bubbling with anticipation this morning, it's because I knew that you were going to get one of the most historic, breathtaking, phenomenal pearl deals that we'll ever likely see likely ever see when pearls are at their peak yeah. their premium price tag and we're delivering you the best possible grade that you could wish for perfectly spherical smooth nacre yeah. surface enormous in their size everything double digit and the rarity of naturally metallic match naturally metallic to well. do this feels oh. so wrong so 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 wrong 
That's working out at <laughs> what? £7.47. And you know, we can guarantee you will, when you get them home and you open them, you will be delighted. You'll have the same reaction we all have. Yeah, exactly. <gasps> Honestly, that's £7.47 pence yeah. per naturally you won't metallic be pearl. It's unbelievable. It really is. And if you don't, I definitely will come the break. 100%. Because, you know, I'd be foolish not to, to be honest. Literally not them, put them on 18 karat gold clasp, walk into an, a luxury high-end jewellers, wherever that might be, be brave, do it. You've got, you have some, if you what if you can part with them, that is, and mm. wait for them to offer you money for yeah, it. Yeah. Don't take a low offer though. Do not take, if you are thinking of selling these, these are fine, the finest pearls I've seen mm. in 25 years. And I genuinely believe that because they're flawless. They're absolutely flawless. And you've got that beautiful metallic luster. And don't tell them how much you pay for them. No, <laughs> definitely don't share that because that's no reflection of the true value or worth. We had 60. That one strand, yeah, that one <laughs> strand in Hong Kong was 18,000. You could buy all 60 of ours for less. And the earrings, mm. have the matching earrings. They didn't offer matching earrings. I have single figure quantities, jewelry makers. I'm gonna make my way over to Yvonne, but can I just quickly say, well done London for upping your quantity. I would do the same, because that's an unbelievable deal. If you are Eileen, Helen, Toyin, Mark, Angelina, Maker, Carolyn, Andrea, Jeannie, Kathy, Abiola, Patricia, Anne, Jeannie, and Marie, I can, you disappear off the screens. I've, I've literally got single figure mm. quantities now, so I'll keep you posted. I'm gonna make my way over to lovely Yvonne. Um, where obviously you're going to get your fabulous demonstration so don't worry about that don't you worry about that but these pearls needed to have absolutely and i you just mentioned someone in london there yeah if you see these in a shop window in london oh uh, i mean compared to stratford on even even they'd be horrendously expensive uh, they would mm -hmm. and and they're not wrong no, by the way they not those no, prices no, no. are not incorrect no. it's us that is yeah totally totally us that's got the wrong price tag there now um we have got like, don't worry like i said your deal of the day is uh, it, you know if it is what it is we will and if you have any questions for our yvonne then don't what you oh, can yes, text please. in as yes, well please do. yvonne i mean look at that I you've know. literally kept it in the box which this is yvonne's yeah. beautiful jewelry so uh, knotted i i knotted uh, they i looked at them i put them on the table i thought there's, there's i'm not no going to mess away no. around with them i could i could add all sorts of things but why would I? They are too beautiful to mess with, yeah. in my opinion. And um, what was that? Can you do a close up of the pearls? Absolutely, there you go. I mean, we're probably closer in this shot, but yeah, we can get right up close. They are flawless. They are absolutely flawless. I didn't change the order of them. I took them from the strand one by one and there as they arrived. Unbelievable, you're literally seeing, I don't know if you can. But the reflection of of the reflection of the studio. Um, Helen's just bought some for her grandchildren. Well done. I wow. Mean, I mean, that's that's amazing, isn't it? I I have to be really cautious saying the word investment. But do you yes. notice that article did say it? Yes, it did. Yes, it, it did, did say it. I had yeah. to I actually had to cut out a whole paragraph that talks mm. solely about the investment of pearls because I can't read into the future. But you know. Uh, two nine nine. That's an amazing deal, isn't it? I mean, can you imagine sending your daughter to her prom wearing those? <laughs> There'd be no, nothing else there to touch you. With Unbelievable. <laughs> Morning, ladies. Um, what's millimeter size? Thank you, Gigi. The strand is ten mil, and the earrings are thirteen. Thirteen, 13 to fourteen, in actual fact. So, can you see? They come half drilled and they are perfection, GG. Absolute perfection. So 10 mil in the natural strand, 13 mil to 14 mil. And you know, we've got two cases open there together and they, they're absolutely perfectly matched, aren't they? Now, okay, okay. let's... Um, Start the demonstration, jewelry makers. Any questions, do text okay. in, and, and I'll we've update the, you on quantity. But we've got limited quantity remaining. Well, we've got the um, we've got the 
instructions. PDF anyway. Yes. Yeah. This comes you. for free, obviously, yeah. that you can yeah, download. Yeah, yeah. Okay. okay. Right. Well, obviously, I didn't have any leftovers, so. No, well, I wouldn't either. <laughs> and what comes in the little box is um, for, um, well, they, we call them not covers. Yeah. Collots, whatever Collots, you like yeah. to call them. And I've got the, the silk here that was left over from the strand. Now, this is lovely thick silk. I mean, to be honest, it, they needed big knots. If you used finer silk, you would probably need to put two, d double the knots. Um, but this makes a lovely, lovely um, chunky knot for the, for the lovely chunky pearls. Um, so, uh, first of all, take your silk from the card it'll it'll be it'll have a few little notches in it where it's been wrapped around the card and just gently pull it like that just to, st to stretch that um, silk just a little bit like that but just be careful I've already done this one but just be careful when you come to the needle uh, be careful you don't you don't get near that when you're pulling because obviously um, you don't want to take the needle off. Now what I'm going to do first of all is go to the end opposite the, um, the needle and do an overhand knot. There we go, like that. There we go. And uh, for this collot I, I would do a double knot here just to make sure that it doesn't slip through that hole. There we go and I will get those those two knots to sit on top of one another like that so we've got a nice chunky knot there so let's find the needle there we go so what we do here is we go for this end we go from the inside of the knot cover to what will be the outside so that that knot sits in the middle like this I'll just pull that down And that knot will sit in the center there now personally I would I've got my um, hypo cement glue here I won't do it for the demo because we haven't got the drying time but I would put a little dab of glue on there let it dry before I close that collot um, and also for this demo I'm going to just cut off that little tail there so that I can show you how I close this collot. Um, now I start off by pressing them together with my fingers. Sorry, you might not be able to see. I might have to cover it up while I do this. So just push those together, but very, very gently because they will actually go out of shape quite easily. Now then get your flat nose pliers and actually ease those together very, very gently. What we're aiming to do is to get those two little circles there um, absolutely identically placed so that we can get our jump ring through. There we go, like that. If you need to, to uh, this is the stage to tweak it if you need to. There we go. Now, sometimes, you you find that you actually see through the sides and if you squeeze too tightly with these pliers you will flatten the little rounded piece but i found that if you take your flat nose pliers and you just go onto this bottom little bit here and just squeeze very very gently on each side like that that actually closes up the side so that you can't see i'm only doing it a little bit at a time there we go and if you can see that by pressing that at the bottom that's closed up the collot now i also do another knot the other side of this so that my pearl is not rubbing against the metal so i'll do another overhand knot like that and what I do, I use, I always use the tweezers. Put your tweezers through your loop. Put them tight up against that collot. Pull it tight like that. And then slide up that knot with your tweezers. You don't have to be, have them too tight. But just slide those up like that so that you've got a nice knot there. And then 
time to put the pearl on. And can I just say, sit and enjoy this process. Pearl knotting is very meditative and don't do it when you're in a bad mood. <laughs> uh, do it when you've got time, plenty of time, plenty of space and just sit and enjoy the process. Now I'll, I will put, push that pearl up against that knot just to tighten it up for the last little bit and we then do exactly the same another overhand knot there we go whoops don't let that happen because it's going to pull me on knot tight we don't want that okay so we, we're going to take that up there see so that you can move the, this about it that that could have been disastrous but it wasn't so we'll pull that tight like that against the tweezers Push that up there. Fine tweezers, um, fine nose tweezers are, are the best for this method. I'll just put one more on, and uh, and to do the other end, you just do it exactly the same way, uh, but you will do it opposite. Um, so you will actually go from the what we call the outside, what will end up being the outside, to the inside. Then do your knot. So exactly the same as we did originally. And don't forget to put that knot next to the collot when you finish off so that the pearl doesn't rub against it. So there we go. Let's do exactly the same. And, uh, and there, there it is. So as I say, just sit back enjoy it uh, get all your knots nice and close to your pearls and uh, and there you go so beautiful i love doing pearl knotting so, you, i really you know you do you said just take the time it and is enjoy it's so yourself. relaxing honestly yeah. it is i used i used to natalie uh, hello oh. natalie saying i find watching yvonne pearl knotting <laughs> so soothing she makes it look so easy and calming and her jewelry always looks so oh, beautiful thank you nat that's really it, kind it, of it thank truly you. does and it is meditative i, it meditative. Is. I used yeah. to stand by the lady in the jewelers that all she she only pearl knotting. yeah that's all, you know. what a great job <laughs> and it was just one of those you just literally just enjoy the process um neary's got a question oh Oh, that's a good question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, Neary's just said, when you worked in the jewellers, how much did they charge per for pearl knotting? And bearing in mind, I was in my early 20s then, so it's 25 years ago. Mm -hmm. So they used to charge, I'm sure it was like between, th it was less than a fiver per knot. Per knot though, they used to do it per knot, yeah. Yeah. It was expensive, hundreds of pounds to have your, but I mean, this is the thing. So. It's 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 a huge skill. It's a great skill to learn. It, oh, and it's as I say, I I left the whole that they came. I left the whole afternoon, nothing else to think about. I left left the, the whole pattern. afternoon um, free just to do that for however long it took, and and I was so relaxed when I'd finished. Yeah, uh, you, you asked question just just for like market research. Mm -hmm. Go into a jewel and say, oh, do you not pearls? Do you not pearls? You could kind of look. I think yeah. do they charge about forty pounds a knot now or something 40? like that? Forty. Yeah, I've heard that. Yeah, I've heard that. Wow. It's yeah. a, I mean it was a lot when I was working yeah. in the jewellers, so that's amazing. Definitely a skill to have. Um now a little bit of an update, jewelry makers. We have literally the final few of these available. So if your name is Joanne, Lanarkshire, Cheshire, Carolyn, Jeannie, Kathy, Abiola, Patricia, and Janine, Marie or Gloria. Um, or anybody else that's interested that hasn't just yet isn't yet on the web or on the phone lines do it now because this will sell out I'm a, we're about to duck into a break before your deal of the day oh unbelievable um yeah so get them now sorry you've been asking for what you've been asking for the deal the wall of fame to be in a set time um we have listened and from this day forward your deal of the day is going to be before sorry your wall of fame is going to be just before the deal of the day auction so your amazing inspirations sue susan good luck check out check out check out 
Your wall of fame is coming up next with the most amazing deal of the days days coming up after that. Again, once again, Yvonne, absolutely beautiful. Oh, absolutely beautiful. I, I mean, I know we've said it time and time again that I I am treated with the <laughs> with the with my kits and. Uh, Oh, I've just seen that. Yeah, <laughs> sorry, we've just seen a message that's come through. You are, no, do you know what? What a privilege though, Yvonne, and you do them such justice uh, as well. And I so love doing. I pearls. love doing them. Uh, yeah, thank you, Maurice from Warwickshire, just up the road. Says I inquired at a local jewellery shop and was quoted between yeah. thirty-five to forty-five yeah. pounds I'd per heard knot. Forty pounds. Yeah. Amazing. So you could make a proper business out of that, to be honest. Um, you could set up your own website. Yeah, and, and it doesn't like take a lot, long time to learn either well, if, how if, to do if it. If you don't know how to do it, yeah, there you go. You in this there. <laughs> um, okay, lovely jewellery makers, do not go anywhere. Your wall of fame is coming up. Um, and then the deed of the day. And now for your slice of recognition, some fabulous pieces. First one being from Gail Somerville. Hello to you, Gail. You are number 276. Oh, a beautiful collection it's of jewellery. It's lovely, isn't it? Very summary. Um, hi all, please find attached my wall of fame for this week's. Um, it's a selection uh, made from August Birthstone, Peridot and Black Spinel with 925 silver. Good luck everybody. Good luck to you as well. Give up, uh, uh, sorry, I almost said Yvonne there. Gail, uh, you are number 276. Gorgeous. Uh, right, I've got 277 from Sue Gott who says, Very hi, nice. this is this is my entry for the Wall of Fame, a beautiful double Biwa pearl from JM. Wow. It's on a rose gold plated 925 slider bracelet, also from JM. And that's from Sue in Derbyshire. And beautiful, that's, Isn't that good? Sue. We haven't beautiful. seen pearls like that no. for a long time. Beautiful in its simplicity, that Amazing. one. Amazing, loving that. I've also got pearls. Um, these are from Linda Walker. Linda, beautiful necklace here. You're number 278. Hi all, at Jewelry Maker, here is my entry this week. Had these Keshi pearls and sea beads for a while. Thought, yes, I would make them together. Um, I think it's a lovely look, very pleased, and I hope you like it too. Thanks for all the inspiration and bargains and banter. Looking forward <laughs> to watching. Um, good luck to all in the draw. Linda, that's absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous. Keep those entries coming yeah, in. Yeah, good luck, everybody. Yes, you've got to be in it to win it, as they say. Now, coming up, jewellery makers, one of the most breathtaking deal of days an opportunity not to miss Friday the 16th of August and I have this amazing strand of faceted jadeite and I'm really excited to share it with you. Also have these amazing sterling silver panther heads. I'm really excited to be back and I can't wait to see you then. Bye! Uh, welcome. 
welcome back everybody and huge congratulations on those yes, amazing pearls well done. oh do you know what the oh. most exciting thing is still yet to come though what i mean is when they arrive on your doorstep oh because you think it's lovely now yeah. and it's like yes i got them and i just realized i was holding my breath until i Oh, I didn't realise yeah, I was yeah. holding my breath. Wait so until exciting. they arrive on your doorstep mm. and you see them in person. They are amazing. You will not be disappointed, no. I promise. Now, I tell you what, tough act to follow that. Mm. But don't you worry, we've got something very different, but equally as, as exciting. Now, we're about to bring you a selection of the finest quality, the rarest colours of beautiful Burmese jade. Now, whether you're looking at lavender, black, green, imperial, white, whatever, Burmese jade is closed. The mine is closed. That's 800 years of history, done, done. And that happened in 2020. Um, it is still to this day considered to be one of the most valuable gemstones in the world. When you think there's over 4,000 different minerals, to be in the top 10 rarest is quite something. But there's also different degrees of your jade. You can, obviously, we're going to talk about the fact that is it type A, type B, type C? Type A being the most sought after, which kind of leads me back to that conversation that I had with you this morning. And also a conversation I had with Wayne this morning, as, or just rather, as about, the, about the lavender jade, hopefully, that I've bought on Facebook. Um, but we shall see. You don't have to pay the hundreds of pounds to have something lab certified and actually find someone that can do it as well. It's quite difficult to do. We will lab certify, uh, lab certify it all for you. In fact, what you're about to see, I might as well just put, you know, just put this one out there. What you're about to see is all type A grade, totally natural, not polymer impregnated, not heat treated, not fissure filled. Now, I am gonna bring you, and you can see it before you just here, the beautiful Black Series Jade, the oldest jade in the world, takes multiple millions of years to form this amazing gemstone. Millions of years older than any other color of jade. Um, we're gonna bring this to you and I'm going to actually, yeah, point blank, show you some photographs from first dibs where you can find similar shades of type A grays and you'll see them at, at huge price points. But before I do that, I want, we have within our vault, and this is what Wayne, is he in the gallery still? Hi Wayne. Wayne um, <laughs> came in during the break just then. He was like, still the most expensive jade to buy, by the way. So like, yeah. <laughs> Disclaimer, still the most expensive. And that is his, um, his, his, yeah, his way of saying, be careful with your price points. Because Wayne, I'm gonna ask the question in front of our lovely audience. Can you replace lavender jade at the moment? No. He's We've got about, okay, so we've got, we have four pieces of lavender jade coming into the, into the business, but it is super expensive, he says. And that's because, and it's really important that I point this out, why? Why is lavender jade, why does Ronan Schlussel, who's like a guru in the jade world, why does he think lavender jade will overtake the price point of, of imperial green? Because believe it or not, imperial green is not the rarest colour. It's the most expensive. Yeah. It's not the rarest colour. Um, it's because gemologically, gemologically, in Burma, where, where this jade is from, an element called vanadium is rare to form. Now, you can go to other places like Tanzania, where vanadium is a little bit more abundant. Uh, vanadium is what colours your tanzanite. But in Burma, it's incredibly rare. And it's that element that transforms your jadeite to these, those beautiful lavenders. Now, if you weren't able to, and I am denied about whether I should tell you this story, but um, I think it's, it's good to share, isn't it? And I might listen, I might go, okay, it's not jade, it's dyed, it's, or it's polymer impregnated something else. You know what, it's worth, it was worth the punt in my opinion, and I'm not a gambling person. But about a month ago, I'm scrolling through aimlessly through Facebook Marketplace, as you do, and you're just looking at, oh, yeah, that's a nice chair. As you do, you're just nice scrolling. Chair. <laughs> it's a nice chair. And something catches my attention. <laughs> and I see this beautiful necklace and earring set. And I was like, oh, I like that. And at, at that point, I don't know it's jade. 
I haven't seen, I've just seen the, the piece of jewelry. And it's 14 karat gold. It's got like a Chinese symbol in the center, which are, in speaking to Susie means um, luck. That's lovely. It's got a matching pair of earrings and it's got this color. I'm gonna show you a photograph. This color. Yeah? Oh, wow. Now, I contact the seller and it's a 14 karat gold jadeite set. I say, okay, is this Taipei? I said, I don't know what that means. Okay, is it natural? Because he's, he's an antiques dealer. Yeah, huh? He's like, okay, is it natural? He's like, I honestly don't so know. They've got no background he information. He says, I've got, I honestly don't know, but mm. it's 14 karat gold. I can see the stamp. I was like, you know what? It's worth the 220 pounds for the gold weight alone. Yeah. I'm going to buy it. And it's really pretty. What I will do is spend the hundreds of pounds to have this lab certified. And I will, if, yeah, oh, well, yeah. 100%, if, if, if they come back, it's Taipei, then I'll approach first dibs, definitely. 100%. You, what you are getting today, or what you're about to see in the lavender colors are the rarest color of all. It was worth that 220 pound purchase. I'm not losing anything because of the gold weight. If it does come back as Taipei, then oh my goodness, happy days. We have literally a handful of lavender jade within our vault you get the most unbelievable deal. And again, you know that it is genuine, firstly, jadeite, secondly, Burmese, and it is lab certified. What you're about to see today, I've got a carving and a 55 centimeter strand of lavender jade. This, the carving is one of the most detailed I've ever seen. You have the most Yeah, let me just put my, oh my goodness. I don't know if you can dim the lights here. I'll check them. Look at this detail. Look at this lavender color. It's two dimensional. Oh, look at that. It's unbelievable, isn't it? Yeah. With that gorgeous translucency, this to, to say that you own lavender jade, there's yeah. very few people on this planet that can do that. Look at the layers of the carving. Know that you actually do have, yes, can you see this? Yeah, like six layers of it. If I turn it side profile, can you see? Look at the translucency, you can literally see my Good finger man. behind. Um, all done by hand with the rarest color of all. The rarest color is not imperial. That's the most expensive, for sure. But um, the rarest color is your lavender. And we're so fortunate mm -hmm. to be able to offer this to, uh, to our audience. Now, when you say we have that lavender jade, we won't have many though, will we? Nine, there you go, that's it, that's it. Normally when we're launching the carving, we might have 50 or 100, we've got nine available of this. I wanna show you as well the reverse, because you can even see actually like a, like a hollowed out center. And there's the drill hole also, hollowed out center. If I turn it side profile again, you can see that very discreet drill hole there. So it's not gonna um, interfere with that beautiful work of art, that amazing carving. Look at that detail, all done by hand. That beautiful unfolding lotus flower. You've got the wonderful foliage and leaves that literally intertwine alongside one another. Each layer a progression of artistry. Remember what one how you said from Sotheby's that when we're looking at jade, don't look at it just as a commodity. Think of it as a work of art created by nature and shaped by human hands. Nine available opportunities. We have literally a handful of your lavender jade opportunities in our entire portfolio across not just jewelry maker, but also across um, across the uh, uh, Gemporia partnership. We've kind of covered this, but whilst you're making your acquisitions, why is lavender jade so rare? If we go back there, there you go. Um, one previously, I think. Vanadium is considered extremely rare in the areas of Burma where jadeite is found. And for it to, uh, to naturally exist in sufficient quantities to produce the lavender color is one of the reasons this color is just so rare to find it in any real saturation or quantity. 
Uh, lavender jade has become one of the most expensive colors in the jade market today and as a result it has continued to demand extremely high prices which have continued to rise every single year and that's most likely only set to continue because you've got to remember four years ago this was mined out so it's Absolutely. irreplaceable already we've got collectors getting involved there's roland schlussel i mentioned the gentleman um, um he, he's like like i said uh, like a jade guru he contributed to in color about jade um and pillar and stone that you can see behind him is literally his business and he says the price of type a jade is right now at all time high particularly difficult for us to source is the skin these are the fancy colors of jade the lavenders and reds these prized colors are so rare because this is the skin of the boulder as it oxidizes this is why you never get solid reds um okay it goes on to the reds there but look over his shoulder or look over dave's shoulder there look at those lavender colors i know that you are getting that beautiful saturation we are over allocated am i right in suggesting this is the only carving that we have left in lavender unless one of the ones that wayne is actually buying in the future is a carving but currently this is the only one we have in the whole building and i think that goes across gemporia as well rupal julie Anne, and i've got anonymous maker there as well you can still do it there was only nine opportunities we are starting at under a thousand pounds but not while we're stopping. Hello, Nicola in Essex. I've got nine in the world. The Even the work, back is like a circle of heaven. Say, the workmanship in that, yeah. I wouldn't even know where to start, would well, you? you? Could, like to hollow something yeah. like this out. It's just, and then, then the layers Those layers well. of artistry. It's just unbelievable. Where do you start? I wouldn't know where to start, seriously. We start at 999 pounds. <laughs> for the rarest color of jade eye in the world. Those aren't my words. Those are the words of Roland Schlussel and many uh, jade pillars in the industry. Years and years of training to do that kind of yep. thing. The artist, artistry in it, just unbelievable. Let's half that price, jewelry makers. We should all day long to the moon and back be holding lavender jade at a higher price tag. Like I said, Wayne stepped into the studio during the break. He was like, it's so difficult to buy. It's still the most expensive to buy, just so you know. Um, that's his kind of subliminal message. Don't trash the price because it's irreplaceable. £499. You try, and get, you try and get lavender jade for anywhere near that mm -hmm. price. And by the way, the piece that I've bought that I've taken a little, little bit of a gamble on. Hey, I liked it as a, as a suite of jewellery. And it is a great price for the gold on its own. But if it, that does come back as a type A, lavender jade, with the gold, uh, that's an unbelievable I deal. I hope you'll let us know. Oh, I will, I will, I will. Don't expect it to happen anytime no, soon because no, I've no. still got, it's got to be sent. It's got to be sent to the sent east or it might, I might even take, uh, um, ask Dave to take it over uh -huh. when he goes next to China to, so they can actually test it because we don't do it here. That's the no, thing. No, that's a good idea actually to send it over. But to know that you have got that type A gemological certif certificate saying this is vanadium rich lavender jade the rarest color of all and not 499 pounds a subtle lavender color that comes through yeah it's a it's a hue of blue that comes through and a massive 200 carat opportunity here is your call to action lovely jewelry makers because we're in, we we're always in single figures. I've got single figure availability. We only ever had nine. RuPaul's not leaving anything to chance, making sure she doesn't miss out on this opportunity. Massive congratulations, RuPaul. If you want the strand that is coming up literally on the back of this auction opportunity, the most beautiful 55 centimetre strand that you could literally suspend this from, couldn't you? What, when yes. we talk heirloom and legacy pieces, look no further. Uh, the rarest color of all jades in so the world. Intricate. And not even at 499 pounds. Plus you've got your 0% interest split pay. Um, good luck everybody. Even let's show that because this is like a page within a jade publication. Um, so yeah, you've got your amazing pinks. Those pinks would be, I don't know. I don't even know how to put a price on those. You can see them literally mapping it out. That bangle will have areas of imperial green, but again, the bulk of it will be this lovely subtle lavender color. The bangle, by the way, in my opinion, I'm no expert. I'm still learning with you, but the bangle will obviously be the most expensive piece on yeah, that. Yeah, absolutely. Um, out of that slab. 
We're not stopping here, jewelry makers. Four hundred and ninety-nine pounds is already amazing. But today, for nine, when was the last time you saw lavender jade out on our screens? Two hundred and ninety-nine pounds for that level of artistry. Remember, colour, translucency, artistry. That's what one how you said of Sotheby's. Those are the things that you need to consider when we're actually valuing jadeite. Colour, well, you've got the rarest. Translucency, well, you saw how on, my, on that recording, when I had the, the torch behind, you saw that translucency. You can see the layers when you put you the see light the layers, behind it. And you can literally see me sort of wave my finger yep. behind it in a second. And artistry is literally off the chart. Let's show those, actually. Those ones that you saw, um, yeah. So here it is at wholesale, lavender jade at wholesale in, this was in Tucson, 45,000 Hong Kong dollars wow. for that strand. It's not the most intense purple, 45,000 US dollars. You are getting carving of that same material at 299 today. Remember how we access a lot of these as well. One there for 80,000. Steve actually went into partnership with Bernard and bought, uh, um, you buy Jade out by the boulder. So they actually went into partnership and bought some together. And um, that's how you've yeah. got access to your lavender Jade out today. Rupal, Tina, Anne, Nicola, Julie, Anne, Maker wants two of these. I had nine opportunities, jewelry makers. Yeah, I, I Wayne stepped into the studio and he was like, rock bottom price, £299. You know, it is irreplaceable. Uh, we could literally just pop these in the museum. We could definitely be approaching sort of the likes of your first dibs and sell them on there. But if we did that, it kind of goes against the ethos of what the, yeah. the company is all about. Um, Jay has also added this to their basket as well. Again, you can do it. Hand carve that amazing translucency and it's the vanadium element that brings this beautiful saturation, this ultra rare saturation. If you want the strand that is coming your way, I don't is it available on pre-order? The strand? It's available on pre-order. Can you imagine that actually? Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Neary. Imagine. I'm going to put it on a different bust, actually, if I can. Can you pass me one of the blue busts? Just because they've got the elastic on the back. Only because this, this strand is literally perfect to go alongside the carving. Uh, no, sorry. Okay. Like a navy blue one, which has got elastic on the back. If you found it. What are you doing? Wait, wait, wait. Neary. Neary, Neary, have you asked Wayne? Oh, he's there. We're not making any money on this. Okay, we're a business, we've got to make money. Yeah. Only because, for whatever reason, these haven't gone as fast as we'd hoped. Do you consider yourself a jade collector? If you do, then I know that Lavender Jade will be on your radar. And you won't get a better price than what you're about to see. Because we are taking it lower, purely because of the time. The level of artistry. Oh, stop, 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 stop. So Wayne is in the gallery right now and he says, I'm gonna show you something that I've been offered today, today. That's the cost, right? That's cost price. So a type A green and lavender jade Pixu, $300 cost, and there's 50 pieces available. It's the lavender that pushes that price up, right? And the majority of those Pixu carvings are actually green, the majority. We're going to take it lower. We're going to take it even lower, jewellery makers. The strand is coming up to, oh, goodness me. 
we've just shown you literally a piece that Wayne, who's in the gallery right now, has been offered $300 cost. So that means we've got to make some profit on it, um, <laughs> it be it even marginal. Are you going to buy these, Wayne, out of curiosity? No, no, he says. Um, what a superb sculpture in jade eye. It is exquisite. It is, Caroline, and I know that you've got one of the most amazing jade collections. It's got the layers, hasn't it? That's the thing. The level of artistry and, of course, the absolutely beautiful lavender colour. Please don't expect it to be the same colour as your amethyst, say. It's a soft, subtle saturation it's almost like hue or whisper of beautiful yes like a is. wisteria yes. color saturation 53 seconds we have to move on from this jewelry makers because we are literally making friends basically and jade collectors very 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 happy i've only got three of them left you can get this home on your percent interest split payment for what just over 60 pounds today um it is drilled as well so again just so that you can see that very cleverly position drill hole at a 45 degree angle so that it doesn't interrupt that beautiful uh, level of detailing. 23 seconds, make sure you're checking out your baskets everybody to guarantee your success at just over 60 pounds. Final six seconds. Good luck, everybody. Gigi, Jane, Rupal, Suja, you can do it. Sorry, Jay, Tina, Anne, Nicola, Julie, Anne, and also Anonymous Maker. Well done. Yeah, unbelievable. Absolutely. And by the way, if you are trying to check out four, you won't be able to because there isn't four. No. <laughs> the Black Series is coming your way, wonderful Bye. jewelry makers. This strand is absolutely impeccable. Probably one of my favorites. Something that you could definitely put with some of your finest quality uh -huh. pearls. These are totally and utterly natural. Um, it's, I love the fact that if you think about the jade color wheel, you've got your greens, your yellows, your reds, you've got your um, lavenders as we just saw. Black Series has actually transitioned through all of those colors. It yeah. takes multiple millions of years longer to actually achieve um, the black color. It forms much smaller than most other sizes of jadeite as well. Um, so to actually acquire enough of all the, you know, yeah. the carrot weight enough to actually make a strand is absolutely amazing. You That's know, coming nature up. Nature is incredible, isn't it? It's when amazing. You, when you, you listen to all that that you've just explained, and yeah. you think that's just fascinating yeah we couldn't uh, replicate that no as, as man could unless we? you've got millions of years to spare yeah. <laughs> which i don't think any of us do no. um so that is coming up jewelry makers but first sorry i'm sorry to be a nuisance can you pass me one of the the, the blue displays Only because I can't just put this over the back of my hand. Thank you. Right. I can't just put a strand like this, just drape it across the back of my hand. It needs to be displayed correctly, like you would see at Sotheby's and Christie's and Bonham, mm. Bonhams and First Dibs. To irreplace this opportunity is nigh on impossible. And the fact that we're so you know open that we would literally say look right now Wayne's in the gallery and he's just been offered some green and mm -hmm. lavender jadeite carvings it'll cost us 300 pounds each so I, I don't know what price they're going to be on air for but we've turned it down because they're actually more green than they are lavender the rarest color of all jadeites not dyed variety not polymer impregnated natural is lavender and you're about to get an opportunity jewelry makers to own a full strand of it just literally you know we spoke about knotting Yvonne yes I would knot this I would too most definitely set so just slightly separate those um, so that they you can highlight them yeah yeah this is such a strong a long strand it actually doesn't fit on the bust it's but it's all good it's probably got a good size drill hole too. Yeah, because it? yeah. it's jade eye. Yeah. Right, there we go. I'm going to double that over. There you go. So it, it is longer than how it appears actually on the bust because basically it was touching the uh, touching the bottom. Look at those beautiful lavender saturations. Remember with jade eye, it is colour, it is translucency. 
um, <clears throat> when we're talking about your beautiful rounds. On the certificate, we will show you that certificate, the Gem Lab certificate you can see here. Aqua, which is referring to the translucency of the jadeite. Um, we use water content, so for example, quite yeah. opaque would be snow. Then you've got like your moss in snows. Then you've got your um, ice, and then you've got aqua, which is completely translucent, like water. Yeah. So you've got a beautiful translucency of these as well. It also shows those magic words lavender but also yellow yellow jadeite is incredibly incredibly rare wow. um now how many do we have bit of housekeeping how many do we have 32 actually you might be going oh it's only 32 yeah but it's lavender jadeite yeah, 32 is amazing yeah. we'd be lucky to have one elsewhere the clock's on screen because we're going to bring the graphics live and i'm going to promise one of the best deals ever we cannot control yeah, that's true. If people multi-buy, which would be savvy shopping, that 30-odd quantity might go to 10 people. Yes. If we've got jade traders, and we know we do all around the world, because mm -hmm. we've got people in San Francisco, we've got people in London, we've got people mm -hmm. uh, um, up and down the UK who buy jade from us and sell it on, we know that. They could buy the whole quantity. Well, that's up to them, isn't and it? And that's entirely yeah. up to them. Yeah. They also get the same price as you. <laughs> <laughs> the quality of that lavender first two gone straight away totally natural look at those lavender tones beautiful translucency in those gorgeous golden yellows london straight away congratulations to you you're not alone believe me loving the fact that these are four millimeters four millimeters i mean it's crying out to be a lavender tassel in my opinion and then i just put some of the yellows and the greens just at the bottom mm. oh how beautiful that would, would that look be amazing amazing talk about heirloom pieces now i want to see you there there's 30 available opportunities do you consider yourself to be a fine quality jade collector like the likes of lovely caroline who messaged in a few moments ago i know caroline has been collecting jade for many years Probably has one of the most envi enviable really? jade collections ever, yes. And I reckon she's probably got her, her eye on this auction opportunity because Caroline will also have a wealth of knowledge knowing the fact that vanadium is rare in Burma. Yeah. And it's vanadium that produces this beautiful, soft, wisteria-like lavender colour. I'm taking a little breath for a second because <laughs> if we had the quantity, we could absolutely say, okay, let's let's open this up at 2,000. Is it unrealistic? Nope. Okay, let's open this auction up at 1,000 pounds. Is that unrealistic? No, nope. it's really not. Talk of the devil. Hello, Caroline, my lovely. I knew you were there. <laughs> It's unbelievable, isn't it? The start price on this is ridiculous. Are you ready for it? All we have heard, do you know actually the two colors in this strand, all we have heard from Wayne, is he still there? Hey Wayne. Lavender's most expensive to buy, can't get yellow. Lavender's most expensive to buy, can't get yellow. <laughs> I'm new Wayne. Lavender's the most expensive to buy, can't get yellow. <laughs> That's all you say when we start talking about the colours of jade. No more natural yellow within the vault. There we go, you've had it clear from the horse's mouth. Slightly repetitive. <laughs> I mean, you know. We're like, yes, Wayne, we know. <laughs> the start price is already ridiculous, jewellery makers, already. Can you imagine teaming this alongside the, the, the Black Series as well? Okay, 30 second clock, we're going to do something ridiculous. It's one of the last strands of lavender jadeite, beautiful four millimetres, which I absolutely love. I always say um, four mil is, is the new six. Look at that beautiful walk, water milk. content. Um, amazing, amazing translucency to it. And again, it's not like, a, it's not like a, a, an amethyst purple. It's a soft bluish light mm, purple. It is. 
much more pastel tones um, but the gem lab certified good luck everyone because we are going to take this extra low for one of the rarest colors no scrap that the rarest colors of your type a jade that you can possibly get your hands on we are not stopping at 499 jewelry makers 0800 655 halving that price tag straight away this is your call to action for the rarest color of all remember you try, if you go on to, I don't know if you can find any of those photographs, go on to somewhere like First Dibs. Number one, S-T-D-I-B-S. Do you know, with four mil, I like making there you go. stacking bracelets. Yeah. I mean, stacking bracelets And, and then lovely. you get to admire it. And that's it. a nice long, uh, long strand as well for 55 that. centimetres. Yeah. Here you go. Hong Kong Jewels and Jadeite. You can get a lavender jadeite. You'll notice similar colour. Ruby, that's the little tiny little like rondelles that you can see in between um and diamond necklace a little bit like the garnets that we had yesterday yeah good point so i mean what's that 150,000 to 250,000 hong kong dollars i don't know about the co conversion rate of that but it sounds expensive and that's an estimate Remember, these auctions will always underestimate to spot, underestimate to, to encourage interest. Uh, auctions are always like that, yeah. aren't, whether they're in person or online. But that photograph also highlights the quality of the lavender jade out that you are getting. Look at it over my shoulder. Those beautiful, strong purples. Now look at your strand. Now look at this one from uh, from Hong Kong Jewels and Jadeite. The quality of the lavender that you're getting. We're not done, jewelry makers. We're going even lower. Valerie, Sharon, Caroline, London. It's very easy to make up. And by the way, you know that. Can we can we Google what is 150 Hong Kong dollars in pounds? You know, the, the diamonds, you might think, oh, yes, diamonds in there. There's not many, it's in the class. It's little melee diamonds. The rubies are nice little rondelles that we brought you in a dealer day not that long ago, all the garnets that we had yesterday. So the estimate is £25,000 um, minimum. And like I said, they always underestimate. We're at £249 and we are going lower. Also, can I say that's what, 2022, so not that long ago. No. Good luck, everybody. One, four, nine wow. for a 55 centimetre strand of lavender jadeite. Um, already we've got collectors, jewellers, yeah, getting involved. I'm not surprised I shan't, out, I shan't out you on this. But again, knot it, put it on gold, which I imagine you probably will do, or literally cord, which is very traditional to, um, to jadeite. You're not going to be commanding three figures, are you? We'd be foolish not to. Sharon wants to. Multi-buying when we've got a quantity of 32 means that we've got, what, 15, 16 people who are going to be successful on this auction opportunity. All of a sudden, sudden that, those chances. Yeah, they're getting slimmer. at 149 at 49 pounds and 66 pence you can get this home natural yellows beautiful soft wisteria lavender tones um certified completely translucent we've got to remember this is not just this isn't a short 20 centimeter strand it's not even 25 centimeters it's not even 38 it's 55 centimeters mm -hmm. from end to end of that beautiful quality um as a double length strand effectively the rarest color of all we could have split this in half couldn't we have turned that six uh, 32 quantity into 64 we could have done that yeah um, we could have brought these to you and maybe like taster strands that we used to do for the world's rarest gemstones. Um, London, well done. Yeah, absolutely. Jade, jade like rondelles in a 38 centimetre strand, did you say? Three by five millimetres. A shorter strand, so 38 centimetres, and it was £99. Here at Jewelry Maker, that's amazing. That's, the, that's a fantastic yeah, really? price. Today, with half the quantity gone, you are not getting just the apple green. And I almost feel unfair saying that. This is the rarest colour of all. 
you're also not just getting a 38 centimeter strand you're getting 55 in lavender and we are going lower i've given you a very big hint here that strand that we said earlier on that amazing strand the rondelles 38 centimeter strand shorter and it was 99 pounds yeah, wasn't it it was <clears throat> there's your hint jewelry makers this is 55 <laughs> centimeters london maker maker julie valerie sharon caroline margaret new customers getting involved now here is your call to walk, uh, call to action sorry yeah you look at the hong kong jewels and jadeite and that auction piece probably did not sell for twenty five thousand pounds that piece would have sold considerably more than that i mean it's a very broad estimate as well that they were actually given and that's purely to spark the interest you are sourcing the rarest color those beautiful beautiful soft lavender tones you get complementary greens you get the most gorgeous natural yellows as well which we have none here we go, here's another one. First dibs. £34,550, natural lavender jadeite. With a very simple clasp. Today you can get hold of that same gemstone. They might be smaller, granted, but it's also longer. For £99.99. £99. Goodness me, that's absolutely unbelievable. Look at the quality of the lavender over my shoulder and look at the pieces that we are showing you elsewhere. Places like First Dibs, Sotheby's, Christie's, Bonhams. £99. The fact that this is a full 55 centimetre strand, not 20 centimetres, um, is absolutely incredible. Senga, you've done it. Sharon, you've done it. Maker, Maker, Yvonne. Angela, Maker, Valerie. I've got jewellery establishment shopping. Well done. Sharon, Sharon in Durham wants three. If you do, Sharon, I would definitely be checking out. I only had 32. That's it. And you know, you know, you know. Going back to those pixus that uh, um, Wayne was literally offered this morning, Wayne, you had fifty. There was fifty being on, offered, right? And um, what did you go back? No, because they're more green than than lavender. Still three hundred quid each. Just a whisper of lavender. Wow. Look at the quality of the lavender. And by the way, you have to buy all 50 for that 300 pounds. If you wanted 25, so it's go wholesale up. price, yeah. yeah. If you wanted more than if you wanted less than that, the price would go, go up for up, us. So yeah. we've literally walked away from it. So continuing to bring you prices like this is absolutely unbelievable. It really really is. Do you know what will go amazing alongside this strand? Your beautiful black series. I would be teaming the two together and ironically, oh, I've got a piece a to show idea. you that actually yeah. has that complement uh, complementary color tones. 50 seconds clock to close jewelry makers veronica and yvonne and angela and senga well done you can still do it but it is getting extremely limited now as our opportunities um as our opportunities to bring you um to bring you lavender jadeite debbie in, on the phone lines well done you literally entered into the auction at the tail end of that presentation and literally leapfrogged over everybody else well done <laughs> i've got five of these left that's exactly how you make you, you know make these your own literally don't hesitate you know that's an amazing deal lavender jadeite is still the rarest is still the most expensive well roland schlusel sorry not the most expensive roland schlusel believes it will become the most expensive um, in the foreseeable and it is logical Angela's there as well she Sheila in Dorset you can do it just make sure you're checking out your baskets maker in Surrey joining us as well it's gonna be an on-screen sellout for sure so I'll keep you posted on that one. Oh. oh, I told you today was awesome has it lived up was it you know oh, you, yeah it's, yeah, still, it's it, lived up to expectations has it and Yvonne we're still not done I know just looking at your desk over there it's I know. Just, and, well, and mine as well I know. it's just unbelievable there's still so much to bring you okay that's what's exciting about the jadeite worlds is there's so many different routes that you can go to to, to yeah, sort of talk about absolutely. this absolutely absolutely the history the beliefs um the beliefs of this amazing lovely, gemstone it's lovely that we can all learn together as well isn't it i mean yeah. you, you do a lot of hard work to bring us this information but it's all very informative for all of us and it's vital we know yes i want to we the next opportunity is your deal of the day but the reality is we've just bought your whole selection of dealer days starting with your pearls mm -hmm. in the last hour yep um remind me producer neary how many have we got <gasps> That's insane. Seriously. 
Okay, okay. We have 150 opportunities. Um, I'm very surprised that this auction opportunity is not happening without Dave, to be honest. We have never brought you the Black Series, which is natural again, in this size previously before. And there's 150 opportunities. Oh, wow. I want to show you a few pieces uh, in a few moments' time that are on first dibs, which you can sell on, by the way. You do have to go through a process where they verify you as a seller, oh, do which you? is fine. As nothing, you you know you know everything about your gemstones. You know that you know that this is totally natural. You know that it's been Gem Lab certified, so you've got nothing to hide. So I encourage you to approach first dibs, yeah. especially as a business. Anyway, especially when you see your deal of the day. Thank you. Okay, now this is one for the collectors and the connoisseurs, most definitely. Um, I'm going to obviously get the housekeeping out of the way where there's 150 opportunities, but people won't just buy one. We'd be daft not to, to be honest. We've Absolutely. never done this size before. And it, I mean, I don't want to wish summer away, but autumn is approaching yeah. and it's a beautiful autumn. There's something color. just really yeah. sumptuous yeah, about absolutely. your black series. More so, I love black jade, don't mm -hmm. get me wrong, which is like that piano black, as we call it here in the West. Yeah. They call it imperial, yeah. um, in the um, imperial black in the East. So we call it piano, quite like to romanticize it. But actually you get shades in before that. So if you imagine like a transition, you start, and I don't know if it's exactly in this order, but if you can imagine you're a boulder of jade, yeah. you formed over millions of years, um, very rare ge uh, geological conditions, movements of tectonic plates, and basically um, the ocean crust plummeting down to the through through to the Earth's mantle. That's when jadeite forms. That's me being very basic about it, but ge geologically it's incredibly rare. So that's why. Thank goodness, actually, we don't want tectonic plates to move that much. No, we don't. Um, anyway, <laughs> but that's how this gemstone actually forms. But imagine that's happened, and then you have to invest multiple millions of years. So transitioning thro from the greens, the whites, yeah. no particular order, the yellows, mm -hmm. the reds, the imperial greens, and eventually to your black series, where you start as almost like a lavender, yeah. if there's vanadia present, and then you might go through the soft greys to the darker sort of chicken skin, not romantic, I know, but that's what they refer <laughs> to it as, to the omphacite blacks. This is the greatest investment of time, and also the new, new newest generation of China, they're the one that they want the most mm -hmm. the most fashionable so never mind the rarity or the price this is the most on demand you've got the likes of cartier working with it right yeah. now you've got asprey's working with it right now so i want to show you a few things um talk to you about the black series sorry back to where we started no remember the numbers cool thanks I want to show you a piece of jewellery that's on first dibs. Thank you. Thank you. This piece is an 850 carat jade bead necklace highlighted with lavender, which you've just had, soft greens, which you've just seen, yep. black and grey, £11,811 on first dibs as we speak. 11000 That's a lot of money. It is a lot of money. And they say there are two, um, there are two cert certificates indicating the jade beads are natural. You also have that. Untreated and unenhanced. The round bead shifts from greyish colour under strong light or sunlight to black in normal light. Yeah. Yours will do exactly the same. Let's flick through because we can get closer to that same piece of jewellery. See what I mean? Under strong light, up close, you can see that really deep you can. black. It's then because you can just see in the distance there the lavender colour. Moving forward, um, there it is on the neckline. Now, granted, these are big. They are big that stones. Big. Yeah. But I don't know about you. You wouldn't be able to wear that every day, would you? I wouldn't wear that at all because uh, I'm not very big. <laughs> that's, I mean, it's a very, very, very big statement piece of jewellery. The carvings of the lavender, which are absolutely beautiful. 
um, and you've got the greenish colors in there as well but that's the eleven thousand pound necklace can you see they're definitely what i would describe as like a cashmere sort of like a dove gray moving forward you've got there it is again up close can you see the shades the shades of gray how it bleed uh, blends into the beautiful yes. black there as well stunning absolutely stunning moving forward there it is again under a different line you can see those definite shades of gray yes. the black series like i said it's not just piano black or imperial black as they call it in the east it's the shades of gray that yeah. first dibs are highlighting there it is another angle you can see those beautiful absolutely beautiful tones eleven thousand seven hundred and seventy nine pounds that's with 20 percent off which is Ooh. very very generous okay so again skipping forward there is how about just some smaller beads smaller beads there that are more of a jet black i would say even those for what is it six seven eight beads natural black jadeite 12 mils be by the garden okay so we're twist on the on the elsa peretti saying um 2374 pounds especially with your early bird could you make that we could make that couldn't we yes and we could do so quite affordably okay flicking forwards Bernard says, there are two types of black jade, both rare and valuable. You've got, whilst not romantically described, you've got the burnt chicken skin variety is black and opaque and the omphacite black, um, which is the rarest of all. That's the darkest of the color, mm -hmm. which when you put a light source to it, it turns, <coughs> um, it turns completely, uh, completely green. Let's look at these carvings. The enclosed carving is the closest I've found to this rough. And by the way, this rough is the parcel that you're seeing for your deal of the day. Um, don't get too excited as we don't know how it will carve yet. But if we can produce smaller series for you, it will be possibly the most ex exciting partnership to date. And you can see important certified natural ICJ decoration black bears. Can you see them? Literally catching this, the salmon. How beautiful Look is at that? that. It's um, gorgeous. Yvonne, yes. £375,000, please, mm. if you want that. Ooh, it's not an everyday purchase. No, you... <laughs> no, no. It's the rarity of the jade. Yeah. What about this then? A blue, grey, Guan Ying jadeite carving. 8,125 US dollars. How about this lovely oh, elephant? Lovely elephant. Bluish grey jade carving of an elephant. The estimate, by the way, is either is between six hundred and forty thousand Hong US dollars, sorry, sorry, to a million. I don't know what it sold at. That's a very special elephant. It's the rarest of the colours. Without further ado, jewelry makers, I think we need to make your Black Series brand new premiere opportunity jadeite strand available. We've never done this size before. The reason why we show you all those pieces, I can't compare this with the elephant. I can't. I can compare the colour, <laughs> but I can't compare the carving or the bears that no, you saw earlier no. on. I can start comparing when we look at the jewellery, can't we? Because yes, you could make course. those. Yeah, I know they're different sizes, but can you see those same tones that first dibs were highlighting in that necklace? Showing you in different light, lighting conditions, the darker colours, yeah. the blend of those beautiful greys, the soft cashmeres. They're showing it on white gloves, black gloves, showing it on yeah. a darker background every single lighting condition so you can appreciate the rarity of the jadeite is theirs natural absolutely is yours 100 percent totally and utterly natural literally the first time we've seen it i love that piece on first dibs i don't have eleven thousand pounds sadly i will be able to afford the dealer day today and actually eight mil much more wearable definitely i i would um, i think i'd ombre those Oh, nice. I think it will look really pretty. That would pretty be lovely. Raised, would yeah. you go with some of the lavender that we had earlier yes. and just put those in yeah, there too? Yeah, that would be nice too, wouldn't it? Now, we've got 150. We are going to do some. This is like a Saturday deal of the day, to be honest. You know, at the beginning of the show, I was going, this is one of the best shows ever. Yeah. Best shows ever. This is like a weekend deal of the day. where hasn't we know let we you have down, deal. has it? No. <laughs> it's been absolutely awesome from start to finish, and we've still got more to bring you. We generally we've got the most we've got lovely projects in the master class we've got more we've got those amazing alhambra amber pieces on the desk as well but this deal of the day could absolutely absolutely be a saturday deal of the day auction opportunity it's brand new in its premiering today and already immediately we've got regular collectors who say i trust jewelry maker i know a it's the it, you know it is what they say it is 
We need to see you there though, says Neary in my ear. He's like, listen, I get it, mid-morning. Sometimes we have a little bit of a mid-morning lull. Mm -hmm. We get that. And we are bringing you your deal of the day a little bit later. It's basically been two hours of deal of the days, basically, back to back, <laughs> yeah. basically. And I appreciate, it's probably been a lot. I've barraged you for two hours, haven't I? I know this. But I'm gonna need, I'm gonna call to action. We wanna see you there because we have 150. What we need to do, jewelry makers, is make sure that we don't melt the phone lines, crash the website, because then nobody's popular. We are going to, I promise, for the oldest variety of jade in the world, i.e. The, the longest time to yeah. achieve the colour, the best possible price. Yeah, we had the 6 mil. I was with Dave when he launched the 6 mil. If you're one of those people that is lucky enough to say that you own the six mil, text in your feedback. I agree. I think there's going to be collectors who got the six mil who are going to be coming back for the eight for mil, the eight maybe mil, looking yeah. for that over the head rope necklace, knotting it all the way through. Text in, do you own the Black Series? There is something very, I don't know, mystical about the Black Series. It's not just a solid black, and I love that. How, smoky. Yeah, it is smoky. Yeah. That's the perfect description, yeah. Yvonne. Now, we're at £399, but that is not where we're stopping. But please, please, please help us here in the studio, because part of our, well, I say our, Tom's job is to make sure that we don't flood the phone lines all at once and our call centre go a little bit crazy and we melt the phone lines and we melt the web and we crush the app. We don't <laughs> want to do that. We've got 150 opportunities. Oh, it's happened. We've all done it. We have all done it. Um, so I'm going to ask to see your names there. If you're interested... And you're, and you're thinking, okay, I'm interested, but I'm not really sure about it. It depends on the price, Al. So that's a fair statement. That's fair. I get that. Much of my, all of my purchases are all based on, okay, well, it depends on the price point, Al. I get that. So it's an unusual thing for, for a retailer to go, I tell you what, I tell you what, come into the shop. I won't tell you the price just yet, but I promise you it'll be good. Yeah, I get, I get it's an unusual dynamic, but let's see you there. But we're about to take hundreds of pounds off that price tag. Massive chunk. Not just 10%, not even 20%. £199. Hello, Linda saying this is... I own the Black Series Jade. I, it's stunning. I call it my black magic. Oh. It is. There's something definitely magical yeah. about it. Yeah. And it is. Maybe Good that's call. why First Dibs took it in so many different fo uh, lighting conditions. Even down to the colour of the gloves that they wore in that photograph. Mm -hmm. At £11,779. We've beat that price tag. Hi, Mariska. Mariska got the six mils of the Black Series as well. This is the first time that we're bringing it to you in the eight mils, Mariska, as well. Um, and she says it's so beautiful. 30 seconds and we are not done. I'll be honest, there's not nearly enough of you on the phone line to, for us to take it to the price that we want to. I'll be honest. Would you agree, Neary? Well, there's not nearly enough people right now, though. No, we can't go to the price that we want to take it to because we're not seeing enough names. This is how shopping TV works. If we can see enough of you there, then we can reduce that price even further because obviously it's all down to how many sell in that one auction. Let's take a chunk off that price tag just to show you that we have the intention. Now, we wanted to bring you the eight mil, bearing in mind they're bigger than the six, obviously bigger than the six mil. We wanted to bring these at 149, but we have got a big quantity. Bigger the quantity, lower the price. You're at 10% you're at of the first dibs price now, aren't you? Is that right? Roundabouts, there or thereabouts. Yes. And it's not where we're stopping.
Okay, hold up. Is Wayne still in there? Hiya, Wayne. Uh, can, can, I, can we be honest? No. There's the, the, the reaction, I'm not, I'm, I'm surprised. I'll be honest, it's what, I do get that I have brought you literally a deal of the day after a deal of the day into another deal of the day. I do get that. I do get that. However, shopping TV works differently to a retailer. So basically, the price is the price and you might be able to get a cheeky, if you're cheeky, and go mm. into a jewel and say, oh, can you knock a bit off? They might do. You've got to be brave to try that though, haven't you? You have. Because what do you do if they say no? <laughs> yeah, okay. It's a bit awkward, isn't it? Yeah, it's very. Shopping TV is very different, and they will have one if they're lucky. If they're lucky. We're bringing you the oldest colour of jade dye in the world that's totally natural. And again, we've spoken about the shades. We've shown you examples of where it is elsewhere. And it is those kind of places that you're going to be able to find place, uh, um, the greys. Yeah. But we've got 150 and we want 150 or rather the bulk of that quantity to go in one auction. If we do, then we can work on a much lower price point. Yeah. If we don't, then obviously we've got to do more airtime. Does that make sense? And that's expensive. So we've got to hold it at a higher price. So it's a two way thing. So the reason why I'm saying all this, has my call screen, yeah, my call screen's frozen. I want to see you there. You've got to show our Neary, he's been really needy, and Wayne. If you want the best possible deal of the day price tag, you've got to show him that you're there. And then he can work out the best deal. Currently where we are, 60 seconds, you've got 60 seconds to join us on the phone line, 60 seconds to join us on the web. Um, yeah, even if you don't check out your baskets, mm -hmm. the more of you that are there showing the interest in this amazing opportunity um, with the intent of owning one of the rarest colours, one of the most yet yeah, magical, I think you've hit the nail on the head. Can you see the Onphasite one just coming through here with that dark green? Because technically, remember, black jadeite is not black. It's actually a very dark, inky green colour because once upon a time, it was imperial green. Um, you've got all those beautiful, kind of <coughs> moody sky colours running through it as well there you all are lovely jewelry makers my call screen had actually frozen so i can see you there i can see people adding multiples to their baskets too the more of you that are there the lower the price tag can be we've got 150 of these available well you can add me to that list as well because i think that was some white pearls literally knotted i'm inspired by that amazing necklace that we saw on first dibs Literally knotted. I haven't got eleven thousand seven hundred and seventy-seven seventy-nine pounds. Might be able to stretch this next next price drop though. I can definitely do forty-nine pounds and sixty-six pence yeah. a month, yeah. Because I don't even pay interest on that. Today you are getting certified natural black series eight millimeter type a jadeites in a full 38 centimeter strand the first time ever bringing it to you in this size and doing so at under 100 pounds did we show anywhere um bringing you the beautiful colors of gray those smoky moody grays at anywhere near double figures do you show it anywhere at three figures actually yeah anywhere at yeah there was there was one necklace that was in the four figures Non that one none three though was there none three, none three no. no which had literally a couple of feature beads yeah two thousand three hundred and seventy four pounds i actually like that that's I like my that style too. i like the style and it's easy to create yeah super easy to create how Get many could you bird. make of those out of your strands? a lot <laughs> an awful lot a lot yeah and matching earrings probably as well yeah. um merseyside well done dorothy susan's got three margaret in littlehampton deborah's got two senga london rupal justin uh pauline colleen marishka marie julie christine maker alan tina london nottinghamshire congratulations make sure you're checking out your baskets there is a bit of a queue forming on the phone lines as we kind finally woken up to the idea of like, seriously we should not be bringing you this amazing gemstone at anywhere near double figures it's taken millions of years to achieve this natural color and the only way to produce that you can't heat treat it to actually achieve a darker color 
it has to be millions of years. I don't know about you, I haven't got millions of years spare. Cardiff, you can do it. West Sussex, you can do it. Pauline, you can do it. Colleen, you can do it. Um, congratulations, everybody. We had 150. It's a brand new premiere. Massive quantity. First time ever at your classic eight mils. The techniques that Yvonne showed earlier on, I think would be absolutely amazing. Yeah, not it really would. I, I just love those tones, don't you? They're yeah. just so calm. I think they're very calming. Yeah, they are soothing. Yeah. Grey's yeah. a lovely very colour. Very soothing, yes. I think you should come out, Wayne, and say all this. Because, like, he's... A, I'm only going to be repeating you. Show off... I've got to show off my tan. What do you mean, show off your tan? Where is your tan? Oh. I'm only joking. Look at the colour of him! Oh. Look at you! He's back! <laughs> Wonder returns. Oh, you no. haven't got another holiday plan now, have you? I have. <laughs> yeah. Well, with my daughter's twenty-first, so. Oh, is it? Yeah, twenty-four. Where are you off to next? America. Nice. Oh, very nice. Yeah. Um, Wayne. Hi guys. This is the biggest quantity mm -hmm. of Black Series we've ever done. I'm not gonna lie. Dave should have been on with it, but he's cancelled the show, which is fine. So we've gone ahead with it anyway. Okay. Because we've gone rogue. Got, you know, he's it'd be on with you tomorrow. So. But so the six mil went to. 79.99 so 99.99 is the price for this yeah yeah because they're eight mil but i bought more oh so i've got them a little bit cheaper so give me a minute get on the lines i want to sell them all today i can't do much but, we'll do but there's a bit of wiggle a little a little not much uh, and we've only ever done four strands of black series really is four, that right so, so so we did a meter strand six mil mm. a 38 centimeter six mil and now the eight mil and then yesterday we did the bamboo bracelet. The ba How much is the bamboo? Yesterday? Yeah. Uh, no, the day for yesterday. Sorry, day for yesterday. I was going to say, hang on, I was here yeah. yesterday. I didn't <laughs> I don't see that. I don't remember that. <laughs> How much was that? That was £100, pay, wasn't it? Just for the... For the bamboo strand? Unbelievable. We're at 99 purely because of the quantity, says Wayne. Purely because of the quantity. Should this be lower? No. Because they're bigger. <laughs> they're the bigger carrot weight. What logic is this? And that's what's unique about us as a channel. Well done, everybody. Congratulations to those of you that have already secured yours. It is a beautiful, soothing, soft cashmere grey, but the reality is you get shades. That's the black series, the same that you saw on your first dibs necklace. I know they're different sizes, um, but that's right, what the closest near, we can see. Oh, do you hear that? No, but look at this that we did two days ago. Right. And that sold for 99.99. That's gorgeous. Yeah, it is gorgeous. I'm trying to get it over so you can play the last four, but. So that was 99. So you're telling me a 38 centimetre strand? Which you could make two of. Exactly. So I come can... on. Come on, maker, Colleen, Mary, Julie, Christine, maker, <laughs> Alan, <laughs> Tina, maker, maker, Susan. You need to press one, people. Come on. Yeah. My first auction back. Come on, let's He's say back. it. <laughs> yeah, he hasn't 151. changed. 151 we had. I want them all to go today at an incredible price. It's on split pay. It's on a free way split pay. Well, you what? know it's too low. Yeah. You know it's too low if it's on Dave's the free way. Dave's on next door, so he doesn't need to know about it. So we'll get it on. We'll get it off. Happy days. Are you mad? Black Jadeite. That's low, bonkers, crazy. Got mine. Thank you. I think. Good. Yeah. Come on, people. More, more, more. Yeah, we are I'm mad. I'm taking a little bit off. It is. I'm going to I'm gonna say it. I'm going to match the price of the six mil. <gasps> today, today, oh, only because we got the biggest quantity we've ever done in Black Series. Four lines ever in jewellery making history. That's I, crazy. Yeah, it's good. It's crazy. Oh, yeah. Probably yeah. as rare as the lavenders, actually. Yeah, would you is. say? Yeah. Um, can you imagine this team with that lavender strand that you have previously? Oh. Wayne's still on um, Cape Verde climate. He's just oh, dithering yeah. here in the you're studio. Like you're North Pole. It's <laughs> yeah. Let me look. Let me back. I'm not. I'm, a, I'm a certain I'm age rushing. now, Wayne. We get hot. <laughs> uh, 99 pounds and 99 pence only, but we are going lower. If there's enough of you, and it's all down to Wayne. There's 17 baskets, Elf. No good in baskets. Come on. One more minute, and I'm gonna do it. Yeah. Come on. Okay. Can we, just show, can we show the names? Yeah. Can we show them that. Let's do it. Off the screen. Yeah. People that need to press one, come on, people. So if you are Murtha, 
Jane in Devon, Maker, Lorna, Caroline, uh, West Sussex, Colleen, Mariska, Marie, Julie, Christine, Maker, Alan, Nottinghamshire. It is chilly if you Ooh. want to turn that off. Actually. <laughs> um, make sure Christine is joining us. Dorothy in Merseyside is joining us as well. Um, we can see you there, but is there enough, Wayne? No. No, no. There is a nothing basket, but they're not pressing one out. Uh, we need to press one, press one. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, well, that's okay, so bye. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good, it's all, right. all good. Yeah, come here, look it up. There you go, here. there you go, lovely jewelry People makers. People buying fours, buying twos, yeah, baby. Well, Susan's <laughs> not daft, is she? Nor Deborah, nor Dorothy. I'd be multi buying because this should have been one four nine. Yeah, should have been one four nine. We had loads of deals today, haven't we? Oh, it's been unbelievable. I'm going to need a little lie down when yeah, I go back you after, will. after today's show. Unbelievable. Should have been closing one four nine. No, ninety nine. No. Right. There is a lot of people there, so let's do eighty nine, ninety nine. 89.99 and give me another minute. Yeah, I was going to say. Yeah, 89, because they're still not pressing one, so uh, show you how crazy it is. Mm. Take a tenner off and then we're going to go again. Well, as Caroline said, we are, it's, it's the tan. Woo! Just your teeth. Yeah. Just, <laughs> <laughs> just see your teeth. Woo! Oh, you, so. That will, yeah. yeah. Go and see the baby turtles. I've got arms, but yeah, we are. Um, Oh, that's what we want to oh, do. Oh, I'd love to see that. That's amazing. Yeah. yeah, it's like a really short window where you can see the baby turtles. Oh, anyway, know. digress. Yeah, Have you, talk yeah, to, talk to me after. Come on, Elaine, Patricia, Christine, Maker, Maker, Lorna, Lorna, Caroline, Carlene, Julie, Christine, Maker, Alan, woo! People up in their quantities oh, as yeah. well. Are you ready, people? Ready. My first deal back is going to be big. Are you ready? It's going to be bad. Oh. Yeah. You've said it, Wayne. I'm scared. You've committed. 79.99 is your price for 8 mil series. Black One series. time only. Four wow. shoes in the whole of the continent. Yeah. Two of them sold out. Yeah, yeah. So you got so this one here. I love that. There's four left. I've, I've ordered it over. It should be here by now. I love there's that. There's only four of them left. So really, this is the only way you can get black series. I want to buy this one of them. So, yeah, but come on. I've asked Bernard to get me more in different gemstones because he won't be able to get it in that. that in, in, in the grey. Yeah, it's I'm the rarity of the grey. Yeah. We're talking about the bamboo one. They're that, massive. They're amazing. You could make that they're, bracelet times two. two. They should be £100 just for the yes. two bamboos in the middle. That is crazy. Seriously? Ah, oh, you could make that yourself. It's really makers. lovely, isn't it? Love it. And do you know what bamboo symbol symbolises? The no, perfect God. gentleman. Does it really? Yeah, so it would be a lovely gift for, for, yeah, for many beyond, in your life. Yeah, that is quite, a, a, it could be a very masculine yeah, piece. Yeah, that's that, what I was thinking. It? I'd be making it though if I miss out on that opportunity. Rupal, you've got two. Margaret's got three. Dorothy's got four. Lorna's got two. Susan's got four. Julian Dynaway's got two. Brenda and Annette and Patricia and Valentina. And Heather and Christine and Valerie and Jane and Lorna and Susan and Anne and Pauline uh, and Fun Me and Justin and new uh, new customers and Jane and Elaine and Mirtha and Caroline and Maker and Colleen, Mariska and Marie and Julie, all around the UK, up and down and around the world. Uh, make sure you're checking out your baskets. The only reason we took it to that price is simply because Wayne managed to get hold of 150 of these um, and. I'll be honest, you were driving a tough bargain. So he's taken it to an irreplaceable price tag. Look at your split pay, £26 and 66 pence only. So basically Wayne was meant, not Wayne, Dave was meant to be on air, but unfortunately I think he's double booked us with Gemporia. Oh, uh, okay. So he had to, there's a two minute queue on the phone line. So bear with our amazing call center team. They are fantastic. Go onto the app, eh? Yeah, go onto the app, tap the app. Yeah, I don't tell you to I download it. Yeah, and me, and me. How many? 40 of you still have it in your basket. So, um, and you've got to re remember that people can buy two. So all of a sudden 40 becomes 20 people. Like Justin, who's just got two. Like Julie, who's just got two. Like Rupal, who's just got two. Um, look at your split pay, you know it's crazy low. Good luck Maker, good luck Monica, good luck to you Durham, good luck to you Maurice, make sure you're checking out. There's a little queue on the phone lines, but our call centre are amazing. Tap the app, yes, on all the W's at, um, at jewelrymaker.com.
Hmm. Well done to each and every single one of you. Those soft cashmere greys. If you want, pop on to first dibs, 11,001. Yes. What was it, 11,000 <laughs> something? Um, or you can, yeah, it's smaller. Yeah, these are smaller. I, draw, I prefer the smaller though. I mean, I would, you, how often can you wear those? Yeah, not very often, can you? They're, they're, you know, not, they're lovely. Not looking at they're the very big. The picture of the lady wearing them. That's yeah. Not, as you said, it's not every day. You know it's low, lower than we should be because you've got three-way split pay too as well, wow. don't you? You know it's far, far lower. £26. £26.66. And and You're not going to get charged huge interest on that. That's 0% interest. Well done, everybody. So, yeah, get it home. It's about owning gemstones like this. Four lines in the entirety of our 14-year history. Amazing jewellery makers. These also would go beautifully with the pearls that are coming up in the 12 o'clock hour. Oh, yes, hour. they would. He's back. You're right, Wayne. Can't do no more than that. There is about 40 left. There's about 80 in basket, so we're going to do a mince close because that is crazy. Yeah, it really is. And if it comes on again, it could go higher. It could go back up because we can't get it, and that was just bonkers. Just crazy. Have so. you just uh, yeah, um, realised? Yeah, retract next time. Back up to 99 tomorrow, so get it today. And go back up to 99. So. One time yeah. offer. Which is still insane. It's insane. insane. Absolutely. And I'll pay for some heating. Just turn the fan off. Oh, is it the fan? Yeah. <laughs> we haven't got air con at the moment. It's broken. Still? It's still broken because we Ooh. keep we keep doing deals like this way. You can't afford to pay the heat. No. <laughs> oh, can't. The air if we keep doing silly low deals like yeah. this. It's still coming. It's still I know. Fine. Well, it's fine air. well, literally tomorrow, if you try and find this, it's going to be probably uh, higher. Embargoing it. Are you embargoing yeah, it? Don't embargo it for a couple of weeks. Okay. There you go. Oh. So you're not going to be able to get it. Maybe longer. Oh. So someone begs me for it. That, that, well, yeah. I can't, can we just show that before we go how many are still in baskets? Yeah, I know. Um, it is too weighty. Is there an issue? Is there a tissue? Is there an <laughs> 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 issue? <laughs> 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 oh, 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 my goodness me. Is there an issue with checking out? Because it's very heavily weighted. Yeah, that's true. Very, very, very heavily I weighted. I still think there is a minute or two queue. Is the there? Idea. On the phone lines? I say how insane these are. They're amazing, aren't they? I like these. Absolutely the amazing. Launch them on Saturday. They are incredible. Team it with. Oh, look at that. The detail in that is, in the detail in that is incredible. We're talking about the beautiful. Oh, I can't wait to see that. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Come on. Just this little. That is like one of the best carvings you've ever seen. It is amazing. Oh, I absolutely love word. it. I love it, love it, love it. Don't Launch. they go beautifully mm -hmm. together? Stunning. Made, made for each other. They are. And we I launched these literally on Saturday. Literally on Saturday. We're going to bring these to you also. Thanks, Wayne. No worries. Should we do it as a star buy? Go and get warm. <laughs> oh, my goodness me. Um, oh, the I think you think lions, then we all think about the kings, don't yeah. we? Um, widely referred to as the king of the jungle, even though they don't live necessarily in no, jungles. They don't, no, um, absolutely they do. Absolutely They are beautiful. magnificent creatures, though. They really are. And I'm totally and utterly with Wayne on these. The detail of the carvings, and we've got them in the different colours. They were only launched on Saturday, so we're going to repeat them today, is insane. It was a deal of the day, and now it's just star by. So um, I joined you on Saturday. Um, it was my usual show, but I got the opportunity. Wayne reached out, text said, uh, do you, can you do Saturday? So we've got the most amazing carvings, some of the best carvings we've ever seen, if not the best. And, I, and one of the things that I spoke about was the fact that I love the fact you get Guan Yin, you get your Buddhas, you get your mm -hmm. Pixus, you get um, the Lotus Flower, you get that wonderful J uh, um, Chinese influence. Yes of course because it's the chinese that carve this gemstone but this is actually global because when we think about lines and the meanings of lines they yeah. are they are literally around the world 
So take a look at this beautiful chap and I will read you the presentation um, sort of at, that we brought to you on Saturday. So um, the lion is one of the most oh, top of mind animals, a majestic creature that fascinates and captures imagination. From childhood years rooting for Simba in The Lion King to being a prominent figure of all sorts of designs and artwork, the lion is a constant fixture of our, um, our imaginations. But why do people love this animal so much? What does a lion symbolize and what can we learn from it? They are a symbol of family. Lions are the only felines that cohabitate as a group, um, of course, called pride a pride can be anything between um from two lions up to 40 lions of course whether it's biological or found family let the lion serve as a token for those you hold most dear wear a lion emblem regularly to remind yourself of whom you want to protect and who you work hard for so that you can stay motivated through challenging situations so they are a symbol of family they are also a symbol of courage and strength i think that's the most obvious i'm not going to read all of this because obviously we are recapping um but lions are the second largest cat in the world what's the largest what's the largest cat in the world tiger. is it a tiger a tiger's bigger than a lion um roles as hunters and defendants they can run up to 50 miles per hour that's crazy isn't it oh. <laughs> and leap up to 36 000, uh, sorry 36 feet, not 36,000. <laughs> um, they are a symbol of equality. I like this. Uh, male and female lions have different but equ equally important roles in the pride. Male lions are the protectors. They mark their pride's territory, scare off potential intruders and defend the area from animals who enter their turf. On the other hand, the female lions are the leaders and hunters. They are typically smaller and more agile than male lions, so they work together to capture prey. The food is then divided and shared in, uh, by the group according to the pecking order. So again, about equality, and I love that, the, 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 the lion symbol, sim, this, this pendant symbolizes equality as well. Patience. This is something I definitely need to remind myself with. Uh, female lions have perfect, perfected and sophisticated strategy of hunting prey, leveraging on the strength in numbers and the element of surprise. On days when you're itching for the need for speed, be grounded in the lion's patience. Add a touch um, of lion to your attire to remind you that all good things take time. It also reminds you of intelligence. Um, lion accessories can be a fashionable way to promote, promote communication and level headedness. Accentuate your office attire with a lion pendant to help you feel ready to face those tough decisions and complex challenges. Now, we launched this on Saturday and we actually had them in a few different colors. They absolutely flew on Saturday and we've got the last remaining quantity for you all. I should point out as well, again, if I show you the reverse, they are very cleverly carved in amongst this beautiful mane. Seems... Do you know, the, the multicolors on there, they really, really uh, highlight the carving, don't they? They highlight his mane, don't they? Yeah, it's really fantastic. Most likely to be the last chance that I'll be able to bring this one to air. There's one photograph in that presentation where you've just got a real nice close-up of a lion's head and his gorgeous mane. That, you know, yeah, oh, look at look him. At he's, he's a handsome devil, isn't he? <laughs> I mean, I don't know, I almost want to boop his nose, but I don't. Boop. Look Reminds at him. Of, they remind you of your own cat at home, though, don't they? Yeah. yeah. Amazing. Are you ready? Because this is going to be the last chance that we bring the lion pendant, the lion carving, to air. You have an amazing 185 carats in a 50 to 52 millimeter solid type A black series jadeite carving. It is per perfect to go alongside the Black Series strand that we had a few moments ago. In fact, I'm going to hold them together. It's incredible the way they go together, isn't it? Because it's even like the colours, yeah. literally, it leads perfect. beautifully into the strand. Look at That's that. That's lovely. Hi, Sheila. I managed to get the pale green lion head on Saturday and it is fabulous. Have you got it already? Wow. I was so, uh, so was so hoping you would still have the old neck. We'll have a little look, Sheila, in the break. I'll see if I can load it up by um, by the code if we haven't got it. Um, we'll, have, we'll have a little look at that. 
Good luck, everybody. This lion's head pendant is available. I know that I haven't got... I know that I haven't got many of these available. So you will need to be quite quick checking out your baskets. We'll have a little look into that for you, Sheila, as well. Oh, 0800 655. Totally natural. You've got your beautiful black series in a carved lion. The first time that we have ever, ever actually had the lion like so. And we're already at £499. Um, how many do we have out of curiosity? Sorry? 20. 20 available opportunities, plus you've got your split pay there as well. So how do you think about it? You think about the savings that you've just made on the Black Series strand. Do you know if I'd got that uh, that strand, I would definitely have to have the lion yeah. to go with it. it. They are just a pair made in heaven, aren't they? Yeah. There's 16. Jane's got two. Well done, Jane. They're amazing, aren't they? A universal symbol, the lion. Courage, strength, patience, family. The, uh, I, I can never get over the artistry and the, the talent people have making those. Even down to the wrinkles where he's snarling. Know, yeah. You know? Uh, you know when lions roar and they have that little wrinkle in their <laughs> nose? Yeah. Even down to that detail. I love that. I don't know if that's a, a real picture or not, but it's incredible, isn't it? I know the back... <laughs> the background's not real. I don't know. I mean, I, I just like the one that's just having a little wash. Yeah. Don't worry. What you're looking at, don't care. I'm having a bath. <laughs> you keep the look out. <laughs> yeah. Let's match that launch price for you, jewellery makers. We only had 50 of these ever commissioned. 50 in the world, so they're incredibly exclusive. At £149 only. Um, it is Taipei, Black Series, Burmese Jadeite. Um, it's unbelievable. It's huge. Yeah, you've got 52 millimetres, all carved by hand. It's quite thick too, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Look at that. If you, if you were, like, let's do some maths here. You can get hold of the strand and the 185 carat carving, which is done by hand, for what, 200 and, 230 pounds. Do you think if you were to sell this piece, well, in fact, I'm not even gonna ask the questions. You're not gonna be selling it for 230 pounds. <laughs> I wouldn't be selling it no, at all. Though, no, no, that's honest. it, that's the thing. <laughs> The, yeah, I yes, agree. Neil yeah. just said the real question we should be asking: Would this look out of place on first dibs? Nope. Not at all. Nope. Not at all. We've shown you pieces. Would this look out of place on Christie's or Sotheby's or Bonhams? No. Not at all. That's the places, the establishments that you're going to be going to get hold of of of, of Black Series. You've got to check out though, Maker Pauline Cumbria, Sheila in Dorset. This is a recap from your Saturday morning deal of the day. We only have ever had 50 in the world. And it is unusual. Um, you know, I love the Eastern influence to all your carvings. I love that. And that's obviously what they're going to do first because it's the Chinese that actually do carve jadeite. We have no knowledge of that. We can cut gemstones, we can facet, Absolutely. but it's a very different story yeah. to carving. Um, but we actually approached them and said, is there any chance you could actually do lions? So that's because on Saturday, it was actually International Lion Day. Oh, we commissioned those, did we? Yes. Ah. Yeah, we approached the Oh, so there artist. aren't going to be anywhere else other than here? No, I don't think so. No. I don't. Th in fact, I researched that, Yvonne. I don't think I found any. The only places we found, I don't know if we can show that, Neary, um, the carvings. This is what I did find yeah. in lions. And you can find artwork, can't you? Posters and things like that. The, the lion carvings, I think they were like ceramic or bronze. They were like, there was, I think there was one lion pendant that was much, much, much smaller um, in its size. Yeah, but none of which were anywhere near 149 pounds, no. even the ceramic pieces. Oh, there was one like, kind of, it wasn't bronze, but um, 
it wasn't bronze but it was kind of like a sculpture that you put on the wall oh yeah um had a bronze effect i yeah. think yeah. and that was 300 pounds wow. you're talking about black series type a burmese exactly. jade yeah. uh, and not an unsubstantial one either no. how amazing is that seven left you can do it but it's getting very very limited i don't think these are going to see another I mean, show it's an easy makers. make as well you can see the drill hole on the picture I yeah mean, just re not you could knock the necklace the the gems that you've just had on and uh, and attach that in the center oh that, that's pretty too if you wanted to mix it up with the yeah. lavenders you could yeah. do that too 42 seconds clock to close Gupa, hello to you on the phone lines hello to you maker hello to you cumbria london's got involved i've only got six though six left one of the most exclusive carv exclusive carvings that we've actually got straight straight away taking us down to the final five opportunities highly unlikely that we're going to be able to repeat this auction opportunity look at that detailing from his beautiful mane to the shape of his nose, that perfect lion shape, to the wrinkles of the nose as he <laughs> snarls, um, to the detail in the, in the teeth. If a lion can be cute, he's, he's he is cute. cute isn't he? Do you know they are so majestic? And you such see a these soft look in his face. Yeah, you see these um, these individuals that kind of rescue lions and things yeah, like do. that, and they form yeah. this bond. Yeah. I don't think I would ever be brave enough. No. And they go back years after, and, rem and they the animal remember, remember them. Yeah. Remember, it's them. unbelievable. Now, was it Sheila? It was Sheila. Sheila. Oh, we've got it. We have the Olmec. Did you? She says I missed. I missed the Olmec on Saturday. Hoping you can play it today, Sheila. Before we bring the graphics live, how many have we got? Okay, there is literally a few of these. You have to be really quick, Sheila. He's absolutely beautiful as well. <laughs> they're all, they're almost laughing, aren't they? <laughs> he's, a, he's beautiful. And we were talking about different lions. When you think of lions, who do you think of? Simba. Yeah, um, always Simba. Yeah, somebody was saying the Lion King. Oh, yeah. Not, uh, sorry, not, not the Lion King. Oh, he... um, lion Witch in the Wardrobe. Oh, yeah. No. And someone texted in saying about the Wizard of Oz. Oh, yeah. There's, There's quite lots a few when you think about is, it. Yeah. Beautiful. In your Olmec blue jade eye. Totally natural. Sheila, I can see you there. You have got company with Trina and also an anonymous maker. These are well done, my lovely. Sheila's got it. She's got one lion at home, but she wanted to get the Olmec one. Congratulations, not leaving anything to chance. It's absolutely beautiful. Again, remember, Guatemalan jade eye, again, is not accessible at the moment. It's not run out. It's still, it's still available uh, gemologically, but they have discovered that ancient Mayan mask, which means that they have temporarily, hopefully, um, sort of ceased uh, mining of this, uh, this beautiful blue. At £499, yeah, we could all day long close there. But we didn't close there, did we? This should definitely be coming at a higher price tag. Look at him. Oh, oh look at that. Absolutely beautiful, isn't he? Yes. That lovely translucency you can really look see. <coughs> Obviously the Excuse depth, because it's a two-dimensional piece, uh, the depth when it comes to his nose means that the colour pools oh, and darkens. Absolutely that stunning. Is just stunning, isn't it? And again, very cleverly drilled so that you can easily uh, sort of knot this, suspend it from any of your um, amazing strands, be that jade, uh, Olmec, Guatemalan, um, or Burmese, or other. Um, 199, we took this way lower. Yes, I've just remembered I've had that light bulb moment, Neary. Because remember, this was meant to close at 299, and we took it to 199. And it had like a knock-on effect. Oh. There it is. So here's like a foo dog that we found on first dibs. 
It's literally a little stand, so not even a piece of jewellery. A foo dog is more dog and lion than it is. Oh, right. Uh, sorry, mixed, more dog and dragon than it is lion. Oh, okay. Anyway, but he's good luck anyway. Um, £2,900. Oh. It's actually really difficult to find a lion in jade. Oh. Believe me, I looked. We've got them all. Yeah, it's because they're not. True. Dawn's asked to see the lavender jade flower carving, the one that we had earlier. Sure. I can do that too, Dawn. Oh, we had some beautiful things on today. We've had some amazing carvings. Oh, it's been a fabulous show. And they are literally done by hand. Oh, How amazing look at are these? Those. Gorgeous. Elaine, you can do it. Trina, you can do it. New customers, you can do it. London, you can do it. Dawn, this was brought to you earlier on in that the hour. That one is so intricate, isn't it? I think we've got one or two of these left, yeah. and that's it. Two, there you go. There are literally two of these left. You can see that beautiful lavender colour. You've got your beautiful lotus flower, and again, the layers. You've got details of flowers and buds here as well, um, produced in layers. Um, now, I have got one more carving to bring you, but I'm just going to give you a heads up. The price we took to is very naughty. I'm hoping Wayne is not still in the gallery. <laughs> um, it did. Oh, it stole the show for the weekend. Very exciting. Um, is it? Is it? Is, yeah, yeah, it was. It was a complete crazy auction. Um, one that, Sheila, you might remember. Just saying there's a little bit of a hint there. Um, okay, make sure you check it out your baskets. It's a steal of the day. Up next. <laughs> yeah, um, I had the privilege and pleasure of joining this amazing crew on the Saturday. Um, and also it was a it was an offer that um, Wayne messaged me and said, Do you want to go? It's a really, really exciting day because we've got lions. <laughs> um, and I love lions. Um, lions in particular in jade. We've never done that before. You know, you think about all the amazing yeah. carvings that we've brought you over the years. Dragons, Circle of Heavens, Pixus, Guan Yin, Buddhas. I was just trying to think if lions feature in the Chinese calendar. Do they? I don't we know don't if they do. No, no. Because we were talking about them not having the that sort of element um, over in China. That's why they don't do um, they don't so carve they lions normally. Yes, it's not much so more maybe tigers, I suppose. Yes, exactly. Yeah, so it's not their thing, is it? The first time ever bringing you a lion as we know it, the king of the jungle, <gasps> but this auction stole the weekend. There's a reason why viewers that are watching today have got this home yeah. and already are saying, okay, I want it in the other ones. The carving's absolutely amazing. When you think about jade carvings, you think about this. This is, you know, this is the, the color that most of us immediately recognize. Beautiful apple blossom green with a hint of lavender tones, I'm gonna say it. Um, and it's all carved by hand. Don't you think as well? Remember with jade, it's about translucency, it's about color, and it's also about artistry. Um, remember, when we're talking about the crystal structure, it should look like a melting ice cube. So you should have that lovely glossy like mm, lustres and surface. It's definitely got that, hasn't it? This quality really highlights, highlights the, um, the crystal structure of the gemstone. Our graphics are live, and if you weren't able to tune in on, on Saturday, you're in for a bit of a shock, because this goes to, remind me. Did it? It goes to one of the lowest prices that you could possibly imagine for a carving, which makes no sense. We've never done lions before. No. You know when I said earlier on that the Guatemalan was meant to be 299 and we took it to 199 We did. Hi, Trina. They have carved guardian lions at the entrance of their homes in China. Oh, there you go. Oh, yes, they do. I have got a guardian lion. Yes, I have. That's a good point. Trina, mine's um, not the entrance. Mine's sort of as you leave on the wall just by the door oh, i've got a, a lion head 
it's only resin or something like that. Yeah. I don't think it was an expensive piece, but I love it. It's just like a silver lion head. Well, that sounds lovely. Yeah, it's very cool. I've had it years and years and years. Imagine being able to put a type A Burmese <laughs> jadeite lion head uh, by your entrance. Yeah. We thought, yeah, I mean, seriously, we've brought you the most incredible carvings over the past few years. 299, I remember the first dragon carving actually being brought to air. We brought you some along the way at one, uh, 249. 199 is incredible. You've got to remember this is a 145 carat type A Burmese yeah. jadeite that closed to four years ago. But remember, this was a weekend deal of the day. It stole the weekend, this auction opportunity, because I'm going to pledge it. We took it to one of the lowest prices of any jade carving. Up there. If not the, certainly up there. Mm -hmm. 14 seconds for the final how many? Nineteen. We're going to match that amazing price, that steal of the day price. Good luck, jewelry makers. Well done to those of you that have already checked out. Going even lower than, uh, even lower than what was intended. We were meant to stop at one nine nine. That was unbelievable. That was steal of the day. That's the steal of the day. Crazy. Genuinely, I know we have occasionally dipped into the double figures for your wow. jadeite carvings, but not with something of this size, not with something of this scale. Look at this. The, look at the lavender you can yeah. see there on the screen. I said that. It's definitely it's got really a lavender hue lo to yeah, it. Definitely. What do we think to that? Putting it per alongside the. Absolutely perfect. Now, already there's a queue on those phone lines. Literally, just knot it. You've got the drill hole there straight away. Uh, Alison, Jane, Doreen, Michelle, William, Maker. Um, there is a queue, but please do bear with our amazing call centre team. They are incredible and they will get to you, I promise you. £33.33 £33 on your split pay. Pretty incredible. It is. Straight down to single figures. Yeah, it's rare to see lion carvings, isn't it? I mean, we've never done it before. And I certainly couldn't find many of them I when I was doing my research. I hope we do them again. Yeah, me too. Me too. Because the meanings behind yeah, them. Remember, it's family. Lovely. Strength and courage. Yeah. Independence. And just because it's jadeite, it doesn't have to have that Asian element to it, does no. it? No, no. Well, the West has finally woken up to this beautiful yes. gemstone and all its beauty. <laughs> yes. We um, definitely have. We took a, took a while, didn't we? Only a few thousand year, thousands of years. Yes. Uh, 24 seconds and we're going to have to move on from this auction opportunity. Jewelry makers, again, congratulations to those of you that managed to be successful. We're down to the final five opportunities. Um, oh, wait, 106, 4, 6, 5. Did I mention we've got some beautiful, a beautiful masterclass coming your way? Did I mention we've got some more amazing pearls coming up with um, <laughs> with Yvonne? Did I mention also the most beautiful bumblebee connector you it could has, ever possibly yeah. imagine? Um, it is stunning. Make sure you check out your baskets and do stay where you are. Oh, Michael. He's got treasure. He has got treasure. I love that. Isn't that lovely? Coming up after the break, the final four of your bamboo bracelet that is just my cup of tea that oh uh, do you know i've never looked at bamboo the same after researching bamboo yeah. we'll talk about that you've got the amazing masterclass coming your way as well we'll see you in two after this Hi jewellery makers, Yvonne here. Just popping in to tell you that I'll be back in the studio uh, on Thursday the 15th of August with Carol, Tom and the team uh, and I'm bringing some beautiful pearls at nine o'clock. Um, I've had the luxury of um, using these. Look at the beautiful case before we even get in there. Look at these metallic multicolored pearls. How delightful are those? absolutely gorgeous so we then in the 12 o'clock hour have um, a shot plate I've had the time of my life with this um, it's got four little uh, symbols on it and they're all very generic so they this one will suit everyone it has um, two different stars on it a heart 
and a smiley little sun and I've put them all on one necklace there. I have made other pieces of jewellery but I'll show you those on Thursday. Hope you can join us. See you then. Bye. makers did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee no matter the size weight or quantity of your order how many times you check out that day we will still only charge you that single pmp keep things simple on jewelry maker Every day, our experts will bring you a wealth of knowledge. They'll take you through the steps of making projects and feature fabulous tips along the way. Whether you're new to jewellery making or a seasoned professional, you are sure to learn something new. We are live every day from 8am until 1pm and you can also watch back all of the demonstrations featured on the show on our YouTube channel. Hi everyone, I'm back on Friday the 16th of August and I have this amazing strand of faceted jadeite and I'm really excited to share it with you. I also have these amazing sterling silver panther heads. I'm really excited to be back and I can't wait to see you then. Bye! <laughs> Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Okay, lovely jewellery makers. I've still got so much to squeeze in between now and the top of the show. Okay, we've got five minutes on the final opportunities of these and then I'm going to be making my way over to lovely Yvonne for the most amazing masterclass and sort of classic white pearls. Yes, beautiful With the pearls. most incredible bee connector. Um, with his little boots on. Oh, he does look like he's wearing little boots. Now, I didn't know this was actually launched you on, what was it, Tuesday then? Yeah. Tuesday. Um, I didn't see this anyway. Um, and the moment I've just seen it today, and this is the first time, I was like, oh, yes. It's lovely. I'm not surprised it's absolutely flown out the door. Um, because it is a classic stretchy. Classic stretchy with, oh, it's a solid bamboo piece. And you know what? You can learn from bamboo, or I've learned from bamboo. And I'm going to share with you just quickly, as you make your confirmations, the graphics are going to be on your screens. We're going to match that amazing price point and the reason why there's only four of them left. But I'm going to talk to you about what the, uh, about bamboo. Um, so both in China and Japan, 
uh, Japan's cultures um, have long regarded bamboo as a defining element because it provides the means to sustain all aspects of human life, including food and shelter. Bamboo is the most popular plant in China, where it's considered a gentleman with perfect virtues. It combines upright integrity and accommodating flexibility, and it has perfect balance of grace and strength or yin and yang. Bamboo personifies the life of simplicity. Bamboo is used in every phase of, of Chinese living, um, yet it needs very little care to grow, to grow and flourish. Um, it produces neither flower nor fruit, and the hollow trunk reminds us of, of humility with an open heart free of arrogance. Bamboo is a symbol of longevity. Because of its durability, strength, flexibility, and resilience, it survives the harshest conditions, still standing tall and staying green all year round. When the storms come, bamboo bends in the wind. When the storm ceases, it resumes its upright position. Its ability to cope with adversity and still stand firmly without losing its original ground is inspirational. Its flexibility and adaptability are a lesson to us all that the secret of a long and happy Happy life, life is to go with the flow. There you go. Also, the young branches at the top of a bamboo trunk will not grow at the same angle as the older branches below. I didn't know that. Um, in order to allow sunlight for their elders. When they, the young shoots <coughs> emerge from the roots, um, they are under the shade of the older bamboo branches. Oh, wow. Such a spirit reflects that the young respecting the old as well as the old protecting the young. I That's love lovely. it. That's really lovely. I love lovely. it. And you've got all that information captured in yeah. this beautiful stretchy bracelet. I want one of these. Yeah. I'd like, do you know, I, yeah, I, I would like to buy one of these. I'd like to buy one for Tom. I thought they were two bamboos, uh, but it's it's one big one, isn't it? Yeah. In the middle. It's one big carving. Yeah, it's lovely. How gorgeous is that? I don't know what this goes to, but I'm thinking for that bamboo carving on its own. Absolutely, yeah. We would sell that as a kit, wouldn't we? Yeah. Um, it, oh, I love it. Yeah, it is. It's really lovely. That's so cool. In natural type A black series, uh, sorry, black jadeite. No enhancement whatsoever, totally natural. 30 second clock. Does this go even lower? No way. That's amazing. We take it into double figures. If there's any of these are left, come the end of this auction. Yeah, because I think it'll be a lovely gift for Tom. There's only what? Is there? Yeah, I mean, what a nice present. Then I'd give all that information. I'd write all that information down. Well, if you're going on holiday soon, wouldn't that be lovely for your husband to wear on holiday? Yeah. Really, yeah. really lovely. Yeah, Tom, well, Tom would definitely wear this cool isn't it i think it's, it can be it, it, you know it can be a masculine piece and also a feminine piece definitely. at the same time definitely would you wear that neary yeah 99 pounds and 99 pence it's just really cool i love it you're cool enough neary you could totally rock this absolutely and you're a gentleman which is what bamboo is all about there you go michael you are a gentleman Oh, no, no, not Wayne, no. <laughs> <laughs> Only joking, Wayne, no. Only joking. Yeah, you could. You could all definitely pull this one off. There's only four of them available, though, so you need to be quick checking out your baskets. I'll be definitely joining you on it. Got, plus, you got your split pay there for £25. How amazing is that? 85 carats. We could do that on its own. Wayne, that on its own, I was expecting to be £100. And then you'd have to buy the strand separately. It's it, Yeah, it's huge. Can you see the size? And the work's done for you. Perfect bamboo shape as mm -hmm. well. That's lovely. The ultimate gentleman. Uh, right, clock to close because there's only a couple of... Oh, we've got more than four, did you say? There's eight. Eight available within the vault. Susan, well done. Amanda in Glasgow, you're there. Write my name on that list as well. New customers getting involved as well. Congratulations to you. It's going to be touch and go whether I get it. Oh. Don't think it. I don't think it will be. <laughs> I don't I think so. I <laughs> beg to differ there, Nerino. 
<laughs> Don't be thinking I'm not prepared for opportunities <laughs> like this. Don't you think I'm not prepared? Clock to close, I'm joining you on it. There you go. That's a lovely little gift, that. That's great. Amazing. <laughs> Amazing. Right, we still have got, there we are. Um, we ha still have got so much to bring you between now and the yeah, top of the show, have. including the most it's amazing masterclass, of course. Um, check out, there you go, not leaving anything to chance. Um, Lorna, please do stay where you are on the phone lines. But what's this masterclass all about? Because we've got a very exciting tool as well. We have, we've got a shot plate. Right. Um, of which I've made all the silver jewellery from. So actually there's like two really exciting um, auctions. Yeah, because we've also we've got the we've got the bumblebee and the pearls and we've got a little dabbing block as well. A dabbing block. So okay. Now what is a shot plate, Yvonne? A shot plate. You put metal into a shot plate, you either uh, press it in with a press, a hydraulic press, or you can hammer it in and um, it gives you little elements to solder onto your jewellery. So kind of like, uh, gives you like imprints, like a stencil almost, I suppose. Um, it is a bit like a stencil. You, you really literally just press the metal into, into a mould, into mm -hmm. the mould, and you get your little elements pop out for you. Amazing. Now we have also been talking about the bees. Yes, Let's give you a little sneaky peek of the bees. And he looks like he's wearing um, boots. <laughs> his little honey Look. boots. <laughs> he's very cute. He is cute. He's really cute. He's wearing little boots. <laughs> How lovely is that? And again, that's a gorgeous citrine. So we've got lots of stock, uh, lots of stock opportunities with yep. this, but um, the masterclass is mainly focused um, around your shop plate. So talk us through um, your amazing jewellery there, Yvonne, that you've created for, from this masterclass. Okie doke. Well, um, we've got the necklace. Uh, actually, the necklace is a good one to look at because it shows all four symbols. Okay. And it's a really general shape because... This yeah. Okay. Uh, it, 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 they are shapes that will fit for anybody. Yeah. Everybody and anybody. They're not specific. They're not like lizards or, or whatever. Uh, they're hearts. They're stars. And one's a little sunshine with a smiley face ah. on it. <laughs> so you know, they're giving me very much Suru vibes as yeah, well. Yeah, I, I thought that that sort of looked a bit like um, festival jewelry. Um, that was the idea I was uh, I, w I was going for yeah. on that one. So basically, I put all four on that, ah, made a them. pair of studs out of the um, the little sunshines. I've made a ring out of the heart. Yeah. And I've made a pair of earrings. I love. Oh, oh, I, there's the ring. And uh, I've made a pair of earrings to match the necklace. Because um, I actually like odd earrings as well. Yeah, I do as well. I, think <laughs> I it's, really love it's very odd earrings. On trend at the moment, is it now, really? Isn't it? Yeah, no, I don't really know. I love trend. odd earrings. So, um, I mean, let me show you as well what you're getting yeah. with um, alongside your masterclass. So, you will be getting Yvonne's amazing instructions. So, if you have any queries or if you, uh, you know, need your hand holding during this auction, uh, during using your shop plate then you can reference this it's, Absolutely. it's sent to yep. you completely for free yep. upon dispatch of your order as well so and likewise we are live if you're watching in the 12 o'clock hour um you can message in if you've got any questions that you'd like to put mm -hmm. to yvonne so how many i agree stars hearts suns most definitely yeah. in terms of symbols yeah massive meaning absolutely it's not it, they are not specific are they they're not they're not seaside they're not animals no. then they are general yeah so I agree. you could use them in anybody's jewelry now um how many do we have of these available 100 chances which is not actually as many as we'd hope because it's more limited than the other shop plates that we've brought okay away. i remember our shop plates been brought to air once recently and they fly and the price that yep. we bring had, them to airport yeah we've had two insane. others i think before this one have we yeah. 
the phone lines have lit up once again. Yeah, they're they so, so useful. And if you look at things like um, like the ring, it you get out a really chunky piece. Let me grab that. Yes. It's not like a solderable element that you get that's no, really flat. thin and flat. It's it's got um, it's got depth. Yeah, basically. absolutely. That's you can see the that best, there. better word. And they're just so lovely for soldering onto your jewellery. There you go. So you can create all of these amazing elements. Again, if you have any questions for yeah, Yvonne, do text in. We've got a hundred of these. So, and with, with the fact you might have noticed on the front of that shop plate is that we have our very yes, own logo. Yes, it's a tool. With the fact that we are now making our own tools, have you noticed we're making those tools far more accessible? Yep. Yeah. And it benefits us to do that as well, jewelry makers, because we want does. you to, you know, progress in your jewelry making. Yeah. Well, we are. We're moving on in in leaps and bounds, yes. aren't we? So, you know, us being able to produce the tools for you at a more affordable and achievable price tag works in both our favours. You know, I know that you can find shop plates elsewhere, elsewhere, and they're not inexpensive, are they? No, they're not. Uh, no, they're not. They're quite <laughs> expensive. There we go. So you can get one. And that's one pattern, by the way. Yeah. A large Celtic knot. It's not. It's cool. How much is it? Forty-five pounds. That's for one motif. Yeah. So you've actually got four on the one shot plate. And that one, it says uh, that a hydraulic press is required to form that design. Oh. Um, which we uh, we don't use the hydraulic press so um, we use a hammer to hammer ours in okay so you can literally use a hammer that's quite an intricate pattern though isn't it much more yeah. much more um a few years accessible. ago debbie bought uh, did bring to air a hydraulic a little hydraulic press uh, but we haven't seen it for a long I time i think i remember that yeah. i think i do yeah. remember that what about this one here Ooh, so where you can get lots of lovely on. little flowers this is nice that's very nice um, but there's only 10 left and it's in seven people's baskets look they say 136 pounds and 53 pence i love that in fact okay very nice the deal we bring you for the four yeah it's going to be absolutely amazing and again i love those earrings those earrings are gorgeous which ones the the suns. oh the little sunshines are gorgeous i love yeah, those studs. they are they're gorgeous absolutely look at that detail pretty, so pretty aren't they 30 second clock on your screen jewelry makers we had a hundred of these available your sun hearts and stars with downloadable instructions from our lovely yvonne in 24 seconds yeah you can get 145 pounds or you can get 12 for 136 or you can get our stars suns um sun stars and hearts what would you expect this to be around what 70 80 pounds well, oh, for starters, let's bypass that. Fifty pounds. <laughs> Fifty pounds only. This is the last of our shop plate collections, by the way, and I think the others have all sold out. Or oh, really? To, I think so. I didn't realise this was the last. Oh, they were one. very, very popular. Yeah, they I are. I don't know. If we, we, we might have new designs on the horizon. Yeah, we might. We might do. Yeah, but I, I just felt myself so lucky to get this like generic sort of patterns that will will fit for anybody really yeah. and do i have to be a silversmith to be a, or an established silversmith um not not really um as long as you you used to torch work i mean and we've all melted silver yeah. and uh, made balls out of it yeah. you basically do that pop the ball of silver in there and keep whacking it with the hammer until keep you've got a it. lovely <laughs> keep whacking basically it with like a cookie cutter <laughs> yeah. effectively we're at 49 pounds and 99 pence yeah they're expensive they elsewhere are expensive because are. you think about it these aren't disposable you'll no, have these indefinitely no, won't it you? is a big heavy piece of uh, it's a tool it's isn't steel, it yeah, yeah as well yeah you can go onto amazon and get what was that are they just circles? They can't even work that one out. Sixty-eight pounds and seventy-five. We're at forty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. 
You get the detail in the sun. You get lovely hearts and stars. Everybody loves hearts and stars. The phone lines have lit up. We've got 100. We aren't stopping at 49 pounds and 99 pence. We are going even lower, lovely jewelry makers. Um, again, any questions, do make sure you check out. We've got silver, but they're lovely, aren't they? Um, we've got silver wire as well for you to be we able have. to make yep. earrings like this. Absolutely, yep. The necklace earrings, yep. You can make Ray, all of these ring. pieces. And the ring, all made out of yep. silver wire. Yeah, That's simple. Are. Now, there are tons and tons <laughs> of you with it in your baskets. Oh, this is exciting. That's so good. <coughs> Excuse me. So good. £29.99. pence. So you can get one for £45 where you get one design. Or we found another shop plate for £130 something pounds. 36, there you go. That's for 12. That's, that's yeah. not bad. No, that's all right. That's good. I like that one. Yeah, lovely. Yeah. Still, what, £10 a design? You're getting yours for, what is it, eight? Seven pounds, seven pound fifty. Unbelievable jewelry makers, loads and loads and loads of you getting involved for your shop plate. And again, you know, keep it away from moisture. I would, yes. And uh, you can put a little bit of oil on it as well. A lot, of, I, I did with mine, put a little bit of light oil, like machine oil or three mm. in one. Um, well, I didn't get any that stick, but it stops them from sticking when you've hammered them in. Oh, perfect. Mm -hmm. And stops it rusting as well, I guess. Yes, yeah, absolutely. Um, water is not tools like this, friend. Non none of your tools in your workshop nope. but what, like, are a friend of water. No, so keep, do keep them away and it should last you an absolute lifetime, jewelry yeah. makers. We had 100. I'm loving that link as well. By the way, if you want to make this exact necklace, you can do so. Yep, you've got the in guidelines um, in advance instructions. And of course, you've got demonstrations coming your way as well. Well done, Fiona, Mary and Jerry, Manchester, Karen, Nora, Karen and John, Durham, Judith, uh, Maker, Anne, Patricia, Samantha, Jane, Sharon, Alison. Oh, gosh, there's loads of you there. Um, amazing. You it's a weighty bit one. of kit. Yeah, it is. It's a really nice tool. And as I say, the, the designs are second to none, I Love think. Love those earrings. Yeah. So, so, so cool. Um, it's a clock to close, jewellery makers. Of course, you've got your demonstrations coming up as well. Um, but it's actually not no. the end of all the goodies because unbelievable. We have a metre of one millimetre wire, which is what you're going to need to make these. Which When was the last time you saw one millimetre wire, silver wire? Oh, a long time ago. It's been ages. Yeah, well, it's a long time ago since I've had any. Yeah. I can't remember. Mm. That's true. Neary's just said also, all these uh, price comparisons that we showed us where, they don't come with instructions, which are free, that should be, we should be selling these for £10 as a minimum. Because you've got, Yvonne, that's quite a weighty one, isn't it? Yeah, I'm not sure how many. 34 steps. steps. Step by step instructions, knowledge within these pages that we send to you by f for free, with images and photographs. <laughs> I'm a visual learner as well. I don't, I, I kind of zone off if it's just words. I but do have to say, it's much easier to write the instructions with pictures as well because you can refer to the picture. Yeah, I bet. Yeah. I bet it is. And you've got that. You can print off. You can literally put it into a file or save it to your desktop, whatever you wish. Um, file it, yeah, whichever. And you've got that information there at your fingertips yep. whenever you want to reference it back. Um, that comes your way for free. But as we said, we've got more beautiful goodies to bring you, including... Um, when was the last time? That one millimetre wire. It's happening, jewellery makers. Is it literally this that you made these with? Um, uh, a lot of it is, yes. I made the coils. Um, the actual shot plate, I used my scrap silver. Uh -huh. Because I didn't want it. It's too, in my opinion, it's too nice to just melt down into balls. Yeah. But if you haven't got any scrap silver, it's this. you've got it there to use as well as or instead yeah, of. Yeah, it works in exactly yeah. the yeah. same way. In actual I mean, fact, I, this, yeah. would probably, this would probably ball down a lot quicker, wouldn't uh, it? Oh, yes, it would, definitely. Yeah. Right, so we're going to do it, jewellery makers. So to work with your shop plate, if you haven't got scrap silver, then we can bring you this. It will also do the shanks, the wires, the jump rings, all of the above. How many times? How many have we got? How many? We've got quantity. 
but I, I bet there's so many of our jewelry maker audience that are watching right now going, oh, you have been desperate for I, silver I didn't wire. No, we were selling it separately. I thought it came together. Are you ready? Good luck. It's a star buy and it's up next. Right, genuine question because we've just had this quick <laughs> yeah it's amazing what we can squeeze in between those short vts I, we're like when was the last time we had silver wire yeah. so we want to put the question to you when was the last time that you saw silver wire because i genuinely can't remember it's probably been years years 2022 that's the earliest that we can find on our computer system wow 2022 grief i wouldn't have thought that but it's a necessity for us all isn't it you know it's very easy to look at this and go oh yeah but actually if, if like somebody that's not necessarily a jewelry maker you might go yeah yeah, yeah. no that's like that's like like a silver bar yeah but much more workable yeah and this is your everyday if you use if you do silversmithing it's your everyday stuff that you, you use. need it yeah I think this will sell out, and then who knows when we see silver wire again. Have you got any of the other gauges? Okay. You can make, <laughs> sh you, look at that. You can make shanks. Yeah. You can ball it in the same way you can. to use the shop plates. Yeah, you can. But genuinely, our computer system tells us it's been two years. That's incredible. Since I can't we've had silver wire you? on our screens. Must be the one mill that we haven't had for, for yeah. that long. Because um, I think I've had other gauges. Have you? Since there then. we go. Yeah. Yvonne's helped us yeah. with the question. We, um, we had a filigree set not so long ago, and that right. had two different types of silver in it. Unbelievable. Okay. Now, with that, let's not forget as well, it is a rare, precious material. Mm -hmm. material. It's got a beautiful gram weight. Um, so you can so use useful the one mil. Yeah, is one mil ideal for shanks? Yes, absolutely. Um, I think I made mine out of um, one mil square wire, but mm -hmm. it's still one mil. Yeah, you could do that. You could do that. Use the actual shank itself. Mm -hmm. So we have um, we have quantity of these. My recommendation would wow. be to stock up your stashes, jewelry makers, and um, get it whilst you have the chance. Look at that, 4.1 grams yeah, of precious that. metal. It's easy to overlook that. You know, if, yeah, I was yeah. if I was sat here holding like a, a bar of silver, then we go, okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. Absolutely. A wire it, is it quite... Doesn't look, no. It doesn't look heavy. It's not heavy, is it? No, um, but it is four grams. And it is substantial. Yeah. yeah. But, and it goes a long way. Now, we're going to do something special. Four grams of silver. This will go wild, says uh, Neary, because the price point is absolutely amazing. So just to get the wheels in motion, usable sterling silver. You don't have to be a silversmith. You could weave with this if you wanted to. Yes, absolutely. <coughs> um, someone like Natalie, yeah. who does her wire weaving, um, she, she'd love that. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> sure. I bet Natalie's getting involved <laughs> yeah, on this. £79.99. pence. Not stopping there. Um, thank you for your trust, those jewellery makers that have already made their confirmations. Now, um, we're not stopping there, you know that. Under £50. Four grams, mind. You could do things like your talk bracelets with these. If you yeah, you could. And last time I was on, we had a fantastic um, wire twisting tool. Oh. Now, you could twist that and you could make a, a, a beautiful talk bracelet. Yeah, lovely. If you put several... Um, twists in several it. twists in it, several very several nice. strands. That's what I'm trying to say. No, I get that because you've got mm. you can see with it just literally looped Absolutely, together. Absolutely, yeah. There's a definite rigidity to yeah. it, and this hasn't even been worked yeah. work hardened yet. Now, um, already first person's bought two. Samantha's bought three. Yeah. You're not alone, by the way. London's multi bought baskets two, 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 three, four. Yeah, I'm not surprised. We are not stopping at forty nine ninety nine. You could use you. I mean, two years, and I don't know why. I honestly, if anybody asks the question, I don't know why. No, I don't know why either. To be honest, sometimes it just happens that way. Yeah. It's not like we'd have suddenly forgotten about one millimeter wire. 
You know, because we've had other gauges. And, and it's not a like a goes a long yeah, way. Yeah, that's true. It's not like a 30 centimetre no, strand. No. A metre goes an awful long way. Does it? Mm. Does, really does, yeah. Shall we hold? Shall we yeah, hold let's the Let's do it. End? We'll have to be careful not to. Don't ping it at you. No. <laughs> right, wait a minute. Oh, could just hang on. Sort of steady. <laughs> like a precious metal there slinky. Go. There we go. We can straighten that out. That's a lot of silver. That's an enormous amount, isn't it? It does go a long way. Yeah. Look at this trust that we have now, Yvonne. There. I <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. Uh, I mean, that, you, that's a lot of oh. rings that you can create. Seriously, four grams of sterling silver, twenty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence only. Um, yeah, I don't blame you, Durham, for getting yeah. four of these. I don't blame you, Samantha, for getting three of these as well. I mean, you I don't have to use it tomorrow. No, you don't have to use it next week. But it's nice to know it's there if you need it. Hasn't got shelf life. No, of course it hasn't. Hasn't no. got shelf life. No, no. And if it does sort of tarnish as silver does, then you can just yeah, literally give just it a polish. Polishing cloth. No bother whatsoever. Twenty nine ninety nine. Well done, Elsa, Shirley, Manchester's got three, Regine, Durham's got four, uh, Justine, Geraldine, Samantha, Sandra, Gloria, Rupal, Mary and Jerry, Kathy, loads of multi buyers, Tracy and Shirley, Maurice and Jean and Nora and Cumbria. Half the stock is already gone. That's how hungry you have been for one millimeter nine two five. Um what? <laughs> oh, We've got quantity. Have what's that? See you in 2026. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's scary. That is, because it'll probably be here before you know it. Get it now. That's the last time we brought one mil, mil one mil wire. That's what our computer system tells us anyway. Two year. No. Stock up. <laughs> because otherwise you're gonna have to pay sterling silver prices elsewhere, and I don't know what they are. If you can even get it. That's true. Not a 30 centimetre strand. It's a length of one metre. And we're going even lower. Stock up your sashes. And this doesn't have to have anything to do with the shop plate at all. No. Uh, as you said, wire weavers, all kinds. It, it'll obviously do for anything. Findings. Yeah. Yeah, I love I love this technique that you've done there to create this almost yeah, like... Yeah, I love those chains. Like that's much too... Bone. Uh, yeah, We're that's showing. two millimetre, that that one for the chain. Wow. They're going to sell out. So many people multi buying on this opportunity. Brilliant. 24.99 for, for, for four grams. So you can get four metres of solid sterling silver. Which, again, you know, that ha that's a precious metal. That's got value straight yeah, away. Yeah, of course it has. And, um, and then you once you're using that, you will end up getting bits that you, yeah. you you snip off and that's where you start getting your little pot full of your scrap and that's what I melted down to make the uh, for the shop plate yeah nothing is wasted nothing in the is wasted world of no silver and even if you do it and you do it wrong just melt it again yeah. and off you go again yeah absolutely I do that as well with broken jewelry it's a nice way of recycling it, is. Jewelry. it really is yeah just literally melt yeah. it down uh 24 pounds 99 pence hello to Robert Lillian Tracy Sandra Merseyside Gerda in Saltburn uh by the sea um Sandra's got two Tracy's got two Gerda has got two, Lucy's got two, Linda's got two, Mary and Jerry's got two, Cumbria's got two, and you disappear. That's one list. Wow. <laughs> um, you're about to make a third row. Um, you can still get involved. Um, Lincolnshire, Maker, Lynn, Marion, Angela, uh, Yorkshire, Helen, Susan. There's lots of twos and threes in baskets. We haven't got, sadly, an unlimited supply of the one mil wire. Um, we've got quantity. But there's also tons of you there. Now, whilst these are flying out the door, I'll keep you updated. We're going to dive into your wonderful demo. Don't forget the lovely little bumblebee that's coming up as well. Okay. Um, Yvonne, take it away. What are you going to show us? Okay. Well, I'm going to talk you through the shop plate, and then I'm going to show you how I made the the earrings and the dangly bits on lovely. the necklace. So, could I borrow your shop plate for now? Yes. And I will give it back. There you go. Thank you very much. So um, we've started you off. Um, as I said, I put a little bit of light oil 
in mine with just a piece of kitchen paper uh, before I started just to stop it sticking and it never did stick um, so as we said you the next thing I did was got my scrap silver or use a piece of your silver that out of out of your one meter if you wanted to uh, and you make your little ball we've we've done that many times haven't we um, so you get your little ball of silver and what you do is it's it's flat on the back where you've had it on your your soldering brick and what you do is you pop that in there and you can take either I've got um, masking tape here but you can take um, electrical tape parcel tape even salad tape I would have thought would do so any 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 type of tape so you you can pop that on there in fact I did mine crossways I I put two on just to make sure it holds it safe in in there like that and then and the reason I'm not going to hammer this <laughs> is because I actually I use this <laughs> oh okay uh, but you don't have to use one as heavy as that that's two and a half pound hammer it says on it that's a whopper that's a whopper um, so I'm not going to hammer on this um, delicate old desk here um, but that basically is it oh, yes we've you got can a glass use, top yeah we there. have so I don't want to go bashing on that but the thing is you can you don't need a special hammer you can get a hammer out of your shed out of your garage whatever you've got as long as it's got a bit of power behind it and then you just whack it so I'm going to take that out of there now once you've done that you might not you, you can take it out and you can have a look at it you might not have got the impression you actually like you might want hmm. so you can actually take it take your impression out and you can anneal it and you can pop it back in because it will find as you see that's that's just popped in there of its own accord and it will just find its own level and it in its safe so you can then cover it up with tape again and give it enough another whack in and um, you can do that as many times as you like till you get the impression you want Yvonne we've got a question from Deb oh. in Coventry saying okay. I am so excited to play <laughs> with the shop play that son was asking me to buy it what size roughly do these pieces come out at once they oh, are pressed we need something Shall to measure? measure yeah we need to measure that. hang on hang on a minute one second so in fact yeah let's, should we measure it on here or yeah 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 so the earrings if i do that does that help uh well, they're almost a centimeter aren't they across the middle work right, that way very nearly a centimeter very nearly across a centimeter. the centimeter there you go that, that's the sunshine is was it just the sunshine that um, yeah do you want to see the heart as well because yeah, you get two idea. different sizes I of the heart isn't that beautiful they're all about a centimetre. That yeah. is actually a puffy heart, isn't it? It's yeah. so pretty. And then probably, let's do this, the stars. Yeah, they're all about a Around about a centimetre. Yeah. So good question. I've not thought to mention that. Yeah. Um, there you go. Okay. So as I say, you can pop those back in, cover them up with tape once you've annealed them and, and go again until you get the impression you Hit want. Hit it. Hit it. Then, depending on how big or small your little ball of silver was, you could have a lot of excess round the edge. That excess you need to either cut off, saw off, and with mine, as you can see, I've filed it until it's got a nice um, hexagonal, is it, that one? Um, so the next thing I did, uh, so we, we can give L that back. We've finished with that okay. now. So that's that's basically how you you get you make your symbols out the shop plate and how you finish them off. So then what I did, so I can get rid get rid of that now. Now I've got to make um, the necklace and the dangly earrings. I actually used a one point two. Um, let me just find my um, my clippers. Mm -hmm. oh. there we go. Every time I twist this, here we go. I untwist it the other end. <laughs> <laughs> I just twist it one side. So uh, what I did to make uh, the earrings and the focal pieces of the necklace, 
I cut off, I'll do this by eye, but I think it was, it does say in here, it was either an inch or an inch and a half. So I'm, I'm just going to snip a bit off just for the, just for the demo. Now, what I, what I did for the, the chair, it, it's the same sort of system for the same way of making the chain as it is for making the earrings so and you've seen you will have seen me do this before let's bring that back i moved it too soon um what i make is these little little paddle little paddles on the edge of these well if i was doing this at home i would file that and make it a really really nice nice end but basically we're going to uh, hammering is it, hammering with this little hammer is enough am i all right doing this yeah so <laughs> there we go it's very so, satisfying so then we end up with that little paddle well, it's like a little, uh, an oar it is and if you were making the chain you would actually make that you would hold it that way and smooth out that way so you've actually got the little paddles facing in different directions that's yep. how the chain's made mm -hmm. um, but for the earrings and the necklace we actually stop at that point you would then take your file and you would make sure that's a nice shape just go around it make sure you've got a nice shape on there so the next thing we do and it's quite simple to make all these the difference between the necklace and the earrings now is the way they have finished off. So what we do here is we pop that upside down. Let's get some, what I've got here is solder paste. So show you here. So uh, pop a little bit of your solder paste onto the little paddle like that and then you need to prop this up um, now I have bought my third hand in here to um, obviously that's got to go face down on top there let's uh, see if we can oops let's see if we can do that okay so now you can either prop this up with pennies titanium strips I'm putting mine into my third hand and I'm going to I'm going to move it further to the end actually. There we go. Uh, all all the time and effort in this is is setting it up properly. The actual soldering doesn't take very long at all. So I'm I'm going to pop that on there. Uh, do you mind if I let's uh, do a bit of health and safety and get rid of the yeah paper. get rid of the pieces of paper <laughs> good idea it off a little bit so we're going to set this on fire now keep your heat on the solid piece at the end we want to make these exactly the same temperature now if we kept going up and making them trying to make them the same temperature that um, strip of wire there would melt so you want to get as much heat as you can into your symbol first and hopefully you'll see then you can go over to your wire start hitting it up and you will see it go oh there we yeah. go there we go so let's take a, let's take those out of there And there you go. It, ah. It's all. On. So then you'd straighten that out. Now to finish them off, um, the earrings I soldered a little tiny jump ring onto the end, mm -hmm. and then put a, uh, a shepherd's hook yes. inside. Uh, a shepherd's hook onto the jump ring, and with the necklace I curled them over, made them a loop, put coils in between, and threaded them onto another little curved piece which I put paddles on both ends and I uh, and I drilled at the end it's so that you could amazing. put a job ring in. So it is, if you can see, it's all basically done like this. Yeah. Uh, the one the one that we've just done. And it's just a matter of how you finish them off and how you assemble them really. But um, it, it, is, it isn't a complicated demo um, because 
I can't make it complicated. <laughs> you oh, you get your symbol out of the shop plates. There's a lot of tidying up to do. Don't get me wrong before you use those. Um, and and then you just. Plow ahead, you can do whatever design you want. But you'd look at each and every single one of these pieces and obviously it'd be like, like wow, there's no way I could make that. But well, then, but you can see how wow, easy it is. I love it, Yvonne, absolutely gorgeous. Now, and don't forget, you've got Yvonne's yep, instructions as well. Yeah, we can get them back out. Well. We can get them back uh, out. There's no now. fire now. <laughs> yeah, you've got Yvonne's instructions got. as well alongside your silver wire, equally yep. your shot plate too. Does, this come, does it come with the silver wire and the shot plate? So it comes with the shop plate. This comes with the shop plate, jewelry makers. Um, now you can still get hold of the one millimeter. Okay. We'll double check that. Um, you can still get hold of the one millimeter sterling silver wire, jewelry makers. Just about. We were look literally looking through the archives and said, "Goodness me, it's been two years, two years." And for that reason, we're going to ask for a minute clock. Yeah! Hello to you, Deb St. Yvonne. I love you. So inspiring. I can't wait to play. Oh, thank you so much, Deb. That's Aww. really kind of you. I'd love to see what you make. Oh, it's going to be beautiful. I, thought, I should have said, actually, but everybody will know this if they can do this, go this far. You obviously pick all this yeah, when you clean finish it all to up. clean it up. Yeah. Um, Yvonne? Yes? We haven't seen one mill wire for ages. No, we also, haven't. We think. We're using that excuse to go that little Not bit lower. Not going again. Yeah. But we've, so, but we've sold loads. Yeah, loads, 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 loads. And so every we don't need to go down No, we don't. <laughs> but every single one of those people that has already shopped ahead, everybody pays the final low price tag. Um, it is a metre, not a 30 centimetre length, which is not unusual, actually, for one mil wire. You've got a metre here, and we're, yeah, basically using the fact that we haven't seen it in absolutely ages as an excuse to take it to a crazy low price tag. Um, yeah, I mean, you use it for your silversmithing, you use it for your wire work, you use it for your everyday jewellery making as well. Absolutely. Um, it, it is your go-to. Yeah. You know, like you have go-to sizes in your beads. Yeah. It's, uh, one mil wire is an essential. Yeah, I agree. Twenty-one pounds and ninety-nine pence only for four grams of your solid sterling <laughs> silver. But again, make sure you are checking out everyone. So, Rupal, Gloria, Jan, Virginia, who's got two, Maker, Mar Sheila, Marion, Robert, Lillian, Tracy, who's got two, Margaret and Sandra, who's got two, Gerd, who's got two, Lucy and Bernadette and Linda and Merseyside. I can't keep up with you. Everybody Gosh, that has multi more, <laughs> um, yeah, you've got an additional saving <laughs> back into your pocket. Um, if your name is Maureen, Stella, Lincoln, Lynn, Yorkshire, Angela, Helen, Susan, Maurice, new customers, Murtha, Manchester, Gloucestershire, Neela, Linda, Stella, make sure you're checking out everyone because it's absolutely flying. Absolutely flying out the door. That's incredible. Fabulous. What a day it's been. It's hasn't been it? amazing. <laughs> Genuinely, after today, I feel like I need to go and have a little lie yeah, down. It's been a fabulous day. Oh, it's I'm been glad I then. came in today. Me it's too. Been, it's been a I feel like I need a little lie down. It's been absolutely fantastic. Wouldn't have missed it for anything. And a real variety as well. Hasn't yeah, it? it's been a right, yeah, across the board. Yeah. Yeah. Love it. Absolutely love it. Can you still get hold of the shop plate? Is it still available? Not sure. Just, you can still get hold of it. Clock to close on the wire. Because this, yeah, okay. There's some people going to have a fair old parcel when it arrives. I keep seeing yeah. the same names coming sure, up. Because well, this is quite weighty That's, as this, well, yeah, isn't it? The, shop, the yeah. shop plate itself. Um, clock to close. We've got hundreds of these, thank goodness. But that being said, hundreds of you getting involved as well. Um, so please don't leave it in baskets if you want to guarantee your success, especially as Jean's just got four, Nora's just got two, Virginia's just got two, Samantha's just got three, Suri's just got two. You get the idea. Um, and they're metre long lengths. I mean, you need what? An inch and a half, maybe, for a ring shank, depending yeah. on the ring size. Yeah, and look at those earrings. How much? Um, how much has the the dangly earrings taken? About three inches altogether. Yeah. For the for the two. I really love those earrings. I shouldn't say that, as I've made it, but I really Why do like you those. Say that? <laughs> you definitely give yourself the credit that yeah, you deserve. Amazing. Oh, Durham says at that price, I'll take eight. <gasps> 
Well done. <laughs> yeah, but you th oh, you also might be thinking it's been two years. I'm not going to. I'm not. I, I need, I'll need more before another two years time. So stock up your sashes. I don't blame you. Very savvy shopping. Um, okay, okay. Let's do a lowest ever price on the Dappin Dome. A Dappin Dome. That is just the cutest thing. Can I show it on, on yeah, your overhead? Yeah, of course you can. There just you go. because, thank you. It is a thing of beauty, isn't it's it? A, and you know, these very often come in great big, great big blocks. Yeah. Um, and this, I hadn't seen one like this before. And I put it down on my bench. I thought, this is so much handier to have around. My big one, it just takes up too much space. Yeah. So, so you tend to put it up on a shelf out of the way. And, um, and then you don't use it so much. But this is so handy. Now, you might be noticing the reason why I'm taking some of these out, you've also got the measurements just yeah. there. Um, and the measurements are also stamped on the... Oh, are they? The, here, look. Oh, they're actually on the on yeah. the actual. Yeah. What do we call these? Ma well, they they're dapping uh, punches. Yeah. Right. But uh, that's what you call them. I use them as mandrels as well uh -huh. because they've all got um, a ring mandrel is very useful for what it what it says on the tin, but it's um, tapered. Yeah. Uh, I use these as mandrels a lot, particularly because it's, they've got the size on, particularly, they're, they're just so handy to have on your bench and um, you, uh, and can I, can I take this out and show yeah. you? Yeah, I was going to say, this, should we take it out? Yeah, we can take it, here a bit. but that, that's for, for using with these. If you take that out, you've got a lovely little, oh, yeah. uh, a, a lovely little steel block as well so it it is oh, it's solid wood it's many things let's, let's, let's yeah. do this i'm just going to pick it up for a second yeah. michael and i'm going to bring it over because i can lean it forward then okay and there's the little the little, there's the little block lovely. which is lovely and it all fits beautifully together we're going to do it at the lowest ever price do you know if you go to workshops and yeah. you want to take, oh, you don't want to take a great big hefty no, thing with heavy. it. You can stick that in your bag. I didn't know I was carrying it this morning. It's lovely. It's really, Amazing. it's a really handy little duffing block. Oh, so you did little concave did, shapes like this? Yeah, that's what you made. I made that necklace. And the pink, the little pink earrings at the end, I, I used, I used the little domes to, to make um, bead caps. Wow! Oh yes, yes, so I made bead caps with them. No way! Lowest ever price jewelry makers to get I mean, hold of this twelve uh, cavity dapping block with the twelve punches as well in the stand. What? We're going lower? No, surely not. No, surely not. <laughs> are you kidding? Are, you, are we doing clearance or something? Is there a reason <laughs> for this? Oh, we've only got 40, okay. And believe it or not, I yeah. know they're kind of, you know, quite convenient in terms of their size for us. However, they're still taking up quite a big space in our oh, warehouse. in the web storage yeah, space. Yeah, yeah. So we've got 40, we're going to do yeah. a lowest ever price. And believe it or not, it's not 19.99. 30 second clock, we're going to go crazy. So if you, take, if you take that to your workshop with you, yeah. you've got mandrels. Yeah. You've got a dapping block. Mm -hmm. You've got a steel block. You've got your dapping punches, and it just does so much. If you don't know how to use it as well, look back on YouTube. Um, Yvonne, you've demoed these, haven't you, before? I have, I know Claire yeah. Has as yeah, well. we, we all have. I mean, I can do you a quick demo if you want, but so it depends on, on time. Uh, but yeah, you see those, I, I just cut out discs with my disc cutter. Yeah. Um, put oh, them, yeah. yeah, put them in the dapping block and uh, made half circles with them Just and soldered them together beautiful oh my goodness me seriously that, that solid wood look at the green seriously solid that, wood. that is a bargain it is surely the surely the block itself should yeah. be more than that yeah you see you can take that with you you've got your dapping block you've got your steel block you haven't got to take this great big this great no. big thing with you to your workshops um, it's just so useful. It's portable, go. it's handy. 
And it's also really satisfying. Mm. That is the lowest ever price tag, jewellery makers. Make sure you're checking out your baskets to get yours. And it, you know, I can't believe that's £15. I really can't. No, it is a clearance deal, though. That's why. Yeah, that's a good point. Flip it over. you got your steel block there. Yeah. So we can use this. So is, would it be like metalsmiths, obviously, like your copper sheets, your silver sheets and things like that? Uh, because they're mandrels, you can use it. You could use it for polymer clay. You could use mm -hmm. it for metal clay. Yeah. Um, people doing wire weaving, I'm sure, would um, would be able to use the mandrels. Um, the coils I made on my necklace between the symbols yeah. from the shop play. Um, using yeah, these? Yes, I did wow. it wrong then. Yeah. We only had 40, though. Keep on dialing through, everybody. Congratulations. Amazing, Lovely. amazing. I love that. Have I got what? Some pliers, yeah. Ooh. Ooh, I didn't get those. <laughs> didn't get she new says, pliers. She says jealously. <laughs> yeah, where's Yvonne's pliers, please? <laughs> Yvonne needs some pliers. <laughs> Last of stock opportunity, these are your wait. They're round nose, chain nose, oh, and side are. cutters. I thought and by the way, be careful. Because I I did just Wait, there's the little cutty bit there. Can you see? There you go. Off I go. Just take a bit off the end of the wire. Yeah. There Can you, you see go. the cutty bit? Ready? Have I done that? Watch your eyes, yeah. I'm I'm doing this at arm's length. Yeah. Hang on. I I hang on, I'm not can I bring it closer to me a second? Because I'm not sure I'm doing that right. It's very hard to tell at arm's length. I don't know. Let's have a look. Hang on. I love the round nose bit at the top. Should we have a go? Yeah. See if it's me. I might be doing that not, wrong. Not necessarily. I might be doing it wrong. Oh my goodness, there's loads of there anyway. Ah, oh, six left. Well done. Don't well know. done, well done, well done, well done. Not actually sure which bit you use for cutting. To, I think that's at, our problem. Look at the packaging. Yeah. <laughs> I haven't got my glasses on either. Um, okay. Start by opportunity coming your way. All things beautiful Alhambra, lovely jewelry makers. And this is something that you won't find in Van Cleef and Arbels. Um, this is specially commissioned exclusively for you here at Jewelry Maker. Um, Alhambra inspired, but in Baltic Amber. Okay, yeah, yeah, now, um, I've got 10 minutes to bring you this opportunity. Beautiful, beautiful amber that is, uh, we believe anyway, exclusive to us here at Jewelry Maker. So you've, you've met my lovely Marius, um, who supplies all of our beautiful amber. But have you noticed we don't do amber days anymore? We don't do amber weekends anymore because it's actually much diff more difficult to get hold of. Wait until you see this piece of jewelry. It's absolutely breathtaking. And I know um, only a handful of people um, in the world will actually be able to say that they own it. Um, there's a big amount of sterling silver. Each and every single one of those beautiful four leaf clovers are Baltic amber. Now, so where does this idea come from? Well, you've probably recognized it. You've probably recognized, seen versions of it that are everywhere at the moment. Yeah. Um, it actually stems back from one of the biggest jewelry houses in the world, the Maison, that is Van Cleef and Arpels. And just a little sketch like this, I can show you. That's one of the original sketches, the original ideas of the four leaf clover. And that is because Jack Sarpel um, abs oh, absolutely, um, sorry, Jack Sarpel, it's because gets moved around. Um, Jack Sarpel, who is the nephew of the original founders, um, basically used to go into his back garden and pick four-leaf clovers. Did he? Yes, and uh, used to gift them to the employees of Van Cleef and Arpels oh, the um, with the British poem, Don't Quit. There it is. He said, to be, to be lucky, you must believe in luck. 
um, as Jack Sarpel, nephew of Estelle Arpels, like to say, an avid collector, he would pick four leaf clovers in the backyard of his house, offering them to his employees alongside that poem. Isn't that That's saying don't quit. Don't quit. Oh, I love that it. Lovely. Um, but again, um, 1968, the Maison created the first ever Alhambra. Um, it was a long line necklace composed of 20 clover shapes, motifs created with uh, creased yellow gold and trimmed with gold beads. The symbolic design achieved immediate success, recognized throughout the world as a token of luck. Um, emblematic of Van Cleef and Arpels. And it hasn't really changed. You know, I'm gonna kind of flip forward somewhat now because um, if you actually go to their website, um, you can see pieces just like this. This is off their website literally a couple of months ago. Um, they tell you the history of it and you can see the, uh, the Alhambra design. It's a simple four-leaf clover. Every single piece is crafted by hand though, literally done by hand with the finest components. Here's a vintage Alhambra. It says vintage, They're still that's literally brand new. That's what they call it though, the vintage. Um, with gemstones like Euronix. Um, this was actually our first dibs where they started using the magic Alhambra wow. where you have the, the the selection of your motifs look at the price tag on it by the way sold for 13,750 pounds um, at auction now again and um, they're often doing sort of different versions um, again like this you can see that's got the hearts the the flowers there's another one at first dibs this is magic alhambra um, moving on here we go classic four leaf 2590 pounds if you want the earrings you're talking 3800 pounds and so on and so on they're all around that price tag if you want the long line necklace you're talking tens of thousands of pounds now we propositioned our lovely Marius some time ago. I think it was Wayne, was it you, Wayne? It was indeed. And you said, uh, any chance you could do like an Alhambra inspired Baltic Amber beautiful necklace? Like, and um, was it an easy exchange or was it, no? Do you have to persuade him? Back and forth on designs because you wanted it to be sort of perfect. <laughs> He's it, done it an outstanding job. Look, the, can, I, can I just show you for a second? I'm going to take this off the bus for a minute. Look at the quality and bear in mind that these are all creased. First, you've got a carve amber, which naturally burns. It naturally burns. It's, it's a, a resin. You put a hot needle into it. Yeah. It? yeah. So it's very difficult to carve. But look at the quality of each motif. I love that. The, like the granulation effect around the outside as well. It's lovely, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's amazing. I I know that this goes to an amazing price because I have brought this to wear before. But um, the other thing I want to mention, if I was sat here, it was eight o'clock in the morning, this was your early bird, and I was to say, oh, I've got a lovely Baltic Amber connector, and I was to bring this to you on its own. How much do you think it would be? Mm, a lot yeah it's going to be I an investment I wouldn't like to guess to be honest but it would be a lot hello Caroline hi lovelies I have that amber um, high low and the 18 inch Alhambra style and every time I wear it either of them I ask if um, I'm asked if they're real yeah I mean you could say it's even more exciting than that actually this is exclusive there is only how many of these were ever commissioned yeah Hundred of these it. ever commissioned in the uh, world. That's one of the nicest ones I've seen. I agree. We've got how many available for you today? Twelve. This is the last opportunity. Uh, Wayno, what's the likelihood of us making this again? Oh, no, 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 no. Nil. Says, no, 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 <laughs> no, 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 no. Um, unbelievable. £199. You've got a huge gram weight of your precious metal. And in total, how many motifs is that? Let me just count, count, uh, count them for you. So, two, four, six, eight, ten. Ten sterling silver Baltic amber motifs. That's working out at what? £20 each, not even including that beautiful chain, which is it's substantial in its right. Crazy news though, jewellery makers, is we do not even close here. Thank you, Caroline, for texting in. 30 second clock is our finale auction. We want to say congratulations to the to every single one of you for the final 12. 
you know, whatever age as well, whether you're talking yeah. to a teenager, whether you're talking to, I bet you, Wayne, you've got a teenage daughter, haven't you? Bet she loves Van Cleef and Arpels mm -hmm. Alhambra. Bet your wife does too, doesn't she? Yeah. Do you know what that would be nice for? Today is A-level results. The four leaf clover for, some, for some, a young lady who's done really well in her A-levels. Yes. Wouldn't that be a beautiful gift? It would be absolutely amazing, jewellery makers. Um, Neary says, I've checked this price three times. I almost can't believe that it goes this low. Um, feel the gram weight that's invested and it will all be solid silver. 12 grams worth because amber weighs next to nothing. Next to nothing. So it's all that beautiful and detailing. And we all know anything that comes from Marius is top quality. Top isn't quality, it? yeah. Premium, premium grade. Yeah. Um, I only have 12 available opportunities, so make sure you are checking out your basket. It's got a little it's got a little extender chain on the back too. Yes, shall I show that? Show that. So if you wanted to wear it a little bit longer, then you absolutely yep. can. Um, wow. Hang I on love, a second. I really love that. Nine ninety nine ninety nine divided by how many motifs did we say? Ten. Ten. So you're talking about a tenner per motif? Yeah. And there's twelve grams of silver. That's mad. That's actually mad. Yeah, you could. You could. You could cut these up and literally like make yeah. lots of the mini alhambras, yeah. which has just got the one on there. Yeah. Can we show a few celebs? Shall we? Because if you flick forward, there's loads of celebs wearing alhambras. Um, yeah, we've only got a couple of minutes left, so we'll literally flick through these. Uh, there you go, there you go. So you've got Romy Schneider, Francois Hardy, Her Royal Highness, oh, of course, Princess, Princess Grace, uh, related to Princess Grace, of course, oh, our princess oh, as well. Princess. And there she is again. She's a big fan of this. She wears it on quite a few she different occasions. She wears it occasions. a lot, she? does, she? yeah. Looks absolutely gorgeous in her al Alhambra. You've got Queen Camilla. There's Queen Camilla again in a, a, oh, with a bracelet. bracelet. Yeah. Borrowing Kate's earrings. Uh, <laughs> Queen of Pop. Mariah Carey. Naomi Watts. Adele. Adele. Reese with, with a spoon. Uh, Molly May and Amanda Holton. <laughs> it's like, like a game, this, isn't it? Blake Lively. Catherine Zeta Jones. Jones yeah. Alex. I can't Scott. remember Scott, Scott, yeah. And there she is again, Amanda Holden, looking hers. And you've got the whole family <laughs> just decked out in Alhambra. <laughs> amazing, amazing price tag there. Well done. She's a rapper, I think. I think he is as well. Um, amazing. Coming up on tomorrow's show, you have got, um, I'm going to be joined uh, by, I guess, designer Ellie. You've got rectangle, uh, sorry, rectangle, where did that come from? Natural plum blossom tourmaline <laughs> rectangles, that's where it was. Um, Aurora shimmer in your kits. You've got two tone collections in your deal of the day, which is going to be amazing. Um, 11 o'clock is all about your amazing high luster Akoya Baroque pills. They're beautiful too. 12 o'clock is about your midnight panther masterclass. Loving it. More big Excellent. cats. Um, we'd love to have you here. Oh, it's been lovely. So Thank much. you for having me. I've loved it. When are you back with us? Do I'm you know? back on the 4th of September with something brand new. Ooh, a brand new premiere opportunity. Yes. Do uh, make sure you tune in tomorrow morning. I'll see you bright and early at eight o'clock. But enjoy the sunshine and Bye. the rest of your day, lovely jewelry makers. Take care. Bye.